All right, uh, yo, what's poppin'? Ah, uh, sorry, I'm stretching. Uh, welcome aboard, all you lads, last and non-binary buccaneers. Welcome back to another Onyak and such stream. As you may have guessed, today is the time we go and continue our legendary campaign in In Stars and Time. Are so fucking back. Uh. Anyway. Um. I don't know how to start this other than, uh. Welcome back. We are going to, uh. We're gonna do a little bit of a, a classic today. I'm like saying words out of my mouth, but, um. What's up, chat? Uh. Let me just readjust all my stuff really quickly. Uh, get some desktop audio going. There you go. Uh, how I discover you through music. Want to know, know funny? What's funny? What is what is so comedic? What is so comedic and awesome? I forgot what I was supposed to do. Oh, that's... That's, that's a horrifying thought. Alright, so... Chat... Oh, thank you, Luna. Uh, anyway, so, fuck, I literally forgot what we did last time, except for, like, so, I know we started Act 3, um, we basically beat the fucking game, guys, totally beat the game, definitely beat the game, 100% beat the game, we definitely beat the game, and we're moving on now <laughs> to the next stage of the game, totally, this is post-game, definitely, totally not Act 3 of, like, 6, anyway, so I totally forgot what Loop wanted me to do. It's been a whole fucking week, and I, like, or I guess what Loop wanted me to do? I guess what Sifrin wanted to do. Then Loop was like, oh, yes, darling, you should do that. Talk to Mira? Good idea. That was not intentional. Mirabel is here, sitting on a bench and looking on papers. She wanted to talk to you, didn't she? Oh, Sifrin! Um, sorry to bother you while you're so busy, but I really wanted to make sure you were okay. You... Tell me if anything was wrong, right? Where is this coming from? <laughs> There's channel rewards? I have channel rewards? Wait. Oh, shit, I didn't set that shit up. Ah, uh, Oops! Oh, well. What are the default ones? <laughs> Wait, no, I'm curious. What the fuck's the default ones? Oh, what the shit? <laughs> Modify a single emo. Oops. Um, forget those are there, I guess. I, I don't know what these are. <laughs> really? I don't know what the point of highlighting a message is, because I'll see it. <laughs> I, I don't have, like, streams of chat messages. <laughs> anyway. 
Of course I tell you. Sifrin, I... I'm... I'm not sure you're telling me the truth here. I don't want to force you or anything to... I, I don't force you to... Yes, I can read your message, Luna. Holy shit. By the way, I saw that tweet about that Fortnite wolfman. What is wrong with you? <laughs> I don't want to force you to do anything, but you have to know I want you to be happy. And I know this is a stressful moment for all of us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but the only way we can get through this is if we talk to each other. If we share our worries. So, um, I guess what I'm trying to say is, if you need help with anything, if you need help with anything, I'm, I'm here for you. Hmm. Okay, weird. Why is she telling you this? Ah, you know why she's asking you this. Poor Mirabelle, can't, poor Mirabelle can't say it, so you'll have to do it for her. Clearly what's happening is, do you need help with something? <laughs> Sifrin. Huh? 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 No! That's not why I- ah! Mirabelle irked at you. <laughs> such an oblivious person sometimes. Anyway, I... And she sighed and, she, and called you names? Who is this? Don't need help. Not at all. Okay, now that's a lie. Not even with those papers of yours? Oh, God. <laughs> you poke the papers to make your point. Hi, Pastel. Huh? No! Not at all! Do not look at the papers! The papers are irrelevant! Do not look at them, Sifrin! I see you looking at them! You arch an eyebrow, smiling. Ugh! Alright, yes, the papers are giving me a lot of trouble and I hate them! But I'm only looking at them now to get worried at something, other than, um, tomorrow? They aren't that big of a deal. If I have to be worried, I'd rather be worried about the thing that won't kill me. There's even more in my dorm room, in the house. The stupid papers have been following me since uh, before the King stuff even started. What? Oh, hi, Mari. There's more in a dorm room? One on floor three? So, if we're done talking about my papers... Hold on, let me just take a swig. Oh, goodness gracious. If there's... Nothing I can do for you, uh, Sifrin? No, I'm good. I'll see you later, then. Sounds like you could help Mirabelle with her problems a bit if you went snooping. Oh boy, if she needs help, maybe everyone uh, if she needs help, maybe everyone else does too. You should ask everyone see if they can help with it, if you can help with anything. So this is what we're doing different, chat. This is what we call the re-zero experience. Because uh Oh boy, I sure hope Act 3 doesn't fucking kill me. Hi again, Sif. Uh, you look like you were in a hurry earlier, so I left you alone, but... Is, is everything okay? Smile and nod. Sure, I believe you. What's up? Can I help you with anything? Do I need help with anything? Um... Well... Maybe kind of, but... Mm. I love eating lead. Lead. I love eating lead. You guys are watching a movie? Why the fuck are you both in my stream? <laughs> oh my god, you don't have to watch my- Well, okay, leave it out in the background and mute it if you have to. I like the viewership, but <laughs> you're watching a movie. Hmm. Serious, does he have a big problem in himself? With Chat. Chat to Sifrin, no. Oh, Dune 2021? I had a classmate telling me to watch Dune. I was like, yeah, I just could never get into it because of the huge celebrity cast. And I was like, that sounds intimidating. Anyway, uh, like, because I, I don't know, especially because there's Marvel actors, and it's like, dude, I can't trust them to do shit. <laughs> anyway. Truth, truth. Bro does not know. I don't. Uh, yeah, Sifrin doesn't know. First clueless. <laughs> you steal yourself. Okay, well, I'd rather you ask everyone else if they need help first. Mine might take some time. Huh? Task is so long, it might take a long time. This must be really important to him. Not seriously. <laughs> so serious. So, um, yeah. Uh, make sure to help everyone and do whatever you need to first. Okay, let me know if you need anything, okay? Cat. Cat. He's so fruity, fruity, gay, wacky doo-doo. 
so fruity, funky, silly with it. So this is your deal. Oh, Sifrin. You look rested. Glad to see you this late back on the day before the end of the world. Anyway, how can I help you? Do I need help with anything? Are you this bored, Sifrin? Odiel seems to realize you're genuinely asking. Ah, well. Uh... <laughs> Looking for a certain type of book. Type of book? Not a specific book? No, not a specific book. It's... It's a type of book called a family tale. Have you heard of those? Oh, what is it? It's a book filled with tales written by a single family through generations. It's a tradition in Vargard. I... I've always wanted to read one. But since each family has theirs, and it's something you're supposed to keep in one family and not show others, I was never able to touch, let alone read one. But I've heard that when, family, when a family dies off, the family tale might be taken by houses as a way to save those pieces of history. Huh? You didn't know that. And so? So you like a family tale of a family that died off? Yes. Huh. I don't know if she was interested in that. <laughs> family tellology. <laughs> of a sort. Oh! <laughs> so, will you help me? Of course. Thank you, Sifrin. Huh. Okay. I was planning to look in Dormant's library, but I have to buy some supplies. And I want to look inside Dormant's house, but who knows if we'll have time to search, so... Oh, so that's why she was so intently looking at books. She wants a family tale. Oh, Odil. How do I remember that? Oh my god, whatever. Hmm. Okay, I'll see you at the clock tower later, then. The power of Odil. Yes, she is quite a lovely, magical soul, is she not? Such a foreboding presence. Library. Let's look for some books about family tale. I don't care about craft. Something tells me it's not here. Something tells me the family tale is in the house. What is up? Uh, what is up, hero? Lay it on me, brother. Carbon expressions. There's an old book stuffed between the shelf and the wall. Get a book out again. You can get the silly now. What is the silly? Run, child, run. The unrestrained. Cursing of Chateau Castle, 16, 12, and 24. 24? Remember this number. Remember this, catch your eye. What is the silly? I'll check the silver coin. Silver coin. Oh no, chat. Oh, hey, silver coin. Grip the coin tightly between your fingers. Repeatedly check the silver coin. Oh, goody. Good to see you, buddy. Oh. I've been waiting to see that one. <laughs> they, holy shit. Thank you for the sub. Holy fuck. Gifting two subs to Mari and Game Boy. Let's go. Thank you, Beaminator23. Holy shit. I've been waiting to see that <laughs> notification for actual for an actual year. I've had that sitting for an actual year. Holy shit. <laughs> Luffy, it's good to see you, buddy. Save it, Luffy! <laughs> oh, I love that clip so much. Holy shit. Thank you. Thank you for the subs. We got two of 25. Oh, shit. Wait, three away from actually having to do another loop. Roll the coin around your pocket. This is concerning. I missed a thing? What happened? I was laughing. I was... Wait, what? Oh! Oh, the incident. Now that's fascinating. Remember the incident. Also, he was gripping the coin in his hand. Oh wait, hey look, there's Sifrin there. I forgot I put him in my setup. Hello, Sifrin. Bonnie's here, looking morosely at the fields. 
Ifrit. What? <laughs> Can I help you with anything? Help me? Uh, but I don't want your help. I don't want you to help me with anything! <laughs> ah, you're still hated, huh? Don't? I don't! You're stupid and you don't know me! So I don't want you to help me! I don't know you. You really don't! Not even a little bit! You don't even know my three favorite foods, stupid! Ah, you're right, that's a crime. Yes, it is! Wait, you're making fun of me! See, that's also why! Why I don't want to talk to you! Just go away! So mean. The money looks sad still. Okay, this is silly. But what if you could prove you do know their favorite food? Chat, that makes me upset. Wizard loving kid. Frog spell. <laughs> Did you make me a frog? Hey! Not cool! Frogs are. Oh! Frogs are so cute! They are? Thank you, kind wizard, for making me a frog. Hell yeah, chat, we did it. Don't you love going back in time and getting people into relationships? I like the I like this dialogue sequence. This is a good dialogue sequence. I just realized the word subscriber might actually be longer than follower. Let me fix this really quickly. I didn't even think about that. Uh, ba, ba. Wait, that's not the right one. Oops. Please hold while I figure out which one this is. There we are. It's good to see you, buddy. Oh, fuck. Thank you for the sub, Sue. We're three out of five. We're getting close to the downfall of man. Let me just, uh... I'm, I'm doing some impromptu stream setup uh, really quickly. Just get, give, please hold. We're gonna move. Oh, there we go. Uh, uh, Sifrin goes there. What's good? We are vibing. We are vibing. Draw me something I can take. We are in the middle of Act 3. I've emotionally recovered from last week. No sub badges, what the fuck is the point? Unsubbed? I literally forgot- Listen, I've been so busy. If I had time to set up anything, I would have. But I genuinely forgot. I've only been streaming for at most, like... Uh... Is this a founder badge? Oh shit, that's based. Where's I going? I was going to Issa. My mouse is in the middle of the screen. Get the fuck out of your mouse. You missed it, uh, Suv. So Mari and Luna were both here earlier, and instead of watching a movie, they were on, like, a date watching. They were, like, commenting in my stream chat for some fucking reason. Oh, shit, we're 93% of the way to a hype train? That'd be crazy. <laughs> Hi again, Sif! What's up? Help you anything? Oh, you haven't helped everyone yet, right? I'd rather wait until you're done! <laughs> okay, oh, fuck. In the same loop? In the same loop? All right, chat. Do I move forward? What do I do again? Chat, guide me. Move forward. Okay. Wait. Yes, isn't you're in that server? Oh, wait. Who the fuck is on Discord? What? Not Discord. This is Twitter. Oh, right. I was like, right when I went live. This is so upsetting to me, by the way. There's like, I don't know. There's like Ray merch or some shit. Uh, which, if you guys don't know, Ray Zipsons. Uh, he's a based artist who drew my fucking like. See this PNG tuber? He drew that. I'm like, there's a thing. There's like merchandise and I don't get to see it yet because I, I, I started stream right as I saw it. Anyway, so move forward, right, chat? Chat, do I go forward? Even though you don't have to go talk to Luke. Talk to Luke? We'll go to Luke. Anyway, Ray is very cool. He's a friend of mine and I think he's awesome. And, uh, I don't know what the whole- If someone could tell me what it is so I can go watch it later. Or, should we- Should we improv to react to it, chat? Nah, you guys came to Friend Stars in time. I'll watch it after the stream's done. Or, I'll see what it is, I guess. I don't know, I saw something saying there was, like, a video or some shit. I haven't seen it yet, but, like... I was gonna say, should we do an improv to reaction? But I figured we should, like, um... We should just- We should play the game, right? 
Hey, Stardust. How can I how can I help you on this wonderful new loop? Side note, I remember like months ago, or like when we started in Stars in Time, like uh, Pastel said or something like, um, "Hey, you should like as a joke like you should do a group stream so I can voice this character." And now I can't unhear his voice like on this character, and that's really weird. But it's also like I don't know. Does that make sense? Anyway, <laughs> what should I do next? You're doing so many different things. What do you need help with? You need help on how to help everyone. Which one, Stardust? Which ally? Uh, oh. So your housemate is hiding something. Some papers. Genocide loop. <laughs> Lol. She implied at the time that she has more of this paper somewhere in her dorm. Maybe you should go take and take a look. Be careful though. She might be watching you closely since that's her room. What's your kin assignment chart? Uh I'm checking Discord really quickly to remind me what your profile picture is. But I can't say that out loud because then they'll figure it out. Sifrin. Definitely, yes. <laughs> <laughs> you might have to be sneaky about it. Uh, oh, we'll get the Isabel last because that's the one I value the most. <laughs> the ah, the researcher. She's looking for a sort of book called a family tale, huh? Interesting. I've never heard of those. Maybe the librarian in Dormont might know something. Them, huh? You need to prove to them that you know their favorite foods. How childish. Don't take don't you take snack breaks every so often? Well, goodbye, hub train. Salute chat. Salute and chat for the hub train. <laughs> so often in the house. You should pick some different snacks every so often. Instead of going for your favorites. You might find out something new. Or you can brute force it and talk to them until you get it right. That's what looping is for, after all. Come on then. Go on go and find out <laughs> their favorite foods. That's a good, that's a good expression. <laughs> a bow. You guys, are, you guys want me to kin assign you all? Are you serious? Uh, Achilles, you can be, um, probably Isabo because he's gay. Yeah, that's probably my best answer. <laughs> Him, huh? Your fighter apparently wants you to help everyone else first. Scary. Don't you think he's asking you to finish helping everyone first because he wants to ask you something really complicated? That's what you're thinking. Well, only thing you can do now is he uh, help every is helping everyone else start us. Don't read that. Well, I just did. What? Wait, what's happening in chat? Are you guys getting kid assigned? Wait, I'm so, I'm so lost. <laughs> I just need help in general. Same. Okay, well. You should try and see if anyone else, uh, anyone needs your help. Nothing more to it than that. Let me know if you need help on how to help a specific one. Oh, excuse me. Any other questions you need help on how to? Find more about the king. What should I do now? Well, I think it's a stupid idea, but you should go talk to the king. Sounds like you have some questions to ask. You don't agree? He's a giant monster who might be related to the reason why you're trapped in time. I would never have anything to say to him. But you do, so have fun! A refresher? Sure. I can zone out? Okay, cool. Find out more about the loops. About the loops. What do I do now? Find out more about the loops. You could try and talk to the king, couldn't you? You and the king seem to share some kind of control over time. It might be worth it to ask him questions about it. And you wanted to go and talk to the head housemaiden too, so you could go to the king and talk to him. And beat him. Uh, and beat him to talk to the head housemaiden. Any other questions? What do you need? 
again, Isabeau. <laughs> ah, the thing he said he'd tell you at the end of your journey. He mentions he wants to tell you something. You go, st uh, go and sleep at the clock tower. That's probably it. But someone interrupted him just as he was about to tell you. How unfortunate. <laughs> if only there was a way to make sure he wouldn't be interrupted. Maybe you'd finally get to hear what he has to say. Talk to Bonnie beforehand, maybe. I feel like I've done all these already. Am I crazy? Anyway, we'll move forward. I can keep talking to Loop all I want, but, uh... We must progress, chat. Apparently, Act 3 is a long-ass one. It's a- it's a long-ass- it's a long-ass act. Long-ass. Long-ass. Long- Long-ass. Long- Long-ass. Ass arc. Fuck, chat. If we're gonna be here for two streams, I might not make it to the end of the week. It is spring break for me, so I might do more impromptu streams. Who knows? Sifrin, you're here! We were waiting for you! Let's go inside! I can skip through it all now! Uh, Wait, should I not be paying attention to what is his favorite? Man, you liked it? I mean, of course it was delicious. I'm a master cookie, you know. Chef. I'm a chef cooker. Damn, I thought I would hear something new. You would hear anyway. Oh. This is good. Let't do it in there. You have no other choice after all. Oh, Sifrin. That was, that was kind of a backhanded comment to say. That. I don't have anything to tell you right now. Check in. <laughs> Joy Curb's reaction? Oh no. It makes sense. It's it is the Why is Sifrin so Sifrin, stop being such a little a little baby. chat the definition of insanity <laughs> awaken big door in the wall you wonder if you'll be able to sleep tonight all right chat Okay, let's try to remember here. So what am I looking for? I'm looking for a book in a library. Bonnie's favorite foods and papers on floor three. What floor is the library on again? That's floor two, right? Yes. No. I already floor two. Comprende. Is it too late to kill myself? Is it too late to off myself and move forward? That is not something I should be saying. Holy shit. <laughs> ah, ah. What's the funny? There's a funny? A lot of XP's. Not level 54. Awesome. Why is Sifrin a little angrier than usual? Notice that? Whoa, what the fuck? Yo, 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 those icons are... Hold on. Those those pictures are a little different from the last time I was here. That That's a little... That's a little di- That's a... Um... Wait, I still have all these? Fuck. Oh my god, I completely blanked. What the fuck am I doing? <laughs> Shit, dude. <laughs> uh, punch. The fuck? Oh my god, level 700. Didn't like being looped back after the king, just saying they think they're stuck. Yay! What? Hi, Aki. Welcome. I'm playing In Stars and Time. This game is... 
traumatizing. <laughs> so, so he he's hollow now. He's just like me for real. Look at him. Happy. Now angry. Grr. Anger. Uh, make up for time, baby. Let's go. Monster attacks first. Owie. Da -da -da. I, yeah, I do think it's traumatizing now. What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? Why do you all hate me? <laughs> well, I understand what you all vague post about eventually. Is this the death room? Am I in the death room yet? Act three. You would thought I was somewhere way later. Ugh, scary. Scary. Don't like. Don't like. Don't like. He's very scared. <laughs> I'm freaking out. I'll be good. I understand, child. I understand you want the bottles. I understand you want the bottles, small child. There's no point in grabbing this stupid thing anymore because I know it doesn't do anything. Fuck you, stupid fake-ass necklace. How dare you bait me? How dare you think you were gonna give me a cool item? How dare you make me think that? How dare you? How dare you trick me? How dare you- I just remembered this room, it's- Don't be mean to the ding ding. I'm gonna be mean as I fucking want. I'm bitter. I'm angry and I'm mad, chat. There's nothing in this room. I've been in here a million times. How do I keep forgetting? See you later. Right. What? Why are you here? What? Wait, 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 why are they here so early? What the shit? What? <laughs> what the fuck? What? Why is this thing here so quickly? We have actually... <laughs> what the fuck? What? 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 No! No, no, no! No! <laughs> Go, child. Murder. What the fuck? I guess that's a really smart way to get everyone really experienced. Huh, that makes a lot of sense. Oh. Holy shit. We're gonna be here for a while. Oh, what the f cheater. Yowie hands, why are they here now? Ugh. Kill! Kill! I didn't know they could do that, but... What the I didn't even get nearly enough levels. I don't know if that was worth it. Stupid fucking... Stupid, stupid fucking... Yowie hands. Dumb. Fuck you, yelly hands. I hate you. Me specifically. I am your biggest enemy. Your biggest enemy. That's right, I have to do this entire thing again so I can get the, the, the 
learn Bonnie's favorite foods thing. Wait, I remember this one. No, no, you don't got to because I remember the phrase. I don't even know why it's called Yowie Hands. Why are they called Yowie Hands? Why are they called Yowie Hands? Why? Why? This is a good way to get some early levels. Yeah, there's a, there's a mysterious kingdom. The Void Century from One Piece. He blamed about the Void Taciturn. The Yow I don't need to grind. This game is much easier than it lets on. I'm actually just so pro at this video game. I'm the most overpowered, um, broken, uh... Void Century One Piece. The One Piece is real. Oh, Achilles, you should uh, subscribe. Not because I want you to subscribe to my channel or anything, but because there is a funny bit. Rock! Uh, I know you don't, but uh, chat, do I tell her why I was grinding? That's a very foreboding sentence. That's a very foreboding sentence. That's a very foreboding sentence. No, you're not allowed to. This is actually- this is actually- I'm, I'm actually, like, relieved that this game is not too hard. <laughs> Infinity difficulty mod it would be very interesting. Please stop. Please stop attacking. Me. What did he ever do to you, dick? Fuck you, nerd. Give me crits, 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 crits. Yes, one crit. He up at every enemy is the king. Holy shit, I would actually cry. You breathe in and out. One thousand one hundred XP gained. Do we even get XP from beating the king? <coughs> I thought you don't get XP from beating the king. You hit your hip on the counter again. And different. You hit the counter and say, yeah. You did. <laughs> yeah. Katsu? Katsu. What? Yes. Held a message for a reason. Sexuality, sex, or gender. What? For the word gay ass? Bruh. <laughs> what? Okay. Thanks, Autobot. Appreciate it, I guess. Did I get the key? Am I stupid? Down here, isn't it? No, it's not. What? Chat, am I dumb? Maybe. Just maybe. What? Cheating. Exactly, we're talking about No, not this fucking thing! Fuck you! I hate you! I hate you, you rotten bitch! Punch. You suck. You you suck. Die. 
Ouch. <clears throat> Punch. Uh, artsy silent first. I think more characters should na make their named attack something silly. Like, I think named attacks that are really silly is really fun. Oh, uh, fuck you, bitch. You'll never catch me. I use my friends as shields. Fuck you, loser. See you around. Oh, shit. Oh, get fucked. Get juked, you nerd. You never stood a fucking chance. I think I went in the wrong room again. What the fuck? Chat, allow the word gay ass. Girl ass? Oh, that's why. Maybe I shouldn't have allowed that one. <laughs> I wish, like, like, imagine if there was, like, a shounen anime. Hold on, I'm gonna take a swig. Where, like, all their attacks were named shit like that. Where it's, like, the finishing attack on, like, the most terrifying dictator warlord of the series gets beat by Super Sparkle Rainbow... Allow the word girl ass. <clears throat> and like Super Sparkle Rainbow uh, Blast of Doom. And it's like, I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. I lost my train of thought because I'm actually so pissed off about how Mod Automod hates the word ass. Let people talk about ass in peace. Holy shit, you fucking. The posters? I don't know if I have. I will go check the posters now, I guess. Excuse me. It's like tiny paintings. Some have to move, but they've been frozen in time. I get it. Some papers. They seem to be various newspaper articles in the game. You should keep those in mind for later. Wait, I have been in here. Oops. Wrapped ones. Some of the papers. You want to roll one? <clears throat> it's a bunch of sketches of landscapes. Some of the papers. You want to roll one? Oh my! The papers filled with sketches of naked people doing fun things. Kind of, you're kind of grossed out by that. Oh! <laughs> Laval. Oh, oh my! <laughs> Neat. Show me, I can't see what it is! Oh, no, 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 no! Mirabel Hari covers Bonnie's eyes to make them take two steps back. But I want to see! No, 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 no. It's not allowed. You're not allowed. Yeah, it's not for little ones, Boniface. Yep, can't let you do that, Bon Bon. <laughs> Bonnie's looking straight at you. Frank! Can I look? <laughs> not, definitely not. Oh. oh! So it's really not allowed then! Why did it take Sifrin saying it for you to realize? Frin lets me do things that you guys say no sometimes. But even Frin says it's not allowed, then it must be something really not allowed. So I won't look. Well, good. Sifrin! <laughs> what the crap did you let Bonnie do when we all said no? Oh, well, he let me drink some vodka once. Oh, <laughs> what? Sifrin! <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> I don't really get why Odia likes it, though. It tasted like some, like, just like boring water. Sorry. That sounds like an amazing practical joke to play on a kid, actually. You think it was funny, yeah. <laughs> Holy shit, I actually thought Bonnie drank for a second. That would have been hilarious. Uh, chat, we here at Onyak and Such Industries do not condone underage drinking. However, we will also participate it constantly. Uh, for the sake of um, Twitch moderation, I don't mean that. <laughs> Critical hit, baby. Please don't attack Nisa. Okay, you bitch. I'll kill you for that. I like booze. Chat, what is your opinions on booze? Just kidding. I know, like, more than half of you are probably not 21. Unless this game is, like, a really, really big adult crowd, which in which case would be a nice change of pace for once. Having a nice, cool adult crowd would be a far cry from what I've had to experience this past year. Not to say that, like, oh, I hate minors and fan bases. I think that's fine. 
I am, however, saying I wish I was in a fan base where the majors were an absolute fucking annoying pieces of shit. Like, um, the thou who shall not be named, but I got really upset about over the past two days. <laughs> Actually, am I allowed to say it? I'll fucking say it. Boss dork. That guy's a real piece of shit. Anyway. I won't I, I won't go into it though. You can ask me about it. If someone asks me about it, I'll go into it, but I'm not I don't feel it. I don't feel like wasting your times. Uh there's a pretty mix of teens and adults from uh, its audience, at least from what I've gathered. Yeah, but at least like the adults aren't pieces of shit. <laughs> For a second, that was a scissor sign. If you need something, we could probably assume it's a cut craft type. If you need help, let me know and I'll analyze this enemy. All I had to see was the YouTube thumbnail. Yeah, nah, bro. That, um, let me tell you, as someone who watched the video, I'm not getting those 30 minutes of my life back. That's all I'll say. That's all I'll say. Um, also, if you feel genuinely threatened by miners in a space, uh, Something tells me you might be part of the problem. Um, and also, leaving usernames of people, including minors, uncensored in a video, which enti his entire thesis is, don't point the finger at people, is a little sus. It's a little suspect, if you ask me. It's, um... It's certainly a take. Uh, but... In all honesty, though, I can't I can't say I totally don't understand where they're coming from in terms of the Amori community. Which, I don't want to talk about the Amori community here in this stream specifically, right? Because this is my happy place. But I digress. I got blocked by him on Twitter. That's the old, that's, that's the takeaway from this. <laughs> I don't know if it was because of the comment I left critiquing, or if it's like... A gen it was like being associated with someone like... Well, no, that doesn't make sense, because they put fucking Mincy in the video, but they didn't block them. Which is weird, but okay! Whatever, man. Anyway, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna pretend like I care too much about whatever the fuck they're doing. Anyway, I'm just gonna enjoy... Oh, fuck. Well, thanks for swapping the type as soon as I fucking did. I'm just worried about, like, what they're trying to say, you know? Because, like, I think it's not... <sighs> I don't know how to phrase it. I'm, I'm just going to not phrase it because I don't know how to say it. Well, like, I do know how to say it, but I'm really tired. Um, blah, 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 blah. We're just going to forget all my combos and we're just going to move forward with our lives. Yes? Yes. We're going to abuse the paper while the monster is using it. Oh my god! Jesus Christ. No, I hate this one. No, stop doing that to Mira, you dickweed. Go, Boniface. Roger. Fuck. Hey, save Mira. Oh. Alright, now we kill it. I hope the community for this game is, like, bearable. That's all I can really ask for. <laughs> I'm not really interested in um, going into another community where I have to constantly catch heat 24-7 by a bad side. Which I heard this game is pretty new, though, right? This game is, like, fairly recently made. Which is nice. It's nice to be a part of a growing community. I, at least I think the game is recent. Did they change it, too? Can't see anything. Okay. Well, we'll just keep trying stuff until see what happens. Okay, so, scissors. so it is scissors. It is very nice compared to uh, November, really. Okay. 
The Phantom is a very nice change of pace. For this one, at least. Although, I haven't been able to engage much with people because they keep censoring all their messages because I haven't beaten this game yet. Which, you know, is fair. <laughs> Probably shouldn't tell me what this game is about before I actually play it. <laughs> Lol. God, Issa. Nice. God, Oji looks so hot. On the verge of death. <laughs> Yeah, you should probably play this game, Achilles. Very interesting story. Uh, if you watched the clip, I freaked the fuck out and cried. <laughs> so weak. All right, chat. Now let's learn one of Bonnie's favorite foods. Victory. All right, let's keep moving. Odil. I love Odil. I want her. No me. That's my wife you're talking about. Not yours. This one feels different than the others, doesn't it? Uh, shit. It's missing the threatening pressure the rest of the house has. Shall we take a break then? I can skip through this, but I want to learn about Bonnie. It's snack time! That's, I'm glad to hear that, because, like. Last time, didn't it? Ha! Huh. You now owe me. You were betting? You now owe me a thousand. A thousand what? Books. Books! <laughs> oh, I can't believe this. Betrayed by a friend. We're not friends. We're associates. Not companions? Colleagues. Allies, at best. Not even soulmates? Can't believe you've gone down for being an acquaintance now. No! <laughs> oh god. Take a shot every time Anya cries in a game. Okay, Achilles, damn, dick! <laughs> True, though. Well, I asked the favor tree to make me win my next coin flip. Huh? Such a silly favor. Purely for scientific reasons. I was wondering whether this favor tree business had any truth to it. As we can see, it does. But that wasn't the best experiment to prove it. There was a 50-50 chance, after all. Well, that's interesting. So it changed. Why is that? You don't believe you won thanks to the favor tree? Not really. Call me weird, but I don't think a tree can grant favors. Oh. Madame Odile didn't care about what she was asking, so why would the favor tree care, huh? If you want something to come true, it definitely will. You think so? Eh! You think so? Fuck, my throat gave out halfway through. Chat, I was too busy complaining about Boss Door. Uh, how you all been today? Absolutely! You're glad to see Bonnie smile again. Okay, who wants snacks? My nose has been very congested today, I don't know why. <laughs> I have snacks! Today, I have many snacks at your disposal. I have... Some plankton chips! Oh, didn't you, did you lose the last of those not bananas to make them? Yes, I did! Twenty. Delicious. <laughs> and full of potassium! Been, what, been swell, thank god. Having the world's coldest pasta right now, it's kind of sad. That's awful. I'm so sorry. Thanks, snack is... Some boring but delicious cookies! Cookies! Great sales, bitch bon bon. Boring but delicious. Cookies, the taste of home. What kind of home is boring but delicious? Is that you weird? Oh. And for our third and final snack, we are proud to present... Uh... Some, uh... Ogimiri, Onigiri, Origniri, Onigiri, Onyengiri. <laughs> you messed that one up on purpose. Yes! I have some Onigiris for everyone. One of those cardboard rice balls, right? Yeah, rice. I love rice. You and every other kid on this planet, Bonnie Pace. <laughs> Bonnie likes rice, huh? The all I did just from total affliction. I do want to be a voice actor after all. <laughs> oh, excuse me. <sighs> Fuck my nose. <sighs> Fuck you. Yeah. One rice, two question mark, three question mark. Yes, we are. We are slowly collecting them all. <laughs> anyway. Now choose. Choose which one you want. Don't worry, I have enough for everyone. You like. Uh, I'll take some There! You! Go! 
So, do you all like it? Did I do a good job as snack wiener? <laughs> I wanna- I need to find comic dubs or shit to do stuff for, because that's like, next stage, right? That's like the next stage of things you do. Bro, oh, this is good. Oh, did that make Body sad? Thank you for this. <laughs> so good, thank you, Body. So good, Von Von! I feel refreshed, invigorated, and alive! <laughs> oh, sorry. Mmm, good food. Yummy, yummy, yum. Yes! <laughs> that should not have caught me that. <laughs> Excuse me. Fuck, I died. Oh shit. Fuck. I'm. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Chad. <laughs> Forgive me. <sighs> Fuck. I took a sip while breathing in. I almost choked. Yes, you're still hungry. I can see it on your face. What happened to this cookie? It's more like cookie. You're really weird. Yes, please, Mr. Amazing, Wonderful, Funny, Buff, Isabel. <laughs> no, not the cookie. Sif, you, you can't just say that. I really have a heart. <laughs> I really have the heart of a delicate maiden, you know. You have to be careful with me. <laughs> Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> Guys, the biggest, the biggest, uh, ho the biggest, uh, 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 what? Allow the word game auto mod. Literally. Ah, oh, whatever. <laughs> the people in the house? Yes, well, they're most likely frozen in time, aren't they? We haven't seen anyone yet, but maybe, maybe someone survived. Maybe that housemate managed to. Tell me a joke, Sifrin, please. To get my mind off things. Make her smile. I didn't eat the plant yesterday, like fruit. Yes, I mean, it was fruitful. You finished the quick joke quickly to make sure she wouldn't finish it herself. What? Oh, fruitful. I guess that's funny. <laughs> yeah, that's not the way to go. <laughs> that's stupid. We can't be friends. That'd be like uh, being friends with your mom or your sister. You know what? I don't know. Oh. Anyway, chat, we can move forward now. Is that Don't Yiff the Fox game? What? Day Shift at Freddy's 1 to 3. If not, I think it'd be an amazing stream game. I've heard of Day Shift. I've never played Day Shift, but I've heard of Day Shift. I heard how much of a drug trip experience it is. And honestly, I'm quite scared of it. Fuck you, enemy! You'll never catch me! I want this key. Out of disrespect, you open and find the crying key. A key here? A mask, huh? This feels out of place. I was expecting a keychain shaped like scissors or something. I got the key in there, not thinking about how bad you are in your job. Usually, when can you play Five Nights at Genos on stream? Maybe one day. <laughs> you have the option to sex Foxy? Where do I download this game? <laughs> Why'd I say that? <laughs> I got a crit! Gowie. Why 
Wow. <laughs> Ignore me. <laughs> I have insanity on the brain. Maybe I should have blocked that word. But yes, very good to know. Unfortunately, that is not my character. My favorite character is Foxy the Pirate. I've read through this one before, chat. Let's move forward and beat stage two, creature. I forgot which one this one is. Let me just block. Oh, it might be scissors. Where are the e-sets in chat to save me? I'm scared. <laughs> Day shift at Freddy's has permanently changed my vocabulary. I find myself going thank without it, uh, without the S due to Withered Bonnie. I remember seeing that somewhere. That audio almost fucking ate shit. Rock, right? Yeah, that makes sense. Why is it called nostalgia? I just noticed that. They always called shit like this. <gasps> Whoa, I finally got the healing thing. Slow, bitch. What do you mean by that? Are you what what do you mean by that? Huh? Yeah. Why are you saying shit like that? What do you mean by 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 that? Oh fuck. Uh shit. Oh. Oui, oui, mon chéri. <laughs> Off to visit your mother. Off to visit your mother. Should I be giving all the characters French accents? Is that what I should be doing? But I'd be like, actually, I don't remember how to do a French accent. Oh my god. Yay, another crest! We should be careful about where we use this one. The first ESA post you saw was about them being French. I'm so sorry for you. Fuck! Oh, look at this little creature. Look at this little creature. Born just yesterday. Checking they're from different countries. Yeah, I think Odile's supposed to be Chinese, I think. That's the what I'm understanding. Then like, I guess that this game is in France, Isabo, and uh University of Japan. That makes more sense. It was somewhere around there. If only she was Korean. Then she would be like me for real. <laughs> Oh, hey, my sinus is cleared up. Let's go. <sighs> I can breathe. Fuck. And then Sifrin should be from a destroyed country in the north, so... Antarctica? Wait a minute. Get me out of here. I don't want to find no fucking bomb. Japanese Odoo. Fuck you, camper. You filthy fucking dirty camper. You rotten bitch. I'll kill you. Crafting time. Come on, critical hit! Damn it. Antarctica. New one. Really? No one made that joke before. Am I original and funny? Uh, is based on, but I don't know if it would be a super spoiler. Okay. That's a. That's a horrifying message. The most horrifying thing of all, Sifrin is from is from England. 
gasp. Yeah, we can skip the dialogue with that fucker. See you later, bitch. Ooh, suck it. It's not here. It's going up, but... It's passing through. You take a deep breath, and... Oh, don't poke my side, Sif. I'm ticklish. Oh, that's wonderful information to have. You feel lightheaded. <laughs> Time, laddies! Stop it! Don't attack a deal, you fucking bitch! Owie. Owie zowie. Hodge! Boom. Now let's use... Bruh, wrong target, idiot. Oh, body steals a kill. Let's go! Uh, Dev revealed what country was based on because she was annoyed by the the country is British jokes. Really? Oh, that's so sad. I was actually going to say the same thing. Wait, did I say the same thing? Oh, I actually don't remember what I said. Holy shit, I have dementia. Or short-term memory loss? I don't know. I'm trying to make a joke, but I genuinely forgot. Anyway, um, give me the key. Just ask her what she knows. And Rocky. Leave stream. Oops. <laughs> Is this like the fucking Kel Burgers joke for the ESAC community? Oh, fuck you. Oh my goodness gracious. It's like that, but the creator also hates it. I see. Understood. I will instead make the jokes that Sifrin is from Antarctica because this game is completely white. And black. Black and white. Just like Antarctica. This one, man. Whoops. Now we'll examine the key. Sifrin, I remember your time loops. What? What's the gems? Wow, a secret passage. Nice one, but you're the one who found it, buddy. <laughs> All right, let's go find this book that, uh... Book is for the Warcraft skills. Book is for the books. No family tells me these are really what you can't read. That's a big, sparkly tree in the cover. Oh, a Sifrin Norse. Anyway. No family tells, but... Oh, yes, color theory. Are you interested in it, Sifrin? You shrug. Huh, what's a color? Haha, <laughs> Sad doesn't know what a color is. I really don't. Tell me. It's, um, well, it's like weird shades. I learned it at school, but it wasn't very interesting. So I crafted a, uh, I crafted a drawing on my table instead. Wow, Bon Bon, you're so hardcore. They are weird shades, yes. This is a relatively new discovery, so I'm not surprised you haven't heard, Isabel. But a very long time ago, we could apparently see shades called colors. Yeah! They had a shade called blue. <laughs> and that's the sky's wheel shade. And one named green. And that's what the, that's what the grass looked like. I think the world around us still are those colors. And we just um, forgot how to see them. Or so researchers say. I think the house of over in Corbo. Or Corbo was researching it. That's, that's such big news! How did I not know this? I failed you all. How oh, don't worry. We don't usually count on you to know things. Oh yeah, that's true. Colors, 
Shades people can't see anymore. It seems silly, but somehow this knowledge feels familiar to you. Chat, I could not live in a world without colors. I love colors. Take a look too. Oh, uh, you too? We should really get going. Give us a second, Vera Battle. Three titles. Mumbling each one under your breath. Lost in land, history of pepper, what to do when there's you're sad and there's no chocolate around. Ah! Here! At the very bottom. Uh paper ass paper papas. Papa papa. Family tale! Where? Pepper, what now? Who checked it out? Someone called Charles... Charles Coquette. Charles Coquette? Oh, that's the Bolanger in Dormont. Does he have a book you want, Van Amadil? So he has it. The Bolanger... The Bolanger in Dormont, huh? They sold croissants, if you remember. Fuck! Hmm. Well, I'll have to check it. I'll have to check after we beat the king and before I go away. Hmm? What? What are we talking about? Ugh. What about you, Sifrin? You were looking around. Did you find the book you were looking for? Huh? A book? Are you both looking for a book? I was, but it's fine. Hey, are you ignoring us? What's happening? Is this another secret quest? If you say it's fine, then it is. Let's get going, everyone. Here, Bo and Lisa will look at each other and sigh. So the Bollinger, or the Bollinger, or the... Why is it in France? Can I just say Baker? The Baker in Dormant might have checked it out. Checked out a family tale. You should go back to Dormant and let Odile know. Paper ass! So wait, should I go back to Dormant now? Or should I just go through the rest of this game first and then go back to Dormant? Because I figure we might as well just learn what all of Bonnie's favorite food is. And then we go back to Dormont, just to, like, make things easier. Go through the house? Okay, word. Yeah, because we also got to talk to the king or some shit, too. And then we can go back and be like, Hey, uh, Odile, you might want to go talk to the, the baker! I've been waiting to get to that part in Deltarune. Because I know I'm playing with Mari right now, and I might keep playing with Mari. But what I want to do is I want to do, like, um... I want to try and get a voice filter for when I fight the Spamton. Because that's the one character I do know that's in that game. That and the Queen, because of Mr. Beast. Mr. Beast! Oh shit, why'd I do that? I fucked up. There goes my combo. Whatever. We'll just, we'll just use this opportunity to heal. Oh, well, thanks for making my life easier, guys. Mr. P! Greetings, greetings, boys and girls. Welcome back to this Phantom Show. Now's your chance to be a big shot. Be a big, be a big, be a big shot. That was your chance to be a big shot. Be a big, be a big, be a big shot. Bum, 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 bum. I was in this room already, but I want to reset the enemy aggro. Ba, 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 ba. <laughs> um, we can move forward. Oh, fuck you, you little rat. You know, we'll just do the cutscene. It's easier than fighting a boss. I'd rather just, like, skip past all this dialogue and then. If we have to fight Sans in fucking. Deltarune eventually. I might actually uninstall that video game. Yeah, that's really sad that Sifrin doesn't nod anymore. I kind of miss the Sifrin nods. You rat bastard. Fuck you, nerd! Bitch. <sighs> but yeah, I don't know. I'll say something I totally forgot. What's his name? Yeah. Uh, oh yeah, Sans. I don't want to deal with Sans ever again. I actually hate that guy. Uh, fuck you, Sans Undertale. Um, you can kiss my ass. <laughs> anyway, move forward. I believe it is downward. Go down for the key. Yes! Will not forget such a terrible crime. 
Although I feel like there's items we can collect if we go up, but it will just like soft lock, them, which I don't want to deal with. Grab this. Wait a minute. Did I fuck up? Wait, hold on. Fifty percent time. Boring. Chateau Castle. A thief. No, forgot I said I have no concrete proof. But I issued this ritual after came to my room. The dorm room said a thief. Look through his pockets. Look inside. Curse of Chateau Castle, issue three. Damn it! Was there something I needed for the, the the super key though? I thought I needed something for the super key. Oh, I remember it forever now. Cool. Swag. Sw oh, you fuck. Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay. So I just gotta get an item though, don't I? Is there an item I need to grab? I forgot. I genuinely forgot. It's so long, chat. Jesus Christ. Grab the notebook key, right? I did. I did grab the notebook key. We'll now learn all of Bonnie's favorite foods. Let's record our progress here, too. This is probably some of the best we've gotten in Act 3. At least for this loop. This loop's levels have not been too terrible. Okay, Shh. strong sadness again. It will be fine. Let us kill them. Widow Bonnie. Money. It's being mixed around sure helps with XP. It does. It helps a lot. Two sadnesses. Get ready, everyone. All right, they have different statuses. Ouch. Yowza. Yeah. Let's start with papers. Just stack papers, because it's probably one of the better ones. You fucker. I don't think I have the item. Ah, shit. Ah, fuck, bitch. Oops. I forgot you don't get it this early. Oh well, I'll be fine, I think. Yeah, I, I have confidence in myself. Yes, yes, what oh, what oh, what oh. I'll be fine, don't worry. Notice how I am completely unfazed because I am overpowered! <laughs> I remember the mechanics in this game. <laughs> no, 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 no. It's not ripped Ojo forever because when you do the super special thing, it reawakens them from uh, being frozen. Inside, which is very funny that I remember that. That's honestly something I thought I would have forgotten. Unfortunately for you, uh, video game, I'm actually really intelligent and a combat genius. Uh, across heaven and earth, I alone am the wanted one. Uh, so get on my level, kid. Uh, yikes. <laughs> anyway. Ouch. Nice to meet you, motherfucker. Damn. Oh, please don't kill her, though. We got really close, though. Ouch. I hate that they do this to her. Why did they give her the spite? Oh, man. Um, let's 
Seek vengeance. You breathe in and out. Seven thousand XP retreat. Fifty-six. In a while, Rockadile. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, finally, lovely moving cure. Okay, we have it, chat. We have it. We won. All right, one last floor to go. Chat, it's snack time. I'm going to do this a lot quicker than last time. Although I guess that's typical when you don't have to reread dialogue over and over again. This is very interesting. Oh fuck, the weird ass hair thing. This room feels safe too, doesn't it? Break time. What was that? Bonnie forgot to tie their shoe. You give a thumbs up. Oh, Jen, I to forget. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm just trying out different things. Oh, fuck. That was new dialogue noises. Fuck! Uh, what happened? It doesn't matter. How delightfully naive. I suppose you won't mind if I throw your ashes in the nearest latrines, then. Joke time. I get it, because I'm full of... <laughs> hey, you done talking, because... It's snacks time, baby! Oh, a serious business snack time. I'm listening. Snack time's always serious business, dummy. Today I have, um... The Madelines. Madelines. Thank you for making some, Boniface. Mm. I also have... Some pineapple spices. I have some sugar on them. Just plain pineapple slices? With sugar. And pineapple's good, you know. It is. It's just not very exciting is all. Exciting? You want exciting? Then eat this! Fish head! Fish head? Fish head? Why a fish head? Fishes are yummy, and their textures are, are different and good. Are they? They are! Okay. So which that do you guys want? Like? One fish head, please. There you go! Let me answer the fish head. I have another if someone wants one. I'll try it. I'm curious. Do I eat the whole thing? Yeah. But, like, not the eyes, right? No, you have to eat the eyes, too. They're the best part. Ah. Uh, all hesitantly takes a bite. Oh! Oh, it's alright, actually. Uh-huh. <laughs> Good choice. Let me eat. So... Uh, I guess it's not fish head. Is it pineapple? It didn't tell me. Oh, pick pineapple? Aw, oh, fuck biscuits. <sighs> Whatever. So, is the, is the second... Oh, I guess I wouldn't know, huh? Shit. We could die today, huh? Don't have to. I've had a good life. You would die today, you? Oh, is that so? I won't let you. <laughs> Keep that sort of speech out for the younger ones. I'm sure Isabel would love it. Hey, Seth. You know you look like a hamster when you eat. No, I don't. I'm so sorry to be the one to tell you this, but you do. Your cheeks get all big and round, like a cute hamster. Isabel. Yes? Not being cheeky. Ha! <laughs> I can? That's a good game design element, chat. Mirabelle's biting her nails. You point to them. Nails. <laughs> oh, uh, thanks, Sifrin. I wish you could bite yours, but you still strong. You'll stay strong. Be okay. I hope so. I might even say, huh? Oh, no. We're gonna nail it. I won't let you win. You smirk. Meh. Bonnie seems to think hard about something. Save your sister, Bonnie. Huh? Oh. Yeah, I know. All right, chat, we can move forward. Ready? Not, not, don't. Uh, not exactly helping the don't pay attention to Bonnie thing with this. It's a thing. I've been paying attention to Bonnie. I just, you know, for I didn't reach out. That's my own fault. <laughs> <laughs> I made a mistake! Oh. I... Ugh. I fumbled! 
Wow, Rocket Owl. Wave goodbye. I don't remember what it did, but it's okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. You can't even critique my decisions then. That's mean. Oh my. <laughs> to come out of your computer and Bonnie to kill you. Oh, shit. Oh, well, I can't say I didn't deserve it. I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? I genuinely already forgot. Uh, there's a thing in here, right? What looking for? I should remember this number. Fuck, dude. Is issue 87 not the number? Damn it. I think I'm supposed to go the other way, right? Yeah, that's the other way. Oops. Oopsie! I made the mistake, lads! It's a fucking bullshit. You s oh the fucking yaoians are back at it again. Oh, I hate you. Anyway, let's just kill him. Uh, crit, 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 crit. Ah, yeah, get. Stop attacking me! Oh, you fucking. Doesn't tell you which number is the last. You just gotta remember which one's the highest. Huh? The highest. 87 is pretty high. Oh. Okay. Oh, I understand now. Okay, I'm starting to get it. I'm starting to understand a little bit. Okay, so, um, I don't know what the highest is. A lot of HP. Oh, die, mortal! Stop. Go, bunny! Yay, sex! The last one you check is the one Sif asked the guy if you find the other one. Oh. Oh, shit. Okay, then. So should I just not look at any more books then? So just, just, so I'm assuming 87 is the highest one. I'm just not going to look at any of the books. It's not for now. Bad. Okay. Crit! Please let me find crits. Oh, two crits! Dude, they gotta stop trying to freeze me all the time. It's not working. Oh, money for the finishing ball. Oh, that would've been cool. Oh! What? Wait, what the fuck? That's funny. I did not know that could happen. What the hell? I did not mean to reset this room. I was on accident. My brain genuinely just turned off. Ah, oh, crikey. All right, I just won't look at any more books. It's all right. I don't need to anyway. I don't think. Critical hits. Oh, I got a crit at least. I'm getting better at getting these crits. I just look at 87 again. Yeah. I guess that's true. For being somewhere. It's just an optional route. Oops. Oh well. It's fun to re adequate myself with the world around us. Also, get these. Uh, uh, these, these potions. Potion, these elixirs, these, uh, where are they? Wait, what? I thought there was elixirs in here. Huh? Oops. Oh, well. <laughs> I genuinely thought there was something in here. That's crazy. Lol. Is there not any more? I guess one there was. My inventory's full. 
I don't think it's possible though. Damn it. <laughs> the weird creature with the rock hands. And I have the memories of shit. Oh, I have to do this. Honest, we're in the de in like the desk. Oh. Uh, as much as I want them, I don't think I'll need them. Because I keep resetting. I don't remember if there's anything in there. Like, anything else that's important. Oh well. I think I'll be fine. Yay, snacks! Thank you, Bonnie. Give me a crit! It has a mouse. That. I softly, stupid baby, die. <laughs> There's no sparing in this game. This is an Undertale. Anyway, let's move on. It has a mouse. Wow. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Uh -oh. Oh, at least, uh, Sifrin is still smiling here. That's good to know. I thought I was about to see Sifrin fucking miserable in this photo, and I would have cried. In your pocket. Uh, well, MatPat is quitting. So... What do you mean, haha? -ha? Don't say that to me. No. I don't think MatPat would... Uh, yeah, MatPat's, like, leaving the channel, so it, it doesn't... Like, I think his last theory is tomorrow. Which is so sad. Like, that actually makes me really upset. I grew up with MatPat, man. Like, that's my childhood right there. Like, that's how I learned about top surgery. Was Actually, I should talk about this. <laughs> uh, well, like... I guess for women, top surgery. Like, getting bigger booby. Anyway. Oh, you wanna know a funny? I had, a, like, a Matt pat like theory throughout this playthrough that the king was Sifrin from the future. That's what I was thinking, too, when I first played this game, actually. But then I slowly started settling, that doesn't make sense. And so I decided to go against that theory. It does sound interesting, though. I'll tell you what. It's a very compelling theory, if this game wasn't totally going for something different. Like, I was thinking about that at first, but it's like, no, because the king wants to learn about the kingdom, or, like, the... I keep wanting to call it the Ancient Kingdom, but that's one piece. Um, like the thing for the bomb. Did I forget something? I feel like I forgot something for a bomb already, but it's okay. Who cares? Yeah, I think I already forgot. I, no, I think I forgot. Books. If you think about it, Sifrin. Like like some good looking type. Question. How do I? Way I can do that? How do I do this? Yes, give it away. Hey, Mirabel Plums! I really give to me some Mirabel Plums. Oh, she does give great gifts. Damn it! Made bed. Bell's bed's roommate. It's bad. She's okay. She's fine because she's really good. They don't like her. Is that a good thing? 
success. So, maybe. But even so, you're gonna be different again or whatever. You haven't worn a dress in forever in Act Two. Oh. Come on. Come on. Papers. Each paper seems to be a file with a person on it. Pictures of your name and what seems to be their answers to questions like, where do you imagine yourself in 10 years, or do you want kids? Are these papers? She must have been looking at some of the papers when she left. Did she choose the one person to do so? Either way, this seems to be a weird one to write about. You should go talk to her about it. Oh, so now I gotta go back in fucking town? Oh, crikey. Rice, pineapple, something, 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 something. Uh, whatever the last one is. Uh, what about this time? time? Trans people, let's go! Is there something in here? It's locked. Maybe I should take this one. Is making my head hurt. That's concerning. Oh, so I gotta do social links? Is that a way to get to Act 4 or whatever? Interesting. Okay. How long have I been streaming for already? Holy shit, it's already almost been two hours? Oh, wait, no. I started streaming at 7.30, right? No, I streamed at 7. Fuck, how long have I been doing this for? <laughs> It's almost been two hours, holy shit. Oh god, Sifrin's dying. No, Sifrin, don't die. We need you. Boom. They want us to do social links. That's what I'm hearing. see what it's doing. Snacks. Oh, okay. Much less annoying? What do you mean annoying? I heard social links are really cool. <gasps> Yay, buddy! I'm not complaining. I like so I like talking to characters in games. It gives me an excuse to do funny voices. Which is probably the most fun I get out of streaming, honestly. It's just like Broadcasting the silly voices I do for characters in public. Which I think is a pretty fun thing, you know? So, I know there's probably items in all these other paths I'm not going to that, like, softlock me. Is there a chance I get to probably do that? I don't know. I thought that's what you were talking about. Oh. <laughs> uh, I forgot which one this one is. Um, I think it's paper. Let's see. Nope. It's rock. Or it's paper. Yeah, it's rock. Punch. Oh, shit! Oops. Um. <laughs> Oops! Bitch! I fucked up, chat. I fucked up big. I fucked up big. It's okay. Maybe a reason to check dead ends later on, yeah? Shit. Ugh. So, I should do it later then is what I'm hearing. Mira fucking died. Alright, Boniface. What did you mean by weird smelly? Uh, let's get some food going here. Uh, sour tonic on our very low friend Mirabel. That should work. Wait, I had to burn through so many tonics though when I lasted that fight. <sighs> Shit. Hidden passage. Some of them are actually required to be some are some passage. I see. Interesting. Oh, 
What a weak ass enemy. <laughs> uh, okay, so some of them are interesting scenes. Interesting. Okay. How many secret paths are there? There's like one. There's two at least. There's one in there. I know there's one in that other room. There's only two other ones I could go, huh? At least I think. Trackpot. Right? There's only like two others I could go. There's like three paths. Some of them are actually required to be the game, so... There's only two other paths I could go, because I went to that other one, and it didn't really do anything when, like, I accidentally picked up. Or I did a coin flip. And, like, so that one didn't really do anything. But I think there's only two paths here that I can really go check out. I think. I think. I should preface with I think. I actually don't know. At least they're non discriminate. Oh my god, stop attacking the ones that attacked you, you bitch. Oh, let's go for a crit. Farm a crit! Oh, I tried. Oh, buddy! Yeah. Oh, it's a finishing strike. There we go. Boxes. The backgrounds? Fuck me. Okay. Oh, okay. okay. Nice. There we go, never mind. Uh, I think the next would maybe be check all the wrong ones. Okay. That's a good idea, actually. Please change the machine. World of higher this game. That's true. Yes. Get going. Guys, they're slowly starting to figure it out. for what I don't want to do backgrounds for. This game is on Switch, right? Is that how you played it? One room and floor two, I think. That's Why, why do they even sell Max? Max is so dog shit. He's over there in the past. Bathroom? Seems so. Bathroom time. Bathroom. 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 So, does anyone need to go? Razor. You close the bathroom stall. 734. You breathe out slowly. Okay. So, you're trapped in time. And that's not great. But you have goals you can strive towards, so you're fine. You know what to do. Talk to your friends. Find out more about the loots. Talk to the king. As long as you have goals, you will be fine. Why did you loop back? Oh, my mouse. Oops. Why isn't it over? Why did it even start in the first place? You'd be so naive to not even think about why you're even looping. You got the power to help everyone, and you just accept it? Who do you think you were? The hero of the story? I'm a silly. If only you'd used your brain sooner, maybe you wouldn't be in this situation. If only you'd thought about why you got those powers. You looked inside the classroom. If you'd look more and in, in, uh, looked inside the classroom more intently. If you'd searched the head housemaid's office better. If you'd look closer at the pillars in the death corridor. What are you missing now? That you'll feel stupid for not seeing earlier. Stupid. But it's fine. You're seeing clearly now. You won't miss a thing anymore. You'll save everyone. Save Vaugard. And escape from this loop. You will. Do 
the exit of the bathroom. I thought it was only on floor three, though. Yeah, Sifrin, such a miserable little creature. Is there anything actually on floor two? I thought it was all on floor three. Well, I thought there'd be something in this room, but it's a crab and dead end. Change God, save me. Save me, change God. Please do something, man. Please do something. Wish to rest. Rest. You need it teleported. A knife, Sifrin? What do you mean? A knife? Did the change code just give it to us? Huh? No, it can't. I, I think they did. With the we can't. Come back to this room when you're teleported. What? Thumbs up. What the? That's floor three's entrance. The change got beamed us here. That's. Well, at least we don't have to backtrack. I'm not gonna ask questions. Thank you, Change God, for the spoon. Thanks, Change God. Thank you. You and Odia look at each other. Shrug. Thank you, Change Gods, or expressions, or whichever deity gave us this knife. Thank you. Am I... Did I fuck up? Huh? Fuck! I knew I forgot something. Whatever. Oh, shit. I was... I was just thinking in the back of my head. I feel like I'm forgetting something. What floor is the sharpening stone on? You gotta be kidding me. Man, ah, uh, that's so annoying. One, I fucking. <sighs> Kill me. Kill me now. Kill me. Let me just backtrack real quick and make sure I remember where all the rooms are. This is one of those paths I could take. Just longer. Uh, uh, yeah, but that's annoying. I want the knife. Uh, so lame. So lame. And I keep forgetting to pick things up. I'm sorry, why are we back here? Madam, are you saying Sif was wrong to bring us back all the way to this to a room we already searched top and bottom? Because there's only one thing here? Madam, you're so weird. Text that should change code. Text that should be in the house so we can see its face clearly. Look at it a little closer. Stick your tongue out in disgust. The statue's face looks awful. Can those just look like that? Wow, that left eye is somehow above the right brow. I can't tell if they're supposed to be smiling or frowning. <laughs> Mira, 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 help us roast this statue's terribly made face. Uh, oh, Mira? Oh no. Uh, uh oh. <laughs> I was trying to make them look gentle and nice. Mira, we're so sorry. Sorry we said your statue sucked! No, no, it's fine. I'll get my revenge against you all someday. Oh, Shudder. So Miriam made the statue. Interesting, that's the only one that wasn't destroyed. You know very little about the change god and the statues of them. You, you can find everywhere in Valgard. Maybe you should look at the statues inside the house when you have to have the time. Got that fucking sharpening stone. I knew I was forgetting something. Oh, God. It was all the way back in floor one. What is this stupid bullshit? I literally walked in that fucking room. Oh, my God. Ugh.
way I can like <sighs> I want to go to a loop. I want to do a loop. Oh shit, really? What the fuck is wrong with my microphone? It's probably because I keep turning away to look at shit. Another strong sadness. We should... Let's go, everyone. And then we do some kill things. We do killing. We do murder. 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 We do kill. We do murder. We do kill. Yeah, why does it do that? Hey, microphone, stop being a piece of shit. Um, let me look at the settings on it. That's why. It's not in the... Circle mode. That should be better. Hopefully. Should be better. Hopefully. Should be better. Maybe. Probably. We'll see. I hope. It would be nice. There we go. Ooh, critical hit. Let's go. Bordon. <laughs> you thought I was doing it on purpose. It, let's just say I was, huh? Let's just say I was. Yeah, chat? Boom. Look at that damage. Kaboom. Nothing broke yet. That's a problem. Da -da. Ba -ba. Um, let's get a crit. Come on, crit. Ugh, nothing is broken yet. Such a piece of dog. Ah! I have to adjust my angle. It hurts sitting down for too long. Let's just get some buffs going, huh? Yeah. Adorable moving shield. I like this buff. Um, smash. Punch. Nothing is broken yet. We'll try to get a combo going, because then we can do damage to everything. There you go. It was not vulnerable to rock attacks. Ooh, that's not good. Super Sparkle Heal! Oh, uh, shit. Um, lower the defense. Um, time. Go, bunny. Damn. Well, they tried. Oh my god. A for effort, Boniface. I don't know what I'm trying to do. I actually do know what I'm trying to do, but don't worry about it. Fuck, I punched the wrong one. Oh well, who cares? <laughs> there we go, that's what you like to see. That, that, the big one is now vulnerable to paper attacks. The big one is now even more vulnerable to paper attacks. The big one is now even more vulnerable to rock attacks. Alright, scissors is the most quantiful thing. He's not vulnerable to scissor attacks. Nice. There we go. Now we can spam scissor attacks and just kill it. It also might not even be my mic. It's just sometimes I'm like louder and sometimes I'm not as loud. Because, you know, that's how it be when you're as sleepy all the time as me. Go, Bonnie. Go. Damn it. Uh, guard. Uh, give me a crit, come on. Eh. Would've been nice. Oh, well. Go! Super attack! Hell yeah. Let's go! Breathe in and out. 7,000 XP. Except for level 58. Oh, it's because Mirabelle died, huh? Yes, we won! Let's... Come on, everyone, let's keep going. Oh, Mira. All right, now we get to learn Bonnie's third favorite food. Probably. 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 I have to go to the bathroom, but we'll... Shit. Oh, fuck, I'll get to the scene first. I'm so sorry, Claude. You don't deserve this, buddy. Oh, buddy, old pal. 
I mean, I could take the part, but there's really no point because I forgot to get the other part. Oh, I feel bad for skipping. But I do want to keep moving forward. So sad watching her cry. Leftover samosas! From yesterday's dinner? Yeah. And the ones I burnt. But I thought I should still keep them in case we get super duper hungry. Don't be mean to the burnt samosas! They were delicious! They really were. They're not the worst of anything. Oh! <laughs> Little baby. Okay, next one! I have... <gasps> Pagama... Pa -pa Palomiers! We all know Palomiers. They're yummy and qu they're crunchy. They're crumbs get everywhere! Moving on! And, um, the last snack... Control yourself this time. Okay, I've never tried it before, but I think I cooked them well. Ta-da! My younger fritters! <laughs> you smile. Bonnie seems you, uh, sees you smile and puff their chest proudly. <laughs> what are they? They're fried malanga and granama. Uh, malanga is some kind of root and granama is some kind of pumpkin. They s this smells heavenly. Something burnt. So which one? Which snack do you guys want? You'd like. Uh, which one, chat? What do I go with? Chat, lay it on me. What do you- what should I do? I don't know what I'm doing. Chat, I don't want to do this again. What- what do I- what do I pick? <laughs> Save me! Smosas? Okay. There you go! Keep some for themselves. Yes, yeah, Samosas buddies! They have potatoes in them, right? Yeah, because I love potatoes and samosas. Hmm. I seem to remember Sif saying the samosas they're used to, uh, used to didn't have potatoes in them. Different recipes depending on cultures, I suppose. Yeah! I love samosas a whole, whole, whole lot! But some places make them with cheese in them. Gross. Why would you dirty a perfectly good samosa with cheese? Such strong opinions about cheese. Samosa with potatoes. No cheese. Got it. Everyone started eating. You're more of a potatoes in samosas hater. But whatever. Read around the burn parts. After eating snacks, everyone's health has been restored. Mirror law, mirror dialogue. All right, chat. I'll be right back. I'm gonna go to the bathroom really quickly. Give me five sec. All right, chat, we are back. We are so back. Kind of tried something new. I had banana chips for the first time a few weeks ago. Are you guys trying about talking about food? Chat, chat. I think picky eaters should just try the food. What do you think? I want to make malanga fritters. Um, was it malanga fritters? Yeah. I would like to make one one day. It would be nice. Browns at you loudly. Just stop. Just uh, eat. Uh, eat more food. But what if I don't like it? Um. Well, you never. I. I think it's good if you like know you've tried a food and you don't like it. But I think we should all, as a collective, should at least try the food first once. You know what I mean? That's my opinion, though. Cause I know I hate Brussels sprouts and bean sprouts. Well, actually, I think I can eat Brussels sprouts. I hate bean sprouts. 
Do you remember? I remember you. Is that so? Uh, we shall fight. And we shall see which side the universe favors! Well, I tried talking to you, bitch. Shrug! Shrug! Zone out for this part? Yes. You've heard this before. Get ready, everyone! The king, you finally managed to beat him last time. You still have so many questions. Why is he freezing Valgard in time? Does his power have anything to do with the time loops you're stuck in? If you ask him something, will he answer? Oh, fine! You can now ask the king questions by going into your craft menu. The things I let you do, Stardust, I swear! Uh, ask. King. What's your goal? Oh, my goal! Sif, does it matter? It doesn't! Your reasons don't matter at all! But they might. Why do you want to freeze Vanguard in time? Sifrin? Oh, ho, ho, ho. can't you guess? Can't you tell? Oh, stars, I thought my intentions were clear. But no one seems to understand. We don't know. We don't understand you. Why would you want an entire country to suffer? And expect everyone to be okay with it? There must be a reason. Why would you freeze Vogard in time? And only Vogard, for that matter. That's true. No other country has been attacked. With a power like yours, you could freeze more than just Vogard. But you stopped at the borders. Other countries are safe. Why? Oh, oh, because Vargard is perfect. Perfect? Oh, hold on, I need to breathe. Fuck. Such welcoming, creative people. Always willing to travel to welcome travelers in. Even travelers with no name. No home to speak of. Such precious memories. It is perfect. I do not want it to change. I want it to stay exactly how it is. So it cannot ever be destroyed. That's so... What backwards thinking? I don't know what about Valgard made it perfect for you. But you cannot stop us from living! That's the king. Are you the one doing this to me? Oh? Oh. Doing this? Stars, you don't want to explain in front of everyone, but the king... He could be the one trapping you in time. The one imprisoning me here. Huh? Imprisoning you? Whatever is happening to you, I am not the one responsible. Bright one. But that scent around you, could it be? It does not matter. He doesn't seem to know what you're talking about. So the king isn't the one responsible for the loops. Isn't that weird? You're looping through time, he's freezing it. Aren't you using the same power? Power over time? That's the king. How are you freezing people in time? Ha! Sif. Could have told you that one if you asked. It's Timecraft, buddy. Timecraft, you've heard of this before. Timecraft, the ability to craft time itself. But Timecraft is supposed to be impossible to control. <laughs> yeah, for real. It is something incredibly ominous. How can you use it yet alone? Uh, how can you use it? Yet alone do it at such a grand scale. Ha! If the Bright One isn't bright enough to know time craft, they will not be bright enough to understand how. Ouch. Don't be mean to Fwin! Shut up! Time craft. That's something to look into, isn't it? Either way, it doesn't seem like he's the one trapping you here. Since you're here, it might be worth to beat the king now, so you can go and talk to the head housemaiden. She said something before about how you're looping. About something being broken. 
she knew something. After that, we have to find more information about Timecraft somewhere. You can always go back to fight the king if you have anything else to talk about. Ask the king. Different time. Ah, uh, make up for time. Okay, now we go. Adorable moving shield. Protect us. Uh, lower your attack so we can survive this even better. Then we go with paper alpha five. Boom! Oh my god, it does no damage! Um, we will... Turn it up so we can do more damage. Yes. Uh, his portrait is just him sleeping, basically. Oh shit, that's horrifying. I haven't gotten that one yet, but that's interesting. <sighs> Oh, it is time, saviors. Die! You live. Haha, <laughs> I get fucked. <laughs> we survived it. Everyone okay? Oh, oh, you're still here. Good. Let us fight to the death then. Go, buddy! <laughs> 99 damage. Let's go, baby. Why would you just die? Ah, <laughs> uh, break, break, break. They used to be surprised. It's like finally some rest time. Oh, that's so sad. Uh, all right, we're gonna heal good old Odo because she has no health. Frail old lady. Goodbye, bitch. Oh fuck. Owie. Um, turn it up. Turn it up. Oh, we could go... Ah, but... Oh, deal's gonna... Oh, wait, can I craft? Sadly not. Attack time! This fight gets a lot easier now that you know that there's really no other tricks up this guy's sleeve except the whale. Ah, uh, pretty buffy friend. I mean, he has, like, attack debuffs and shit. Really, it's not all that impressive. Her poor old woman bones, yes. She can barely survive anything. Go, bunny! Oh, critical hit! Uh. Uh-oh. Uh, make up the time. Go faster. Fuck, I have to use lovely moving cure. What we'll probably do... Uh, slow you down. So we can probably... Yes, okay. Uh, turn it up. Need Mirabelle's spell, just in case the king attacks. Oh, fuck, I don't have it up. Oh, shit. Oh, wait, everyone's healed, too. Oh, shit. I fucked up, chat. Always cooldowns by six. We can just start reducing cooldowns, I think. That's what we'll do. Youch. Uh, he knocks the slow off. That's good to know. Okay, paper time. I need snacks, Bonnie. No, please. It would be nice. Uh, done heal. We will do... Oh, okay. Because she has weak old woman bones. Nice, 99 damage. Adorable moving shield. Protect us from any potential attacks. Um, Stall allies defense. I don't see why not, because he can debuff us. She's doing her best, I agree. King whimpers. Oh shit, biscuits! I fucked up. Uh, let's get some crafted water going. Revive her. Um. Fuck. I should really use this time to heal. Yeah. It's so sad. Um. Okay, that should be enough. Oh, it's different. Okay. Uh, let's just do attacks. We're gonna keep stacking so we can get some heal back up. We're gonna have to rely on this. Zone out for this part. Yes, I don't care about you. Don't have the right to cry! Um. I will make it up the time, because if we can keep doing shit, 
while the king doesn't get to do nothing. Uh, then we can get all our health back and we don't have to worry about anything because this guy's a dumb doo-doo baby head. Oh. What? Huh? Wait, 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 what? Is it because of the shield? Wait, why didn't Sifrin freeze in time? That's weird. Is that a glitch? What happened? What? What? Was it a shield? What? What the fuck? Oh, that's cool. I did not know that. Good to know. I'll keep that in mind. Roth. I'm gonna just keep all of Mira's cooldowns off. She needs it. Ugh, okay. I need some buffs. I need some buffs. I need some buffs. I need some buffs. Um, super pretty buffy friend. Turn it up. Mira Bell. Oh, you thought you got to attack, but we get the shield, dumbass! Haha, <laughs> just in time! Fuck you. You're not hot shit, loser. What? Did you send something? Lol. Lol. Uh, reduce the defense of the king for three turns. Um, we'll done heal Sifrin. King sobs. Cry baby, whiny baby, doo doo head. I don't even care. Uh, I don't even care. Uh, I don't even care. Uh, I don't even care. Buddy, no one cares about your problems. Why don't you just uh, shut up and die? Yes, yes. All right, the tears. That's an enemy? The tears are a fucking enemy? I didn't know I could hurt those. Oops, that's funny though. I did not know that was a thing. Oh my crikey. Dude, she keeps targeting Mirabelle, man. What did she do? To do damage, though. Lisa will be up soon, so will Sifrin. I think Sifrin is faster, so... We'll use Sifrin. Yeah, because Sifrin has nothing else, really. So we'll use Crafted Water. Tears do look so yummy. Holy shit, I want to eat them. Ah... Uh... Let's go for a punch, I think. There we go, because now I can heal everyone back to full. There we go, now the tears are gone. Is that enough for this part? Yes, don't care about what you have to say. You've heard this before. That's interesting how that text was coming out. Severin's getting annoyed, man. He does not care no more. I was getting frustrated. Paper mache gloves, did you not use them? They're very useful. All things considered. I used that thing on accident. I forgot I have to use things to keep deals. Ugh. So we I don't want to really reduce his attack yet. I think we're fine for now. I love how timing is used for the text in this game. Yeah, it's very interesting. Oh, it is time, saviors. Ah, oh, shit, I don't have a shield up. I don't have a shield up. Do I die? God damn it, I didn't have my shield up. Shrug. Oh, fuck. Let go. I could go back. Anyway, let's just go back to town. So we should just go back to town then, right? And just get this out of the way. It's been one, two, three. It's past your 20th loop. 20. Is that a lot or too little? Still. 
back to it. Oh, hey, there's a, there's a little savey thing. Hold on, let me do this. It's light, close your single eye. Still in Act 3, but it's okay. We can go hang out. Zephyrin, you're up! Here again, you'd like to make me make sure Mabel doesn't go to sleep tonight, right? conversation. Something like, Hey, Mary, have you thought about doing a sleepover tonight? <laughs> oh, I was actually thinking about it. What do you think? Absolutely, I'll let everyone know. You're right! Talk to you later, Mira. Uh, okay! <laughs> make sure Mabel knows uh, how to shield all against the king. Tell about the carrot method, whatever it is, so she'll be able to cast it. I hope this makes so much more sense! Horrible moving shield. Again, you watch her go. Um, where's the nerd? Oh, the end of the world is all fine, but I really won't regret. I won't be able to know what the last you've seen is. Oh, shit. Oops. No, that's when pure. Oh, crap ass, because I forgot to look at that, too. Oh, God. We'll just teleport back between floors. Oh, I know I can't, because I have to go to fucking floor one for some reason. Crikey. Ugh, whatever. Do I mean I have to do everything all over again? Holy shit. <laughs> the rest of the guns you made back in the end of the world. And how can I help you? Can I help you with anything? Do I need help with anything? This is a friend. Mm. Look for a certain type of book. It's a type of book with a friendly tale. Have you heard of those? Oh, I've heard the Bollinger has one of those. What? 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 Huh? Really? Seem to know how to react. Look at her repeat the same words over and over. Zephyrin, will you come with me to ask them if I can borrow it? It might take some time, so make sure you have time to help me. I have time now. Ignore the above message. What? Close your eyes, close your seat. What? Okay. Let's go then. We're we'll hanging out. The Bollinger. I believe that's you, right? The site says Dormant's Bollinger. Oh yeah, go talk to o Issa with Odil. Really? Where's Issa? He's over here, right? He's not. What the fuck? He moved? He's been moving. Why is he on the move? Why is he on the move? Why is he on the move? Oh, you guys look as thick, look thick as thieves as usual. Are you on a secret quest again? Indeed, we are. Good for you. Nothing like a secret quest to make life worth living. Oh, I'm so jealous. I'd love to go on a secret quest too. Let's go on a secret quest before we part ways, yeah? Oh, I'd love to. A secret quest with you could be fun, Isabo. Huh? Oh, with you, Benevo Deal! Yes, that's exactly what I meant. I definitely meant going on a secret quest with you because you were also standing right here. Yes. Oh, please don't look at me. Uh huh. <laughs> Let's go talk to go to our. I know what you are. Oh, Sifrin, Benevo Deal, on a secret quest again? Again, huh? Oh, sorry. I feel like. I've seen you two on secret quests very often. Like, literally every time we stayed in a town or village. Isabo and I uh, Isabo and I always wondered where you were going. Ah, that's right. You know you'll often visit antique shops every time you went to a new place. Neither of you asked what the other was looking for. Come to think of it, she was probably looking for a family tale. Are you two betting on it? On what our secret quests are about? Oh, I would never bet on anything. It goes against my moral code, madame. But Isabel would, uh, would read a horror book of my choice, uh, if, if my guess is right. <laughs> uh, oh no, you're not going to tell me what your secret quest, uh, quests were about now that I've said we're betting on it. We'll see you later, Mirabelle. No! No, come back! <laughs> Please don't look at me. Hi there. Hello, we've heard you may have a family tale. A family tale? Of a family called Paper Ass. <laughs> Papyrus. If you'd be okay with it, I'd like to borrow it for a little bit. Ah, oh, the one I borrowed from my girl before the house froze. It's, I'm not a very good writer. 
So I figured reading another one would give me an, some inspiration for the store for stories to tell my little girl. Do you still have it? I do not. What? Do you know Anto Antoine? Ant he lives in east of town in a house with no flowers. Asked if he could borrow it. They knew the paperist family, you see. I could I couldn't really refuse. The paperist family died only a few years back, after all. Well, that sucks. You know if he still has it now? I don't see why they wouldn't. I have a sudden bad feeling about this. A house the east of the village with no flowers, huh? Looks like we should go pay them a visit. Never eat. <sighs> Never eat soggy waffles. No flowers. There we go. Oh, hello. Antoine, is it? That sure is me. And you two are the saviors, aren't you? Thank you for all you're doing. Best of luck for tomorrow. Thank you. We got a favor to ask. Can we borrow the family tale you possess? For an hour, maybe? Oh, the Papyrus family tale. Oh, shit. I know this means a lot to you, so... Oh, no, that's not the problem. I'd be happy to lend it to you, but, well... <laughs> I think one of the kids next door stole it from me. What? What? <laughs> Uh-oh, I'm not saying they're bad kids. They're very nice kids. They're very nice. They just... Well... You know the three kids outside? A few weeks ago, they passed by and helped me cook some things, and, well, the book is gone now. So, sounds like we should talk to those kids. Odile's just disgusted. How could this happen? <laughs> we'll get that book, Odile. Ugh, let's just go, alright? <laughs> Who would have the book? Would it be you? Kids! <laughs> the middle of the small head looks at you the small Adults! What do you want? Sifrin, you handle this. Why you? Why me? You're closer to being a kid than I am. <sighs> oh, fuck my nose. Good luck. Okay. You know about family tales? Yeah. What kind of adult doesn't know about fam- uh, What kind of adult doesn't know about family tales? Are you stupid? Man, man, you can't ask adults if they're stupid. Can't I? Look at them. They're short. And their hair looks unbrushed. And they look like they haven't slept in weeks. And that hat definitely looks stupid and not cool. Sifrin, this, the kid is destroying you. Do something. On principle, you don't get in the fight with kids. What to say? Anyway, do you know about the... Ah. Man, and I think he's asking about... Shut up! I got this! The middle kid looks at you disdainfully, as they can. Which is a lot. What do we do? We'd like to borrow it. Trade! A trade! A trade! I have something you you do not knowledge. Offer us something in exchange. Um. What do I chat? What do I do? What do I do, chat? What do I do? What do I do? Chat, chat. Does anyone know? <sighs> of course, it's pun. A pun? It better be the best pun I've ever heard. How do you keep a wizard in suspense? The kid leans a bit towards you, interested. I don't know. How? I'll tell you tomorrow. What? That's not the deal! Tell me! The kid's eyes grow wide, speechless. Manon? The wizard-looking adult? He said... That, that you're a wizard, man. Wow. I know you just said it because it's part of the joke, and I know I'm not a real wizard because wizards aren't real. But I felt something just now. I'll do whatever you ask. We only need a book. Oh, yeah! Um, okay, so I... Man, it doesn't have the book anymore. What? <laughs> Listen, Charlene was being really annoying about wanting, to, wanting it, so I gave it to her and she stopped crying, okay? Who's Charlene? Um, Charlene Choquette? The bur the <laughs> Are you fucking <laughs> the villager's daughter? The what? <laughs> uh, you can't open love. <laughs> Look at the old lady's face. Saffron! <laughs> you jump. We are going. Do not rapidly and follow. 
Bye, adults! Let's play again soon! <laughs> oh my god, no way. Hi! Hello! Ah! Hey! Please do not scare my daughter, madame. <laughs> you got in front of a deal, smiled the girl. Hi! Hi! We heard you had a cool book. A book? Oh! 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 Yes! From Manon! Manon's so nice! She gave me the book! The book with the nice stories! Dad was reading it, and now it's mine! And I can read it all by myself! But it's boring! I want another book, Papa! Wait, which book are you talking about, Charlene? This one! She showed you all the book with the first family tale written all across it. I'm so sorry. It's fine! <laughs> you got the perverse family tale, finally. <laughs> you both are a nice silent place to talk. Oh, this is a new place. Let me drink. <sighs> I can't believe this took this long. But, finally. How do you look at the closed family tale book intently? Hmm? Hmm? Aren't you going to read it? They said I could keep it until I have to leave Dormont, so I have time, but... She's still looking at it. The family tale book you spent so much time trying to find. It seems important to her, but why? Is it related to your research? Sorry, what? The book. Is it related to your research? Ah! Hmm. Well, I suppose I've kept it secret long enough. Don't tell Isabel, right? There is no research. I'm not researching anything. Sorry for not saying anything. Isabeau said I must be researching something since I was a traveler here in Vargard. And it felt... easier. To not say anything. So then why are you... Why did I leave Kabu? Travel for years. All to find myself in Vargard, if not for some intellectual pursuit. Hmm. Well... I'm actually here in Vargard. To find out more about myself. I suppose it's not very apparent to you, but... My mother was Vargardian. Oh. I lived my whole life in Kabu. My father was Kaban. And my mother was Vargardian. I have no idea how they met. He never told me. But all I know is that she never wanted a child. She left very early in my childhood, and I never saw her again. Good riddance, if you ask me. But she left and didn't leave anything behind. No pictures, no letter, no family history. But what does it matter, right? My father was a good man. And Kabu was my home. I used to think I didn't need to know my history about Vargard. But still, a part of me was... curious. And one day, a few years ago, a Vargardian merchant showed me her wares. And this book that she wouldn't let go of. A book of tales written by her whole family. A family tale. And she explained family tales to me. Generations of Vargardian parents writing stories for their children. And writing them down in a book. So you'd end up with stories written by an entire lineage. And she was explaining the way the book was written. The rules of this particular way of telling stories. How friendly families shared their stories with each other. <sighs> oh my god, this is so sad. <laughs> and how it had been done for generations. How it brought her closer to her family. Her ancestors. Her culture. And while she was explaining all this to me, she suddenly stopped. And I was surprised to find out she stopped because I was crying. I didn't even realize it. Because I wanted this. This connection that she had to her history. That was also supposed to be mine. But it was stolen from me. Because my mother left. And I'd never had a link to this culture ever. But I went there. Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. What the fuck? This is why... Hmm. So I traveled to Vargard. And, well, the king took over shortly after I arrived, which did make things more difficult. Wait, why? Every hangout is like this? <laughs> but during my travels with you all, I got to know many Vargardians and see many Vargardian cities. I got to learn more about the country, its culture, its faith, its people, and... 
And I look and I learn, and... This is the country my mother came from. It's half of me, but... But still, even now that I'm here in Vargard, I feel no connection to it whatsoever. I don't recognize myself here. Oh, thank you. <laughs> isn't it strange? Half of me should be from here, isn't it? Shouldn't I see something of myself here, in the place that my mother came from? Shouldn't it be like looking in a mirror? Like a revelation? Shouldn't I see how Vargardian people act? How they think? And be able to say, Ah! Oh, so this is why I'm like this. Shouldn't I be able to call this place mine? But I can't. And it feels awful. Like, like my roots have been cut off without my consent. Like my mother stole it from me. Like I really don't belong anywhere. But this is why I'm here still. To know as much as I can about this country, and in the meantime, find out if it'll make me find uh, if it'll make me find out more about myself. And I did find out more about myself during this journey, so I'm glad. So it's an interesting question, is it not? How much do you carry of your country, of a culture that should have been yours, but wasn't? It may not seem so to you, but Kabu, my features, but to Kabu, my features are foreign. Just small things. My hair being slightly too thick. My brows being too thin. I'm about to be teased for this. My favorite is Isabos. Oh no. <laughs> Enough for me to look different here. I'm other. So. What about Vargardians? Would they see me as one of theirs? Would I find myself in them? After coming here, I found out that... No. Of course not. Why would I? I've never been here before this journey. But at the same time, I'm not the only one who is other. In fact, Vargard is full of people who also come from other lands. Vargard welcomes people from all over the world, after all. So, even if I did not find someone like me, I found Vargard to be full of people that are similar to me. And I am very grateful for that. God, Lilith's half our guardian. I never knew. She traveled halfway across the world to find out more about herself. To see if she'd find herself in a country she has no memory of. What about you, Sifrin? Are you finding out more about yourself in Vargard? Huh? What do you mean? Well, you didn't grow up in Vargard either, right? Do you have roots here? Or were you just passing through? <laughs> My apologies. Forget I asked. I didn't say anything. You didn't need to. Your face said it all. Just because I'm telling you my personal facts about my- uh, Just because I'm telling you personal facts about myself doesn't mean you need to tell me anything in return. It was wrong of me to ask. We can forget about it. She goes back to looking at the family tilk's cover. She'll probably- She's probably be fine leaving it here. Just bearing her story to you and nothing else. But- But you- It's more family moments. <laughs> oh, have fun. I... I don't remember much about where I'm from. Bill turns to look at you. Huh? Were you too small when you left? Was it because there was nothing worth remembering? Nothing was worth remembering. Either. But I can relate to you. Trying to find pieces of yourself wherever you can. Trying to find where you belong. Trying to find how your roots might have shaped you. Which parts of you create which parts of bleh, which parts of you you created? And which parts already were? You know. But you know you're not only made of where you're from, right? If that were the case, everyone in Kabu would be the exact same. And everyone in Vargard would be the exact same. Where you're from matters, yes. But it's not the only thing that makes you you. That's what I realized during this journey, Sifrin. I'm Kabuan, and Vargardian, in ways I do and don't realize. But I'm also myself. One might say that's more important than being Kabuan and, and Vargardian, wouldn't you agree? I do. Ha, <laughs> <laughs> that's interesting. I feel so much lighter now. 
because you found a family tale? <gasps> oh my god, she's gorgeous. <laughs> sorry. Shit, I ruined the moment. I'm sorry. <laughs> yes. And also because we talked, Sifrin. Oh. Ha! <laughs> Thank you for listening to me, Sifrin. You blush and nod. Now get out of here. I have a family tale to read before we all meet for our sleepover. We'll talk later. Go have fun. How do you smile you mischievously? You got a memory of a secret quest. You always remember this. When equipped, memory of a secret quest boosts all of your researcher's stats by 30. Wow. The researcher also learned the skill Craft Break Alpha. Craft Break Alpha is amazingly strong. When used, it makes an enemy weaker to all craft types for a few turns. It's so strong, you'll only be able to use it when you and your researcher have this exact have had this exact conversation. So if you look back to Dormont, you'll have to talk to her all over again. Remember that, okay? You get up to leave, waving goodbye. Oh man, I don't want to have to sit through that again. The thing is, I don't want to go through that again, even if I have to go through it, because like, it's so special to go through that once. You know, I don't know, whatever. What am I talking about? Go to Airballs here, sitting on the bench looking at papers. Hi, Sifrin! Do you need anything? Uh, so which one will you choose? Hmm? Sorry? You pointed at a pile of papers. What? <laughs> what? How? What do you know? Answer me! Uh-oh. She has her hand on her rapier. Y you're choosing someone for something, right? It seems important! Maybe I can help! Clearly, you've never owned a family tale. <laughs> oh, man, I like. I don't know what. I haven't even had, had time to process yet. I just went straight into the next one. Holy shit. Anyway. Hmm. I. I suppose you must have more experience than I do. All right. I would like your help if you, you'll give it. Experience? Sure. <sighs> Thank you, Sifrit. But, um, this might take some time, so, um, make sure you have time? I have time now. Oh, okay! Okay, how to do this? Sit down next to me, maybe. Ugh, you sit down next to me. The girl looks at you without saying a word. She looks worried. Maybe you should take a lead. So what are those papers really? Oh, um... Bonding proposals? Bonding? Like, when you promise to stay with someone forever? Is Mirabel looking for a partner? No! Wait, that's not exactly it! Please stop looking at me! It's more like, um, dating? Dating profiles! I, I'm i not thinking about being bonded yet. Dating? You didn't think Mirabel cared about that. You're still confused. Alright, well, before this all started with the king, I decided I wanted to uh, try to date someone. And so I asked a dating company, and they gave me a bunch of folders of people that I could meet, and that I could date. But I haven't gone through it yet, so I figured I could at least get that done today. And look through all of them, and make a list. Of people I could see myself dating, and... I suppose I need help. I'm choosing someone I could spend the rest of my life with, so I'd appreciate another pair of eyes. Or, um, just one eye. As long as it's not my two eyes looking at this. Um... And also, I need a distraction from tomorrow very badly, so I figured I'd replace my anxiety with, um, with our possible defeat, uh, with, um, this. Oh, huh. Choosing to date is a little out of your comfort zone, but you think you can try and find someone who would fit Mirabelle? Maybe. Let's have a look, then. All right, I have a few profiles right here. She removes an immense folder out of her dress pocket. Is she carrying it with, you, with her throughout your entire journey? Here's a few of them, so, um, we can... You can go first! And tell me what you think! And I'll go after! So, uh... I'm so... Well, well, tell me what you think about him! He shows you a file of a strong, buff-looking man. That Mirabelle's type. We have one of those at home! <laughs> oh my god! We have one of those at home. That's a funny one. What? Do you mean Isabo? You, you're right. <laughs> Is that worth an ew? Either way, it sounds like masculine people are in her type. Probably. Maybe she would like someone more feminine. 
chat. <laughs> Do you have someone more feminine looking? Mm. She looks through her files. How about her? She shows you the profile of a gentle looking lady. She looks nice. She does, I guess. She guesses. So, well, not into feminine people either, apparently. What kind of person are you into then? Oh, I don't have a type. I like all kinds of people equally. But if you had to choose, uh, um, someone nice? You nod. And someone pretty? You nod. <laughs> and someone who likes me? You don't nod. Mira. No, 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 wait, 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 let me, let me think of a bit more. I want someone who... Oh my gosh. Chat? <laughs> well, what about you then? What kind of person are you into, Sifrin? Well, think about how to answer this for an awfully long time, but you got yourself. Wait, are you just going to copy my answers? No! Okay, fine. You got me, Sifrin. I'm not interested in that dating stuff. Oh, that makes sense. But then why? So then why worry about it? You know, Sifrin, the change belief is very, very important to me. It's all around changing. Changing with a capital C. Bettering yourself. Becoming a better, different person. And one of the ways to change is to try new things, you know? That's part of the reason the house offers so many different classes. And so, um, so I'm trying. I'm trying new things. And some are fun and fulfilling and easy. But you can't just go and only try new thing, new easy things, can you? Sometimes I have to try scary new things. Things that make me uncomfortable. Things I don't want to do at all. She doesn't want to do? Like dating? Yes! Like dating! But, but... But you know, romantic love is one of the biggest ways to change. It's supposed to change you, to bring you new experiences, and and so I have to do it, right? To be a good housemate, and I have to do it. I have to date. I have to love someone in a romantic way. I have to do things with them. I have to bond with them. I have to sleep with them. I have to have children with them. I have to love them in a very specific way. Oh, chat. Oh, Mira. Oh, God. And, and... And you don't want to. And, and I don't want to. I don't want to do it, Sifrin. Not at all. Dating, the idea of being in a romantic relationship, of being with someone like that, I hate thinking about it. I hate the idea of it. I really do. The idea of it alone is just so aw it's just awful for me to think about. I can't love someone like that, in the way that I should love them. It never happened, and I don't think it ever will. And I... I need this to change, don't I? No, Mira. Oh, oh stars, this is heavy. Very! <laughs> You're not sure what to say. Maybe, maybe. Well, um... Why do you need to... Oh, fuck. <laughs> because I have to, Zifrin! I'm a housemaiden, and I love it. I love helping people, getting to know them. I love learning new things. I love it all, but I have to change in that way, too. I wish I could just not do it, not be with someone that way. But, Sifrin, there's so much, there's such a pressure to force us to do that. And not only that, there's such an intense pressure for uh, to force us to change. We have yearly festivals all around, showing yourself as a new person, for crab's sake. Most housemaidens have completely changed at least once, and I haven't. Isabo is not even a housemate, and he's changed. <laughs> Sorry, that should that should make me laugh. <coughs> and I haven't. And I don't. I don't want to change. I'm happy with who I am. I'm comfortable with who I am. I'm comfortable with the idea of not being with anyone. I'm comfortable with the idea of staying the same forever. We have to change and bring new things into our lives and change clothes and hairstyles and even part of our personalities to appeal to a deity that, that, I don't know if they understand that sometimes. I just like to stay the same. Maybe they do. Maybe that's why they haven't. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Now, I have a list of people that I could meet so I can fall in love with them, which I can't do. To do things with them which I will never, ever want to do. Also, I can change. And it makes me feel like I, a mistake. And I must be broken for not being able to want these things. Because everyone else can. Well, I don't know about the romantic part. But I don't want to do things without people either. Huh? Why not? It's weird, right? Yes. Farewell takes a hold of your hands. You jump a little, but she doesn't notice. Yeah! Yeah! It's just weird! And gross! It's awful! I don't want it at all! Oh, Sifrin! Sifrin! You mean it? You really mean it? You understand? Yeah, of course. <laughs> what a relief. I have someone who understands this, at least. Oh my god. But it doesn't fix anything. I need to change. And dating... It's part of it, so... Mirabel sighs. Sifrin, I know you don't follow the change belief, but... Do you have something like this? Something that brings you joy and community and faith? But some other parts you don't know how to follow? Some other parts you don't know what to do with? Some other parts just... Bring you grief? Something that brings you both joy and grief. Think about the stars. More complicated than that for sure for me, but... Yeah, I have something like that. So you do too. How? How do you deal with it then? You don't. I just try not to think about things that bother me in general. <laughs> Avoidance, huh? That feels a little too cowardly for me. Ouch. I, I mean, I'm, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to say. You laugh. <laughs> she, You know she didn't mean it that way. Of course not. You didn't, Mir you didn't know Mirabelle held those feelings towards the change belief. She always seemed so passionate about it. The belief she loves so much is also the same belief that forces her into a box she doesn't want to be in. Why doesn't she leave it behind then? I suppose it's not that simple. I don't know anything about your belief, but... You could always game the system, right? Game the system? You can't just give me five bits and then say this is five subs. I'm not resetting for that. Fuck you, cat. Changes things by deciding not to avoid, uh, deciding not to change. If everyone changes in that way, then you'll change by not changing uh, in that way. There's more than one way to become a better person, right? Changing. By deciding not to change? <laughs> Sit, friend. That's not how it works. But no one needs to know. <laughs> if that's not five subs, that is five bits. <laughs> change myself by deciding not to change. Sounds challenging and fun to me. Right now, you mean it. That is not five subs! <laughs> I will not reset for the measly five thingies. It does. It does sound challenging and fun. Oh! <laughs> I'm dying, chat. Smile back. Thank you, Sifrin. Thank you for talking with me. Oh my god, chat. Oh, look at the time. You probably had other things to do, don't didn't you? Go, go! Don't let don't let me keep you. I need to be alone for a bit. I have a lot to think about. I'll see you later, okay? When equipped, Memory of Faith boosts all your house maintenance stats by 30. Wow, your house maintenance also learned the skill Holy Care Shield. Holy Care Shield is amazingly strong. When used, it creates a shield that makes everyone invulnerable to attacks for one turn. It's so strong, you'll only be able to use it when you and your house maiden have, the, have had this exact conversation. So if you look back to Dormant, you'll have to talk to her all over again. Remember that, okay? You nod to Mirabel. You wave goodbye. <sighs> Goddamn. Let's, uh, let's do some equipping really quickly. We're here, you know. 
plus 30 to all stats is crazy, dude. Holy shit. Anyway, I'm sorry. <sighs> Let's just grab this really quickly so I can grab the bomb piece. Hey, Patch aren't you? I've heard about you. Ah, I see. Trying to get some advice from the blind person, I see. I've heard from people in the village that this is a very new development for you. Yes, it happened a little while ago. I see. How are you dealing with it? It's not a while ago. You wouldn't worry about it, so... Well, it's fine. Okay! Well, if you need advice from another blind person, you know where to find me. I go in this room. Open phrase to open it. Right, it's the word change. Chat, we're getting closer to making the bomb. Honey's here, looking morosely at the fields. Honey! Hey, friend. What you want? Can I help you with anything? Help me! But I don't want your help! I don't want your help with anything! You know? I don't! You're stupid and you don't know- and you don't know me, so I don't want you- I don't want you to help me! I don't know you. You really don't! Not even a little bit! You don't even know my three favorite foods, stupid! Okay. I do. Huh? You love... Uh, rice. Y yeah, that's true, but... and... It's pineapples, right? It's pineapples, right? MC Mom. Real watching my friend stream body scene convinced me to buy the game immediately, then there. Oh my god. The last one is. Uh, samosas. What? But which samosas? Yeah, I bet you don't even know that! Which samosas are my favorite, stupid? Is it samosas? Without cheese with potatoes? Y yeah. That's all my favorite foods. Success. If you remember them all, then you. you. you do. Pay attention to me. No, oh, that's stupid. Of course you do. Or else you wouldn't have... There's something you can help me with. Can you come with me? If you have time. I have time now. Okay. Then come on. That's so sad. Bonnie brought you outside of Dormant. I see some weak sadness roaming around in the distance. When I... You said I could ask for anything, right? Uh, you said I could ask for anything, yeah? Not exactly what you said, but sure, whatever you want. Okay, well, I... I need you to teach me how to fight! Oh. I know Deal's gonna say I can help you all in battle tomorrow, but it'll be from far away, right? I want to help! To actually help! And for that, I, I need to learn how to fight. So you're gonna help me! Let's go! Bonnie ran away. Oh, shit. Towards the sadness, you run towards body as fast as you can. Look, look, I'm not scared. Come on. Oh fuck. Oh, oh fuck. Oh, body icons. They're so, they're so silly. I'm not scared. I'm not scared. I can do this. I can do this. Owie. <laughs> body. Stop thinking about it. You strike. Jesus. Breathe in and out. 150 XP received. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, you can't help but yell. Be more careful, Bonnie! Ah! Uh, I... I'm sorry. Look at Bonnie closely. Miraculously, they don't seem hurt. Bonnie is trembling. I shouldn't have yelled. Breathe with me. You breathe slowly in and out, and make sure Bonnie breathes with you. You need to calm down, too. Slowly, they stop shaking. Huh. Hmm. That didn't go super well. It did not, no. It's your fault! You weren't there! You weren't there to help me when I tell me what to do! You frown. I, I mean, I... I'm sorry. I can teach you, but don't go on ahead on your own. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I'll listen. Tell me how to fight. I want to learn. You look around. There's another sadness in the distance. You put on your uh, you put your index for uh, in front of your mouth until Bonnie is silent and pour towards the sadness. 
Bonnie looks over and nods. You jump in. Dun 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 dun. Okay, okay. Ready? Yeah. Yes. What do I do? Smile. Teaching time. You tell Bonnie. Look at the sadness hands. That's a scissor sign, right? So that means they're vulnerable to Rockcraft. Yeah, I know Rockcraft, so I get it. I can hit them, right? You nod. Okay. Okay. Here I go. Take an attacking stance. Bonnie follows suit. Bog. I did it! I did it, friend! <laughs> you clap. <laughs> you breathe in and out. One hundred fifty XP received. Wow. Yeah! <laughs> you defeated the sadness. You breathe out. Bonnie's looking up at you. You look back. Um. Hey, Flynn! Why aren't we? Why aren't we allowed to touch you? What? What? Um. Teal and Zai and Bell said we're not allowed to touch you because it makes you jump, and because they said so. It's true that you jump, but I was wondering why. Cause it means we can't high five or anything. Why? None of them are touching you. On purpose? Because it makes you jump. For such a simple reason? I don't mind being touched or hugged. I'm just not used to it. You're not used to it? Oh! Maybe it's because you're not ready for it when it happens. That's how it is with Neil. Neela? Is it Neil? I'm gonna say Neela, because that sounds cuter. Neela? Neela? My sister! Her name's Patronila. Oh. Patron... Petronila. Patronila? Patronila. But it's dumb, so I call it Nila. She doesn't like it when people touch her, when she and she's not ready for it. Nila's really cool and tough, but she gets scared easily, I think. One day, I touched her on her shoulder, and she didn't know I was there, and she screamed really loud. <laughs> like, ah! <laughs> But then, she said I shouldn't do it again, because uh, when she's scared, and she said her, her scared brain takes over, and she said she might suplex me without meaning to. Which sounds really cool, but she said she doesn't want to suplex me, because she doesn't want to hurt me. She did suplex one dude who scared her once, though. <laughs> so I'm not allowed to touch her if she doesn't know I'm there. So I always try to walk real loud so she hears me coming. That's why my shoes are so big, see? Bonnie points out their boots. God. <laughs> this little child. I don't want to talk about my sister anymore. You don't often talk about her. She's frozen in time, and she's not here, so I don't want to talk about her. She's just talking behind people's backs is bad. Also, talking about her hurts and makes me sad. I want Neela to be here. I should have helped her when... Why aren't you used to being touched? Did your family not hug you when you were a kid? You flinch. I can't remember. Oh. Well, maybe that's why. I'm just not used to it, and it takes me off guard, I think. Oh, okay. So if you can see me, and if I tell you you're, uh, I'm gonna touch you, it's fine? It's not fine, but sure. Huh. Okay. I'll remember that. So! Then... Bonnie just so dumb, making sure you watch him do it. I'm going to touch you now! <laughs> Suddenly, Bonnie pokes you hard in the stomach. Ow! You saw me and I told you, so it's fine! I guess so. <laughs> okay, let's go. Let's fight one more sadness. I can do one more. You spot a sadness in the distance of attack. Oh my god. Okay! I can do this! Watch me, friend! You smile and join body. You and the sadness exchange blows. Bow, bow, bow. Strike. Bow. <gasps> Ouch! Different from usual. You're not used to fighting outside anymore. The ground is uneven, and there's rocks and branches to worry about. Oop. Uh, you tripped on a branch. <gasps> Flynn! The sadness saw you fall and is running towards you in a, to attack. No! Not this time! Bonnie attacks wildly. Oh, fuck, dude. This is getting heavy. <laughs> ah. Ah. You breathe in and out. 150 XP received. Flynn! Flynn! Are you okay? Bonnie is shaking. I'm okay, Bob, but I just tripped. R really? You promise? 
You're not. Okay. Oh my god, that fucking Jesus Christ! That actually got me freaked out. Fuck the the music in the background scared the shit out of me. I. You haven't called me Bonbon bon in forever. Only Zar calls me that now. Oops, Bonnie. No, no, I didn't mean. You promise you're okay. You nod. Okay. Sorry, I got scared. I just. Reminded me of before, that's all. Four. Four? Yeah, you remember, right? It was a while back. When you protected me from that other sadness, you know. Hmm. What sadness do they mean? You can't remember. Which one? W which one? The one that got your eyes, stupid! Oh! Ah! Oh crap, you're stupid! See, I told you! I knew it! You're so crabbing stupid! Oh, uh, sorry, I got interrupted. <laughs> Someone's in the room. You didn't even re you didn't even remember it. You think it doesn't matter? You keep getting hurt because of me. You don't care. You can't see from one eye because of me, and you think it doesn't cramming matter. Oh fuck! This just got heavy really fast. That's right. You'd forgotten. It was all. It was after you all met Bonnie. Before they barely started barely speaking to you anymore. They weren't careful. Sadness was about to hurt them. You're so small. No one else would was close enough to do anything. You're the fastest. So you ran and got in front of them and... <laughs> Why did you do it, friend? Why did you do it? Why did you protect me? I don't understand. You could have stayed put. I could have... I could have taken care of it. I was fine. But no, Fred thinks they're better than everyone else. And you tried to protect me like a stupid crabbing idiot. And you got hurt because of me. Because of me, you can't see from one eye. You have a big scar. And you bump into things all the time. And you trip all the time. And you can't, you can't see because of me. Because of me. Oh, fuck, dude. Oh. It's not that big of a deal, though. But it is. It really is. You got hurt because of me, and, and I don't like it. I don't want it to have happened. You should have stood there and let me be hurt. You would have died. It doesn't matter. If I died, I would have been fine. It would have never been fine. I could never let that sadness hit you. I know you don't like it but when you say you're a child, but you are. And as adults, it's our responsibility to make sure you, you're safe. Fuck, dude. Did you want us to go to your sister and tell her, uh, sorry we didn't jump to save them, and they're gone now? You'll always be more important than any of us. No matter what, we'll always make sure you'll live. I'll always pick you over a blinding stupid eye. But, friend, I don't... I don't want you to be hurt. I don't want you to be hurt. Reassure them all you want. Uh, you can reassure them all you want. Say you're sorry. Promise you'll never do it again. But you would do it again. Again and again and again. But I don't know. <laughs> you're stuck in a time loop. You jump in and protect them every time. You would protect them all every time. Because what's the alternative? Try to find a way to save them without being hurt. What if you failed? What if you couldn't do it? And they did get hurt again, instead. They died because you tried to get a better ending. You can't take that chance. You would do it again, the exact same way, for as long as you need it. <sighs> Fuck, dude. Gosh. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> I'm good. I'm good. I'm stronger now, Bonnie. I can protect you and make sure I don't get hurt either. You promise? You promise you won't get hurt again? I promise. You super promise? Super promise. You super duper promise? Super duper promise. Okay. Okay! 
As long as you promise, it's fine. And, and, oh. And anyway, I protected you just now, right? If it wasn't for me, you'd have been hurt. So, so you can protect me and I can protect you. And we can protect everyone too. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> you see me, right? I'm gonna touch you now. until you remember what to do. Oh, fuck. Slowly, you hug them back. <laughs> ah, fuck! Ah, my heart. See? You do know how to hug. Looks like I do, yeah. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh, my old little heart. Oh, I can't take it. Oh, shit. With memory of training is equipped, your kid will never miss when attacking. Your kid also learned a skill, a uh, billion blows technique. They'll be able to hit the enemy harder during battle. It's so strong, you'll only be able to use it when you and the, your kid have this exact conversation. So if you look back to dormant, you'll have to talk to them all over again. I don't care. Let me clear my glasses. Let me clear my glasses. Fuck. Oh my god. I can't. No, I'm not. My eyes sting. Fuck. Okay. Let's go back to Dormant. I gotta show everyone how cool I am now. You nod. We both went back to Dormant. Oh my god. Ah. <sighs> Equip that one now. Equip that one. Thank you. <sighs> I can't do this anymore. My heart. <laughs> oh my god, I'm in so much pain. Oh, I have to go back to the tree. Okay. He's the most here, probably part of my favorite ass the tree. Lisa! Sif! Woke up on the wrong side of the bed? I get it. Anyway, I was just looking at the favorite tree. Isn't this a cool- uh, isn't this tree cool? You joke. Yeah, it is. Glad you agree! One could say it's pretty. Uh-huh. Tremendous tree. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Yes! You both laugh. Laughing forwardly, so you raise his hand towards your shoulder. You get it now. This is him. Trying to touch you. He freeze. His hand in the air. It goes closer. Closer. His hand. Abruptly stops from above your shoulder. It goes back to his side. Uh, that was funny. I'm gonna go soon, so you can do uh you can do your thing with the tree, but uh do you want to talk before I go? Hey, I finished helping everyone out. Huh? Oh, that's cool. I did see you running around with everyone earlier. It looked like fun! Oh, that's right. You didn't ask him if you needed any help this loop. Well, so do you need help with anything? Help? Oh, oh, uh, oh, yes! I, I do need help with something now that I'm thinking about it! Uh, 
Is that why you're, uh, is that what you're doing today? Helping everyone out? I didn't know. I kept the best one for last. Oh, Seraph. I'm glad. I was just thinking I wanted to hang out with you today, since I saw you running around with everyone. But you didn't talk to me much today, so I was, um, worried you didn't want to. It, it doesn't matter. I'm glad I thought about, uh, I'm glad I thought about what I, we could do today then. Um, are you ready now? We'll probably have to go to the clock tower immediately after we're done. So, I don't think you'll have time to do anything in the village after. So, I uh, want to make sure you do everything you... Uh, I want to make sure you did everything you needed to. You know what now? I'm ready now. <laughs> okay. Well, um, follow me, Sif. I'm going to cry. Follow Issa around for a while. Going through torment then the forest until... <sighs> oh, shit, man. A field. There's nothing around. What could he possibly need? So, what did you need me to do? Huh? Oh, um... <laughs> lay down with me? I lay down. And then? And then, look up! You look up. Oh my fucking god, dude. I'm gonna end my life. <laughs> stars, stars, stars. All around you. You inhale sharply. You know, when you asked me if I needed help any earlier, I wasn't sure what to say. I don't really need help with anything. And I did all I needed to prepare for tomorrow and stuff. I saw you run around and help everyone today, and that seemed kind of fun. And so I thought, Sif's making sure to help everyone today, but I just want to hang out with him. So, um, that's it. That's all I want you to do today. Let's just hang. Oh. Oh. My stars. Oh! Um, so, you wanna know, uh, you know, uh, you know how, uh, you say this word when you're annoyed or something, or something bad happens? I don't know what language it is, but I always thought it was, uh, like a swear word. Like crab. And I looked at a few, few books, and I couldn't find the word anywhere. And I got really curious. And then one day, I heard someone else say it. So I asked them, and they said, it means stars. And it knows you know stuff about the sky. You talked about planets once, and the sun, like you really knew what you were talking about. And sometimes, when we slept outside, you spent most of the night looking at the night sky. And I thought that was interesting, because I never thought about what's up there before. But, um, I thought maybe, um, like, you'd like to see the stars. Together? Or just in general? Fuck, I'm gonna cry. Oh no, was I wrong? Was that really more of an actual swear word like crap? Where you don't actually like stars and stars are bad and gross? Did I step it in? Did I step in it? Did I mess up? No, you didn't step in it. Oh, phew. I got scared. <laughs> anyway, uh, I've heard some people can see stuff in the stars sometimes. Like pictures. They're called... Consta something. Constellations. Constellations! Yes, that. Do you know some? Look at the stars. You don't recognize any of them. No, I don't know any. Huh. You're saying I didn't step in it, but Sif. Change the subject. No, no, you're you're fine. <laughs> Tell me something. Something? Something about you. Oh, okay. Um. <clears throat> well, okay. You know I'm from Juvente, right? I lived there my whole life. It's a nice, big city. More than one house, too. Way bigger than dormant. Big enough that you don't know the life story of every person you see. <laughs> anyway, you might think it's surprising. I don't know. But when I see... Uh, when I was Bonnie's age, I was like... The smartest smarty pets around. Not like slightly smart or anything, but like the nerdiest kid you can imagine. Huh. I have trouble imagining Isabo as anything other than the boisterous man he is. <laughs> like, really imagine it. Big glasses, super neat braids, always knows the answer to any question the teacher has. Always getting perfect grades. Always too shy and focused on grades to know e to even know how to make a friend in the playground. That was me! 
And, um, I didn't really like myself. Because, like, I was smart, but I really hated being shy. Being alone. Not even able to ask a classmate for a pen, because I was so paralyzed by fear. And I was ready to spend the rest of my life like this. One day, after years of living like this, I looked at myself and the way I was, the way I existed in this world. I looked at that kid in the mirror and I thought, is this it? Is this really who I want to be? Couldn't I just be someone else? <sighs> someone that can make friends, someone people could love, someone I could love, someone I f wouldn't feel ashamed of being. Couldn't I just change? And that's one of the things people go to houses for, you know? To learn things, to train, to do body craft on yourself, to change. And you can stay for a bit and come back changed and no one would say a thing. They just accept the new person you've become. I want to live here. So I went to one of Juventus' houses and threw myself into it. Trying to be the coolest, strongest, most dependable person around. Lifting weights. Training my voice to be deeper, louder! Crafting my own body to be cooler, stronger! Looking at myself in the mirror every morning and yelling, I'm the coolest! Now, change is destruction, you know. Bring about change, you need to know you might hurt people. <sighs> might hurt yourself, even. So you always have to be careful and think about whether the destruction you bring about is worth it. I decided it was. So, the person I was before, I made them disappear. Killed them with my bare hands. Made sure they'd never, ever come back. So I could live. Oh, that it sounds so bad when I say it like that. The kid I was before is still here. I just grew around them. To protect them building an armor until it becomes the real thing so I could become strong someone outgoing someone comforting to be around someone I would have liked to know before Meh. it doesn't matter that much I'm here is what I mean and I love myself so much more now that I uh, now that I did before but even the person I, I'm now is a work in progress. I want to change still. I became a big and strong and dependable happy-go-lucky dude. That's who I needed to be. But lately, I've been feeling like I need to let down the airhead facade a bit. Act less stupid, that sort of stuff. It doesn't feel great when people think I'm stupid just because I act a certain way. So I might change again soon and become someone slightly new. That sounds cool, right? Oh, you never knew. Someone wanted to change to become someone else. He did. He must have worked so for so long to make his wish come true. <laughs> I might change to be a mix between a jock and a nerd. Balancing it all, you know? <laughs> God damn it, Sifrin. <laughs> change it to a jared. More like a knock. Sounds better, doesn't it? Better mouthfeel. They both sound bad, Issa. No, don't say that! <laughs> Buff nerd. Oh. You think I'm buff? You quickly look away from him. Anyway, before we beat the king tomorrow and go on our separate ways, I'll, I'll just change into someone else. Someone who can be both strong and smart. Both at once. What a concept. Doesn't that sound like someone cool? Doesn't that feel like someone you wouldn't feel ashamed of knowing? Is that what he thinks? He's, uh... Yes. Yes, if? I've never, I've never felt ashamed of knowing you. Oh my god. Not even a little bit. <laughs> You're gonna make me blush, Sif. And, well... You know I feel the same, right? You're like, maybe the coolest person I know. You know that, right? 
And I really like spending time with you. When we hang out, I always discover new things, like cool theater stuff, or even just something new about you. I like how you always have a pun ready for any situation. How you breathe in this specific way sometimes, and I wish I could breathe with you. Make you feel better. I like the way your face looks when you eat your favorite foods. And I want to know more about you. Talk with you more. Laugh with you more. And... And I... I can't look away from him. I... Oh? Oh, is that a shooting star? Fuck! Chat. God. Come on, dude. Come on! You're robbing me! <laughs> anyway. Hey, look up! I isn't it cool? You look away from him. You look up at the starry sky. There's no shooting star. If you don't mind. Ah <laughs> See, I told you they'd be here! like a dog put me down ah! you heard he mumble to himself about it earlier <laughs> like hi Sifrin hi Isabel we figured you'd be here can we join you everyone is here <laughs> smash froze <laughs> good to see you everyone such a beautiful night was it your idea to come here Isabel it was under the stars huh how romantic. Very well done, Isabeau. Uh, what? No, it wasn't romantic at all! Just pals outing! A buddy's hangout! I, of, of course, would bring any one of you here! Uh huh. I found a food! <laughs> so we can eat here. A nightly picnic! Oh, I can smell samosas! Yummy! Yeah, I made a lot! Twin, take one! Take two, even. You deserve it. Sifrin sure worked hard today, didn't they? Thank you for your help earlier. You jump. Yes, thank you, Sifrin. You've been a great help today. We taught me how to fight! I'll be able to help you tomorrow! Oh, I'm looking forward to it, Bonnie. Zod, did Flynn help you today, too? You freeze. Did you? <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye! Goodbye! I'm done. I'm fucking done. Oh, I quit. Bye! <laughs> of course, Sif me help. Sif help me. Uh, Sif help me today. I'm gonna lose it. My controller keeps on plugging when I put it down. I suppose looking at you, smiling brightly. Thank you for spending time with me, Sif. Hide your face beneath the rim of your hat. <laughs> How wonderful. Thank you, oh great helper. <laughs> Here, have another samosa. And have some pate and bread! I'm sure you want some tea, too. And here's some of my curry! Your plate is overflowing. You see everything in your plate swim back and forth. Do it as much as possible for everything falls down. Oh! You burp. Ew! <laughs> 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 nice reflexes. Nice reflexes, Sifrin. Everyone starts laughing happily. You laugh, too. You're surrounded by your allies. Heart lifts. Love them. You're glad to have sp to spend time with them. You're glad to know them better. <sighs> You're glad. Frit, are you okay? Want some more? Want more snacks? You smile. Yes, please. <laughs> then eat. Eat as much as you want. <laughs> <laughs> Today you're happy. <sighs> really, he doesn't need your help with a quest. I didn't get anything from that. What the hell? <laughs> That's Kate. You play with the orb. Oh, this is Kate, huh? Oh, I guess I can skip through this. Don't forget, I'm with you in the dark. I don't want to be on this planet anymore. 
Doing a nice time yesterday. Hanging out with Hisabo under the stars. <laughs> Memory of stargazing. You always remember this. Hi, Stardust. I didn't want to interrupt before, but you got a new memory. When equipped, memory of stargazing boosts your fighter's stats by 30. Whoa! Your fighter also learned the skill we will win. We will win is an amazingly strong. It's amazingly strong. When used, it boosts everyone attack, defense, and attack speed for a few turns. It's so strong, you'll only be able to use it when you and your fighter have, this exa have had this exact conversation. So if you look back to Dormant, you'll have to talk with him again to... Oh fuck, I'm gonna vomit. <laughs> Excuse me, that was too sweet. Talk to him all over again. Remember that, okay? But hey, Stardust, it was nice, wasn't it? Hanging out with all of them yesterday. They love you. They, uh, they love you now. Your bond with them is stronger now. Isn't that neat? It is neat. I don't want to have to loop back to before you spent that time with them. What would happen if... If you stayed with this version of them until the end? Went through the entire house without looping ahead. Beat the king and saw the head housemaid with them. Did anything happen? Did anything change? Time to walk all the way up and beat the king. I really. Wait, as in I can't loop? Or they're guilt tripping me not to loop? Because I'll happily be guilt tripped into not looping, but. I need to. I need to think. Alright. Okay, I was gonna say, because what if you accidentally get killed by the stupid fucking door? Oh! Oh, up ahead, that's... That's stupid sadness again. That's like usual. It's fine. You're not annoyed or anything. Follow the script. Sadness, huh? Chat, I know it's gonna be like going through the whole game all over again. But let's just like read through the dialogue at least. I feel like Sifrin's deserved it. Chat, what do you think? Should we do the tutorial again? Would anything change? Would anything change? Oh, okay. Nothing changes. Monster time! Let's kill this bitch! Man. You didn't manage to beat the king earlier. But you feel a little stronger. You gained some XP. Yeah, my fault! Man, I need to- I need to think. Also, check all the broken change god statue you find. Oh, okay. Noted. Breathe in and out. 100 XP received. I- I need to process the fuck I just went through. Holy shit. We did it! <laughs> I'm just gonna zoom through this, cause- God fucking damn, dude. Okay, so there's- I know there's a few around here. There's like one on this floor, I think. That's the change god. It's been destroyed. Broken. 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 Huh. Also, check enough of the pillars. If you check enough of the pillars, you get something. Well. No time. There's house to explore. If I checked enough, enough of the pillars. You have to check enough of the pillars. Let's save this. Let's save this run. Let's save this. Not all of them. Oh, can't go back. Oops. Oh, well. Just a lot. Just a lot. Okay. Storage room. Let's look around. Tonics. Small glass containers. You look around. You found sour tonic. Uh, the Bonnie. The Bonnie wants the, the, the containers. Uh. 
Yes, I did do that. <sighs> I'm gonna cry, man. Ugh. This is so... This I'm so... I'm so... <laughs> I'm broken. I'm a broken lass. How long have I been streaming for? Holy shit, it's been like three and a half hours. God bless. Uh, the hangouts are definitely a lot to process and honestly good call for choosing not to do something earlier. Oh. The whiplash would be something. Oh no. Oh, wait, Zifrin! I just remembered this room! It's- You press the switch. Yeah. <laughs> what?! You start walking away. Let's go, everyone. Uh, okay. That's so funny how Zifrin looks like. <laughs> anyway. It sure is a pillar. A pillar. It's a broken pillar. A pillar. Yeah, I will never forget the whiplash I felt when I was first when I first saw it on a friend's stream, and I wasn't even full paying attention the whole time. Oh God, was it that bad? Did that, would it have been more interesting to see it, or would it? Well, I don't know what to think now. I don't want to see things too sad, but for the sake of interest, I don't know if I want to go back. Oh man. What is stop saying next time around? <laughs> I don't like that. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. <sighs> Your girl can't take it no more, chat. Give me that stone. Hmm. I still think of the stone. You have weapons. Those things have a name, but you can't remember what it is. It's a forge, and that's an anvil. Sharpening stone. Oh, ah. And then you pick it up. Sharpening stone. Thank God. I thought I actually forgot. I would have sucked. Anywhere. I feel like it. Oh, wait. I'm dumb. Oops. Oh, thank God. I juked it. Fuck you, bitch. Oh. You'll never catch me. We're moving forward. We're zooming through it. Oh, you fucking bitch. Um. Mirabelle. Man, I'm so depressed. <laughs> Holy shit, man. <laughs> Fucking hell. Why is that censored? Uh. Makes an enemy weaker to all craft types for a few turns. Oh my god. Dude, I'm like going through it. Holy shit. Let's just kill it. Boom. Oh, it made a link. Even if it tests my patience, I kind of do want to just go through it again. Holy shit, my emotions. I never thought a game would make me like backtracking! Fuck, dude! This is a good game. Stop attacking Isabel, you piece of shit. Uh, die. Oh my god! <laughs> uh, the attacks on the hangouts have special art. Really? Oh, I will go check after this. Well, I'll check when I do a battle. Hey, a little statue. It's a figure of the change god. It's been destroyed. Well, thought it'd be interesting if something happened. Various board games, craft game for kids, fishing game, checkers. Checkers! I love checkers! If you're gonna change God. I've just looked at that, I'm stupid. Some books. One of them is a very striking cover of a voodoo clay figurine with a large sunken eyes and a screaming mouth. Spooky. 
Interesting. I don't know what that is. But here. Doors locked tight. Uh, storage, storage room room. What? Uh, let's go inside then. Yes, look at all these vials. Look at all these vials. Oh, yes, look at the collection of vials. Oh, yes, I love things. It's been destroyed. So, I guess I can't. Is there something? Why am I looking at all these statues exactly? I'm not entirely sure. I mean, I guess I'll figure it out, but like, it's weird. Anyway. Oh my god. Look at that. Oh my goodness gracious! You'll know when I've checked enough? That's great. Noted! Noted, noted, noted. Why did I go into my Isopo uh, voice for a second? I have no- Ah! The fucking hands! I hate these things. Please don't kill Isa. Okay. Um... Crit, 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 crit. Damn. Unlucky roll. Oh, these things are so tough. It's so lame. <gasps> what the fuck? That's so cool. That's so cool. That's so cool. Oh, that's so cool! <laughs> that's so cool. What the fuck? That's so cool. Buddy! Yay! <gasps> oh, <laughs> I'm gonna ball. I'm balling. Only Bonnie had one, but they cannot use moves. Yeah, that makes sense. Wait, is that foreshadowing? Are you lying to me? What are you talking about? Bro, they are just going for the wrong person every single time. These dumbasses die. Oh, this... I don't want to... I don't want to go through this again! Oh, I hate this stupid loop shit! Oh! This is so frustrating. I'm actually so frustrated. Because I, 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 like, I know there's going to be another loop. I know there's going to be another loop. And I'm going to be so fucking destroyed! I'm going to be so fucking decimated when I have to go through another fucking loop and they all forget everything! <laughs> SHUT UP! STOP SAYING THIS IS IT! I KNOW YOU'RE LYING TO ME! I KNOW YOU'RE LYING! <laughs> you're lying! <laughs> you're lying to me! You're lying to me! Stop trying to trick me! It will not work! It will not work! It will not work on me! I am aware of what is going to happen! You do not have to try and trick me! You are lying to me! How dare you lie to Schmeagol! You lie! You lie! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, two crits, holy shit. <sighs> Why, but it didn't matter! Oh, I got the star crest, uh... <sighs> I mean, once I get to the second, I do have to do another loop, though, because I have to go down the other paths. Ow. <laughs> Sifrin, did you just really hit the counter and... I said, yeah, who cares? Whoa. Frin, are you... <laughs> you angry? <laughs> How comedic! I don't believe you. 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 Huh. No time. I don't believe you. You may try to trick me. You may try to trick me all you wish. But I understand. I know what you're trying to tell me. There's cookies in there. Give me those cookies. I want cookies. Cookies. They're frozen in the time. Fuck! Bitch, I forgot! Oh, how fucking vile! How dare you do this to me, you fucking bitch! Uh, storage, storage room, room. Oh, come on. Oh, thank you. Thank you for getting baited by my simple schemes, you fool. Shit. 
Bonnie puns. Oh my god. I don't want to do this again! Why does this game hate me? Why? Oh my god, I, it's just in my head now. It's just in my head, because all I can think about after this is like, <laughs> but what if we loop again? What then? Oh. Everything we just went through for what? I can get the bomb now. That is the plan. The plan is to get the bomb. The plan is to build a is a to build a bomb and blow up the king. Fucking bitch. I just got this already. I'm dumb. But I was resetting aggro, so actually I was really smart. Uh yep, I'm very intelligent. I was never book smart, I'm money smart, makes me more intelligent. I got hella bands. Like a Mega Man. I was never book smart on money. That sure is a book teller. Makes me more intelligent. Oh, get juked! Nerd! Two sour tonics. Give me the money for safekeeping. In the closet. It's full of wax colored sculptures. It smells like wax. Craftonomy book. Oh, what is this? Craftology book? Pierce a craft. Create a craft. Where's the craft? It's a craftonomy book, not craftology. This one's about the study of craft. Your fortune. What about the study of craft? Could I have information about timecraft, maybe? Hmm. Is everything about timecraft? Time timecraft? What for? Hmm. It is It is related to our situation, isn't it? With the king? We don't have time. What's timecraft? I don't know what it is. Should we have a crash course on timecraft, then? Ugh, fine. It does have a section on timecraft. All right. So, timecraft is as the name implies. Did I do this on accident? Is, was this, like... Was this on accident? The music is sounding like this is important. Did I just do this on accident? Chat? Oh my god. No fucking way. So, timecraft is as the name implies. The power to wield and craft time itself. It's a type of craft that's been hypo hypo uh, hypothesized to exist for decades, but its existence has never been proven. Until now, right? Stop in time. That's what the king does, right? So the king is using timecraft? The king most likely is, yes. Which wouldn't make it uh, the first time in history someone managed to harvest that power. Outside of stories told in family tales, that is. I've heard scholars outside of Argot are really excited right now. Timecraft is confirmed to be real. So they're happy because you force people in time? Well, it's more complicated than that. Morals aside, it does change everything. We knew about timecraft. Think about how timecraft could be used. The king is only stopping people's time, but it could be used for many other things. It could be used to hasten or slow people's time, too. Maybe make other people's bodies younger or older. Maybe make buds grow into trees in an instant. Worst case scenario, it could be used to change history itself. Crafting time to go back in time and change history! Whoa! Whoa. The possibilities are endless. And terrifying. Definitely not the kind of power you want in someone's hands! And definitely not someone like the king. And, correct me if I'm wrong, but... Crafting time wouldn't be like crafting clay to a specific shape or crafting a sword. Those are easy enough to do and won't tire you out, but crafting time... Something as basic and essential as time? Wouldn't it ask for immense amounts of power? Exactly. Crafting clay barely asks for any power of the uh, from the user. But crafting time. It was theorized that crafting time, even to pause time for a second, would probably kill the user immediately. Huh? Kill them dead! Kill them dead. And yet, the king is still alive. So it raises the question. What gave him enough power to use timecraft without dying? How did he learn to use it? Good questions, Isabel. You have a pretty smart in you have pretty smart in insight sometimes. I sure do. Huh. I'm crafted so the king uses it so it's and it's dangerous. Excuse me. Got it. I suppose uh I suppose my throat just gave out. I suppose talking about this was useful. I'm surprised you're curious about this though. Sifrin. You shrug. Timecraft, a type of craft that allows the user to control time. Isn't that what you and the king have been using? But neither neither of you should be able to use it. Using it would have uh, would ask for immense amounts of power. So then, what gave you this power? Maybe you should ask the king about this. And 
You still need to go talk to that housemaiden. She seems aware that you were looping in time. Maybe she knows why you're able to use timecraft. You need to talk to her. Regardless, I think it's time we kill the king. We put we put him dead. We put him dead in the ground. Is there something I'm missing here? Oh, I grabbed this. Salty broth. Well, I need that. That's useful. Wait, there's a statue in there. I can't talk I can't touch the statue though. Sad. Oh well. Here's a key. Yes. Okay, it's someone's drawer. How fascinating. Is there anything else in here I'm forgetting? Uh, some papers, some papers, some papers, about the king. You should keep this in mind for later. Can barely read what's on it. Some papers, some papers, about the king. You can keep this in mind for later. Okay, noted. Uh, I don't need to look at those. Small in comparison to other games. It's only 40 songs, really. Undertale Yellow is like 100 something, apparently. That's a game I also played recently, which. That's crazy to think about. Mori has a 170 is crazy. It makes sense though. Should I I should be grinding, I think. Makes sense to grind at least a little bit. There we go. Yeah, Undertale is like a hundred. I know Undertale Yellow has like oh, more songs than Undertale, which is crazy. Although it does have like a whole, I think it has like a, like three different unique and co like complicated endings. Yeah, yeah, Isa, I think it makes sense because they they definitely w utilize the resources they have really well. It'll work. Dun, 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 dun. Ouch. Yeah, because they're very big games. They're very vast in comparison. Even though Undertale's kind of similar, where you go through similar areas over and over again, the areas are really big, and there's a lot of shit to do in there. Also, I think it just makes sense for Tobuscus Fobuscus, you know? Because he does have he does have a lot of um Wow, I didn't even get to use for special. Yeah, but uh, Tobuscus Fabuscus does a lot, like, in terms of music. I remember all the Homestuck stuff, and uh, there was the Noise Master theme from Cucumber Quest, which I am, like, one of 12 people I know who remembers Cucumber Quest, because I'm an old fart. Alright, chat, we've saved all our progress. Yes. I'm going to have to probably loop over and over again in the coming areas, so... Yeah, I'm talking about Toby Fox. Yeah, the Tobuscus Fobuscus is an inside joke. Some, I actually, I don't think any of those viewers are in this chat, but it is a joke that I have made on a different channel. Tobuscus Fobuscus? I forgot what it was. Oh, it's because I was talking about Amori. There's like a fucking um, Toby Fox composed song in Amori. Big balls head. Big balls head! Wait, something's happening. And then it does the thing. Paper. Nice. This is Sifrin fight. I guess I meant smallest teas. I mean, like, the game refused to use the same songs a lot, and yet they don't do it good. Exactly get tiring. Probably assume it's current craft type. You need help, Sifrin. Let me know, and I'll analyze this enemy. Uh oh. No, don't attack Odile, you bitch! Alright, crit, 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 crit. Oh, 69. We will win! <laughs> Boom, baby. Music sounds very silly and picks something. Change to rock, really. Bonabelle, go, child. <laughs> we all craft types, bitch. 
You're not getting away from this one, fucker! Why would it sound pleasant? Very Uh, I don't think, I think it's, I don't know, when it comes to an indie game, I can't really blame a soundtrack for potentially getting repetitive, but. God damn it, Pastel. <laughs> we did it! Victory! Alright, let's keep moving. Let's keep moving. We want to get out of here, don't we? We want to beat the king. We want to, uh, you okay, Sif? I really don't think we'll have another switch inside a pillar. Yes, I think we're using the same. Ta I think using the same same tactic twice would be quite stupid. What if one of these calls had another switch? You can't take the chance. And if not switches, they might have something in them. You've got a memory of pillars. You always remember this. If you have the memory of pillars equipped, examining pillars might give you some cool items. Which is a little weird, I got to say. Why would you find stuff in them? I don't get it, but that's how the world works. Yay! My current memory. I actually don't know what my different memory is right now. Memory of looping, plus five max HP every loop. Oh, no wonder. Looping to the king, you have the knife key equipped. One way to go, get times through your memories from defeating a normal sadness. Victory is meaningless, but it still feels good. Auto attack up at the start of battles. Paranoia starts the P, randomly find items when you interact with pillars. Castle's full of keys. When interacting with a locked door, get directions to where the key is. I see why I was using that one. Uh, I think I'm okay with memory of looping. I'm okay with memory of looping. Sure is a pillar. This room feels different than the others, doesn't it? It's missing a threatening pressure the rest of the house has. Shall we take a break? It's snack time, bitch. Uh, we'll skip to this right now. Okay. Again. Plantain chips, cookies, onigiri. Now choose, choose which one you want. Uh, don't worry, I have enough for everyone. You'd like a cookie. Yeah, some cookies. Do not make Bonnie sad. Thank you for this. Uh, it, oh, it's so good. Thank you, Bonnie. Mmm, so good, Bon Bon. Feel refreshed, invigorated, and alive. <laughs> huh? <laughs> That's all I wanted to see. <laughs> <sighs> Uh, they do? Good to know, holy shit. I hope everyone is alright. People in Dormant. Yes, but the King's Curse probably got to them already. It was so close when we arrived a few days ago. Even if we decided to go back, there'd be nothing to come back to. So all we can do now is... T tell me a joke, Sifrin, please! To get my mind off things. Make her smile. I had a meeting with Plum today. A plum? Like the fruit? Yes, that meeting was- Oh, let me guess! Uh, fruitful meeting. Oh no, was that it? Sorry for stealing your joke. Nah, you got it. The fact that you stole my joke, Mirabelle. What a pitiful experience for me. You kind of brought it back. <laughs> Chuckle along with her. Hey, Sif. Let me guess, you're still hungry. I can see it on your face. One half of this cookie? You really would. <laughs> yes, please, Mr. Amazing, Wonderful, Funny, Buff Isabeau. Ha <laughs> ha! Sif, you can't just say that! I really have a- I really have the heart of a delicate maiden, you know. You have to be careful with me. Yeah, you feel awful about the cookie, too. Uh, I hope I didn't make Bonnie too upset earlier. Look at Bonnie way, uh, Bonnie's way. Bonnie is stuffing their cheeks happily. Never mind. That's stupid. You can't be friends. That'd be like being friends with your mom or your sister. Which one? Uh, which which one am I? You're my cousin, who I see once a year, and we have a really good time. Oh. And <sighs> yeah, we'll save you. Chat. We are saving Act Three. <sighs> I'm killing myself. <laughs> Are you ready? Ready. All right, let's go. A pillar. 
pillar. I really should just get the pillar one at this point if I'm just gonna keep checking these fucking pillars. Uh, this way. Then I have to get the bomb. Bomb parts! Yippee! There's something in here. There's the desk. Search of the change card. It's been destroyed. Broken, broken. I don't know why I just throw some flowers. I smell like flowers. I don't know if there's anything else I missed. Am I just getting the tier item now of all times? What do you mean the tier item? There's a tier item? A sadness, another weird one. Another weird one. Another weird one. Weird one. Weird. But die. Ugh, nostalgia attacks. Pop. Which one's this one again? Shit, I don't remember. Oh, okay. Oh, shield. Yep, found it. Dun, 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 dun. Really? We're touching him 30 times? That's crazy. In a while, Rockadile. <laughs> oh, wait, what? It lived? And then body killed it. Okay, thank God. Thank you. You're such a little, little baby. Star crest in your pocket. Yay, another crest! We should be uh, careful about where we use this one. All right. Oops. I just went the right way. Oh, because this gets you the key for the other one. God damn it! Fucking Yowie hands. That Sifrit's at eight hundred and eight health. Holy shit! Knife to meet you. Okay. Well, that's a decent enough damage. Super Sparkle Heal. Uh, your turn, Sifrin. Give me a crit, give me a crit, give me a crit, 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 crit. A girl can dream. It's very strong. Yes, it feels that way. Jesus. Bonnabelle. Nice. Oh, 354. Hello. Wow. And super attack. And now everyone's healed. Boom. Um. Boom. God, he's so cool. You fucker. I hope you die in a fire. Um, slow. Not really worth doing damage if it doesn't lead to a potential synergy, which is more important to me. Anyway, die. You breathe in and out. That was an XP received. He's supposed to now level 47. Odile is now level 47. I forget that Mirabelle levels up a little slower than the rest for some reason. I don't know why. It's very strange to me. Not that I... I mean, I think it's fine. Very unassumed by them. And then she pulls up... Uh, she pulls up with the, the, the funny, and then she does uh, big damage at the boss. They really hate her swag. I don't understand. Paper punch! Alright. Odile should kill him. We'll just use paper three to be safe. Goodbye. You're breathing in and out. Or paper the third? Is it paper the third? There we go. Lovely moving cure. I guess that's why, because lovely moving cure is kind of like... I guess that makes sense, because Odile is old, and she's more experienced. Almira is kind of a worrywart mess. But also, Mira's skills are just a lot more useful. And her as a character, she's like just immune to a full-ass status effect, which is kind of OP. <laughs> if you really think about it, it's kind of OP. Bunny! They're so awesome. Thank you, Bunny. Very cool. Mm -hmm. 
That's so true. She's like the, um... The crouch... What is it? It's like... It's like the hidden badass trope or something. That's what she is when she does her big attack. Okay. Well, also, she's just got MC powers to prevent her from getting hit by that. Which is funny. Dun, dun. Goodbye, Yowie Hands. Fuck you. I don't know why... Why, do, why are they called Yowie Hands? Why do you guys keep calling me Yowie Hands? I don't understand. Am I just stupid? Or am I old? Hmm. Yeah, this is technically Mira's story, even though Sifrin's the focus character. He just got caught in the situation, but this is Mira's story. This is her quest to saving the kingdom. It's just we got stuck in a stupid loop. This is literally a side quest. Oh, give me a crit, come on. Oh, two crits, wow, that's crazy. I don't have the thing equipped, I don't know why I'm looking for items. Uh, super sour tonics given the body for safekeeping. Very big plants. While passing through, you take a deep breath and... Oh! You gently poke her and she pokes you back. Your cheeks feel warm. Guarding supplies and... I think that's gone. Uh, I think there's nothing else in here. <gasps> you fucking Freddy Fazbear! If I knew it was going to chase me, I would have gone back inside. Dickweed. How dare you. Alright, whatever. Die! Kill. They're such besties. It's so funny. And it's cute. I love found family chat. It makes me... want to end my life. <laughs> the change has been destroyed. Oh. Sifrin, are you curious about the change god statues, perhaps? Oh, um, I just wondering why they're broken. That's the king's doing, isn't it? They're statues of the change god, and the king wants to freeze Vagard in time, so maybe the king wanted to make a statement. Look how useless your god is, that sort of thing. But only the faces are destroyed. Normally, you destroy the whole statue, right? The face important deal. Oh? Yes, um, so every statue we've seen so far is made by a different crafter, artist. It's kind of a cultural thing to craft your own change god. The change god is always changing, always different. And we all have our own version of the change god in our brains. The change god is always depicted wearing the same clothes, so they're at least recognizable in a way, in that way. But their face is always changing. I think the change god has like a thousand eyes. That's how I see everything. Uh, that's how they see everything, sorry. I've heard someone say the change god had sewn their own mouth shut, unable to tell us how to change, and leaving it to us poor humans to figure it out. I had a dream they had dimples! And, and, since it was crafted by us, it's supposed to represent our connection to the Change God. The Change God, by their very nature, doesn't interact with humans much. Except for when they bless Mirabel! Ah, uh, yes. B but by crafting the Change God's face, we get linked to them in, this, in some small way. And some people can uh, even get to communicate with the Change God through the statues they made as well. Oh, really? No, not really. Yes, really! I met someone who talked to the change god when they finished their statue. Was it in a dream, maybe? Because you know that doesn't count. <laughs> anyway, that's why the statues are different from one another. Interesting. So it's a cultural tradition to make your own statue. But it's, but it's a connection between you and the change god. How do you connect with your god, madame? We make shrines for our gods, and everyone shares the shrines. Sharing gods! Interesting. Now that you know more about the statue and the change belief, maybe you should check uh, Mirabal's statue once more. Oh, that's the head mouse hater's office. The housemaid's office. Ba 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 ba. Move forward, we grab the key. So, this is where the key is, I believe. Head housemaiden. She can tell me whatever's happening to you. Maybe you should try asking what she knows. Pick up the key. Not the rock key. Key in your pocket. I should change God. That's right. Broken, broken. Is there anything in here? Some notes about the king. How's, that's not what I meant to look. 
wonder why they call him King might have given him more time. Right, but King is the name that he chose. Maybe that's something you can ask him about. Oh, okay. That's actually good that I'm collecting information to ask this stupid guy, but I feel like it's not going to matter. Bum, 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 bum. I haven't really softlocked myself yet, which is funny. I thought I would at this point, but you never know. Uh, well, I did that one time, but that was because it was a literal coin flip. It's different, it's now level 60, holy shit. That's crazy. Dead guy. Uh, thing in here. Book is full of random books from novels. Wrong book. Dumplings! I remember dumpling recipe. I want dumplings. I love dumplings. I keep getting DMs. DMs from who? Let's check really quickly, chat. We're in the middle of the downtime period. Ah, I see. That is what they were asking about. Where's my OBS? There we go. Ugh, scratch a search in there. If I recall the dead, so they're not going to fix it. I just remembered a funny bug in the game. You can try it out when you get to the next sack sequence. What is the glitch? A bug? Secret passage. Ah, it was secret passage. I think there was something in here, right? They're not. I could have sworn there was something I could have gotten in here. I just wanted the book. This book made me learn a skill. This must be it. I'm taking it. Why do you take the book off the hill and open the random page? Oh, it's a cooking book. I'm talking about carrots and stuff. What? Let me see. Ah, oh, no, that's the carrot method bonbon, not carrots. Oh, the carrot method. Ziff reminded me of it yesterday. That's how I figured out a new. Uh, an Figured out that nice new shield skill. Huh. That's so. I smile awkwardly. Ah, your new shield skill! They show it in this book too, look! Oh, they do! If Sifrin didn't teach me yesterday, this could have been useful. But I already know it, book. But I already know it, book. Sifrin taught me, book. And it'll protect us against the king, book. Huh. Look away, maybe you shouldn't have elected this bookcase. Oh, this book mentions shields that reflect attacks too. Those are so complicated. I wish I could figure it out someday. Uh, what? What? Hello? I press family teller. Interesting. Everybody looks at your way. Very interesting. You look away. Oh, shit. Oh shit, I didn't know that was a thing. Oh fuck. <laughs> Very interesting. Ding too. Oh wait, there's that's what I was looking for. Vials! I want to fight the king with vials. Is this too, ding too? Because I thought she was kind of like figuring us out after the uh we looked into timecraft specifically. Which, you know, to me is like I don't know. What am I talking about? What's in here? Did I go in here? I just want to reset boss aggro. Because I'm so smart. I love breaking game mechanics. I remember that for some later loops. For kind of sus. I don't want to fight the enemy again. We're just going to blitz this dialogue sequence. Hmm? I'm so confused. But you know what? We're slowly figuring it out, chat. That's the whims and beauty. My fucking mouse is here. Get out of the way, you dumb fuck. Dun, dun. Oh, it's still chasing me. Sucks the suck, loser! Bye! Okay. I shouldn't soft lock myself, because I've already been up there, and there's nothing really that interesting. Unless something else appears, but I fucking doubt it. Right? 
There's nothing else, right? I'm just gonna ask for confirmation now. There's nothing else up, right? I don't have to keep doing that. Chat. Go down. Okay. Yes. We will not forget such a terrible slight, Sifrin. We will not forget. We will not forgive. May you eat only potatoes for the rest of your life. May your house fall down on your horrified face. At least for now. God damn it! Nothing else. I can't tell if, like, you... Uh, at least for now is a fucking foreboding sentence. Die. Ow. Die! Damn. Die! Yes! <laughs> at least not for now. Sorry, I can't even read my own foreboding sentences. Jesus Christ. Book number three. I don't need book number three right now. Uh, no time. And then I, since I got the carving stone, I just... By the way, I still have a little wood carving of me you made, Sifrin. You do? Of course! Why wouldn't I? It was so very cute. You know, I'm so still so jealous Sif made you a wood figurine. I could curse you and your entire family name. Then curse me, coward. I will one day! <laughs> and then you'll be sorry! Oh, I'm so scared. Look, the frozen in time. Look, the frozen in time. Look, the frozen in time. I will one day. <laughs> Owie, stop attacking me, you stupid bitch! I'm healed now. Yes. I will one day! It's different time. Alright, it's different to kill one hit. Have to meet you, bitch. There we go. Oh, crit! Nice. Nice suit. Nice suit. Nice suit. I believe there's nothing here. So door locked tight. Locked by one of those weird locks. Or storage room. room. Worth a try. Wait, what? What kind of fucking door is this one then? Wait, so what? Words? Yeah, it's just need to say the words aloud. I think it's a open phrase. An open phrase. Fascinating. Phrase for this lock. I do not know. Ah, so it's locked. Yes, Yahoo. Well, I wish I knew the open phrase for that one. It doesn't even tell me where I could find that one. Which sucks. But okay. I, I, what can I do about it? It's probably going to come up later, and then I'm going to feel stupid for not knowing it then, but really, it's- how could I have known it? Because it wasn't an option. It wasn't an option! Oh. Wow. Wow. Yowie. I'm vulnerable. Oh my god. Wasted its turn. Bunny! <gasps> Yay! Oh, my attack and defense is boosted. Nice! Isaglar is so good. I love that. I love that portrait so much. Oh, chat. It's the slog. It's the slog. I didn't do everything, right? I did. I did everything. Okay, I'm just trying to make sure I remember everything. Bam, bam, bam. Do it then, coward. I will one day. It's actually good that we're grinding, because then we can get some XP before the next floor. Like, I'd like to at least have some of the better skills in the game. At least that I've seen by the time I get to the next floor. It'd be nice, you know? It'd be nice. Punch. Smack. Um, it's so crazy this is only Act 3. Holy shit. Oh my god. <sighs> There's still, like, at least three more acts I've heard. 
There's like six acts in this game, which I don't know if they're gonna be as long as Act 3. I've heard they're shorter, but... Or they could be longer, who knows? I don't fucking know, I'm just assuming they're shorter. But I realize that could also just be a lie. La 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 la. Yeah, 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 yeah. You can keep doing that all you like, but I already know your secrets. I know your truths. Two sadnesses, get ready, everyone. What if I just talked like I talk in, like, um, what's, uh, if I talked like Odile's voice, like, but in real life, just like in general, I just use that voice. That'd be cool, wouldn't it? Maybe. I don't know. Would it be weird if I keep talking in a British accent the entire time? And I'm not even British. I don't know. It's a thought I've had. It's a thought I've had. We will win. Not say it's one I'll commit to. Fuck, I did the wrong enemy. Oh well. Let the Odeal spirit take over. Maybe. I don't know. Would it be weird? It'd be weird though, just speaking in like a different. Uh, lovely moving here. Ooh, thank you, Bonnie. Oh, I did the wrong enemy again. Fuck me. She gives me held in the soldier from uh for back when I got I, I guided somebody for through Mori knowing what was coming. Oh shit. The short hand one is doing something. What? Oh, so that's what happens when you Oh crap! It killed the other one! And healed itself in the process. That's what it would do. Anyway, good to know. Uh, we're moving shield for the buff. Fuck you, nerd. Uh, we'll go to Mira's turn again. And you, pretty buffy friend. I don't know. It'd be weird though if I just talk like this all the time. People would be like, "Oh, are you from? Are you from England?" And I'd be like, "No, I'm not. I just do this normally because I'm actually mentally ill." And they'd be like, "Oh." You're one of those. <laughs> I don't know where this bit is going. <laughs> I do kind of wish I had that suave, femme fatale kind of voice, though, you know? It'd be kind of... Well, for lack of a better word, hot. But, you know, that's different. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. Don't worry about it. I'm actually fucking insane. And not well. In the head. Uh, this is the floor. I think I get the bomb part. I'm just, I didn't miss it, did I? Bonnie has a crab face. Give a thumbs up. So mean, Sifrin. Good. Um, okay. And then we say, we agree. We agree that we're going to let Bonabelle live. Don't take the pineapple. Why? Oh, because... They're going to want the pineapple, and they're going to be like, Why did you take my pineapple? You're so mean to me, Flynn. I hate you. Be like, oh, sorry. I forgot it was your favorite. <laughs> mm. Am I really getting reassured by a kid right now? <laughs> well, if Bon Bon is saying it, I believe it. You and Bonnie will protect us? I, I won't accept such a one-sided promise. If you both protect us, we'll protect you both too. We'll protect each other. Indeed we will. You may be allergic to pineapple. Oh. Don't worry, Bon Bon. Don't worry, Sif. Well, there is, okay. If they say anything different, they're saying something different right now though. <laughs> we'll all fight and we'll all live. Not smiling. So, to make sure we have enough energy to protect each other, isn't it? Oh, it's snack time, baby! Yeah, I have, um... Some more ma- some Madelines! Madelines? Thank you for making some, Boniface. <laughs> I also- I also have... Some pineapple- some pineapple slices. Uh, they have some sugar on them. Just plain pineapple slices? With sugars, ah! That's what makes them good. And pineapple's really good, you know? I don't know if I want to bug it. <laughs> it is, it's just not very exciting is all. Exciting? You want exciting? Then eat this! And it's the fish head. Hell yeah, Chad. Fish head! Fish head! Fish head! I have fish head. Fish heads are yummy and the texture is different and good. 
Are they? Yeah. Okay. So which deck do you guys want? Would like. One fish head, please. There you go. Uh, in words of Sif, spicy. Wait, do you see me? I'm gonna touch you now. Honey slowly raises their hand and slowly moves it towards your hand and slowly pats your hand. Good kid, good kid. You didn't even jump that time. Good job. You did such a good job. You laugh. Sifrin. Sounds good. <laughs> Sorry, I just wanted to say your name. Mira. Sifrin. Mira. <laughs> Sif. No! What? Sif is my Sifrin nickname, Mira. You have to pick a di you have to pick another one. I'm sorry. I won't budge on that. Shem's alive, Isabo. I, I I mean What? But you and Sif and Shem Mira! It's not fair! Mm, that's true. Alright, in the spirit of fairness, we can join we get joint custody of Sif then. You know, I think I'll pick another nickname for Sifrin after all. <laughs> Thank you for talking to Bonbon bon yesterday. Huh? Why? Why? Well, because you managed, uh, they managed to look, uh, look you in the eye earlier, that's why. Didn't think it was gonna happen anytime soon after the whole incident, I guess. Uh, about my eye, you mean? Well, yeah. I always felt you didn't really care about what happened, but Bonbon's a little, uh, Bonbon's little, you know. Even if they felt like you didn't blame them for it, it's still a lot of emotions for a kid to handle. But knowing you, you probably thought Bon Bon hate was started hating you for no reason, yeah? <laughs> Figured. I guess I should have talked to you about it, but it didn't feel like my place. So that's why I'm glad you two talked yesterday. Good job, Sif. Good job. Here, have a Madeline. You feel patronized. You take the Madeline. <laughs> eh, deal's looking at you. Uh, ah, never mind. Leave me alone, I'm reading. <laughs> She's getting suspicious! Chad, she might know! She might know! <laughs> Good job, Pissifer, and have a pineapple slice. Goodbye. Are you ready? Ready. Alright, let's go! Oh. Wait. Do you hear that? We've gone through this whole thing before. Found a key on the floor. Pick it up. Empty key. Keep your day one mask of some kind. You put the empty key in your pocket. Well, I'll check your location. Guess get ahead, but. It's covered in King's hair. This thread is so strange. I can't seem to move it aside. Frozen thread. Seems to be covering the rest of the floor, too. Oh, it didn't work. Attacking out of nowhere like that. So scary, Sif. Indeed. Didn't seem to have done anything to thread. Oh, wait, look, it did something. It's slightly dented here. So a sharper knife could do the trick, maybe. House. Oh, yeah, and then it just goes through that dialogue. Interesting. Oh, well, I'm fucked. Oh, unless... Oh, no, I'm fucked. I gotta fight it. I figured there might be something different there. Anxiety. That's so funny. Escape. <laughs> Alright, chat, we'll move forward. I believe. Oh, but there's a room here. I'm gonna go to. Uh, Pepper juice. Give it to money for safekeeping. Broken finger in the change god. It's a broken finger in the change god. Broken finger in the change god. Secret passage, right? Huh? Secret passage? You all into the secret passage. That's just a hallway. Somehow, I feel like we're wasting our time, but I suppose we might as well see where it leads. And then we go see where it leads. And inside is a mysterious room. And the statue of the change god. It's been destroyed. Broken, broken. I believe there is books in here. Nope. Drama. Uh, is that something new? Did I just miss something? Oh, well. Captain Waters. What the? Jackpot! Hey, look, a dream catcher, I think. Looks like a dream catcher, which is cool. I like the dream catcher. Dream catchers are cool. Really? I have a dream catcher in my room, which, uh, I haven't dreamed. Or I've dreamed sometimes, which is weird. Like, 
I, I used to dream like all the time and have a shit ton of nightmares. Then I got this dream catcher like 10 years ago and I only have like four or five dreams a year and it's really strange. I don't know what to do with that information about how I've like not had dreams. And I think it's the dream catcher's fault, but we ball. Or Le Neelay ran away from home. Bonnie was too little to remember. Oh, runner papers are different. Oh, well, that's okay. Oh, such a cute photo. I love that. Now we have the key. Smiling key. Which, if I remember correctly, we're supposed to... So this is one of those paths I think I can go. Should I do that this loop, or should I do it again another loop? I feel like it'll matter later, so I won't do it now. Unless someone in chat objects to that idea. In which case, I will probably do it now. Another loop? Okay. Do it non-family loop? Come. Gotcha. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Change God. Plus, oh, two salty broths. You can the money for safekeeping. Hurry wheels. My dog is barking. Non family, comprende. See, we'll have to make non family loops. Oh, that's that's my room. Huh. Give me the pieces for the bomb. I also want those broken news. Attack, pick it up. I want pepper juice. Why don't you introduce him the body for safekeeping? Uh, I don't think there's anything else in here if I recall. Important papers inside. Um, does it have the books? Castle 68, Dice Maker, why don't you raise the die hard? Oh, 68. I should remember this number. We did 68 before and it wasn't the right number, but we have to go to the library to go to the other one. Uh, here's the key. Breaking your pockets. Uh, change God, destroyed. Craft your body. Wow, so well, I've studied. Apparently, they made some big strides of body craft recently. Before, it took almost a year to make a big change. Now, you can change in a month or so. Interesting. Crafting your body is so accepted here in Volgard. In Kabo, using craft on yourself would be grounds for prison. Prison? But why? Because if you craft your body to your liking, where's the limit? Take the king, for example. They say he crafted his body to become so massive he can destroy houses in a single gesture. That's without mentioning his mastery of a timecraft, too. Oh, but that's... I'm not saying Kaboo's correct. I'm just telling you to their point of view. Plus, it's not like there aren't ways to do bodycraft in Kaboo, if you know where to look. Oh my, Madame Odile. Were you part of the underground resistance? I'll never tell. Trans woman? Resistology? Miles. Guys, is she a trans woman? Do we have trans woman Odil? Is this canon? Are we are we in canon territory? Interesting. She'll never tell. That's true. We'll never know for certain because she doesn't want to say shit. I find that so quirky. Sprouts. So quirky and based. This fucking door. Not confirmed, I believe. I mean, I'm gonna be honest, it's pretty stated. Like, I don't know, I think it might just be like, where's the library again? Fuck, I don't remember where the library is. You know what, I think I'm about to go there. Yeah, it, it, also there was other dialogue before the movie realized, oh, this is a trans man. You know what I mean? It's not like, it's not, okay. It's not quote unquote confirmed, but they're really not trying to hide it. And if anything, it's super, it's confirmed. Oh, sick. Oh, that's, hey, that's even better. I love trans representation. If that isn't obvious already. <laughs> 
sort of guest chat that I like trans representation. Where's the library again? I genuinely don't remember where that fucking thing is. Oh, no, I was just there. Wait, no, I remember where it is. I'm actually just stupid in the head. Chat, I'm dumb. That was not the right one. Yes, it is. Paper time! That's awesome. Chat, I think trans people are pretty cool. What do you guys think? This is actually my way to get people banned. <laughs> Chat, give me your thoughts on trans people so I can determine whether or not I ban you. <laughs> uh, we have fun here. I love trans people. You are not getting banned. He is a trans person. Huge, huge. Hell yeah, bro. I I love seeing that shit. I love trans people. Chat. I think trans people are cool. As one of them, they would say, I am, in fact, very fascinated with the concept of the transgender individual. Yowchies. Oh my fuck! Trans man Isabeau, hell yeah. You know what we love? We love gender euphoria in this world. I think more people should be granted that luxury. It's not the library. The library again? Am I stupid? Did I... Did I not go back to the library? I just when I was there. Was that on the last floor? Wait, am I dumb? Fuck. I forgot what the book was, though. Which is the most important part. Oh, where's the book again? I don't remember where the book is. I thought that was on, um, floor two. Clay room? Oh, is it in the clay room? Shit. I'll go there in a second. Whatever. Consider this grinding. Yep, we're grinding. That's what we're doing. Uh, crit, 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 crit. Damn, would've been nice. Uh-oh. In the clay room? Gotcha. My fault, chat. My fault. I would apologize, but I feel nothing. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. Kill! Kill! Unleash the scissors attack of destiny! Breathe in and out. That was an XP received. Your bell's now level 49. I'd like to maybe get to level 50 before we fight the king, but I don't think that's possible at this point. Playroom. There we go. It does? I didn't even see it. My fault. Clean dirty hands. An issue of curing statue 87. Issue 87. You should remember this number. We oh, yeah, Civ is sad now. <gasps> no! Well, I'll, I'll be able to see it in coming fights. Not this enemy! Nope, definitely not this one, though. It's nice to get some grinding in, though. Nice to meet you. Die. See their EXP? Oh, let's do that. Oh, uh, level 49. That's not profile. Um. Holy shit. Next level. Goodness, 7,000, 4,000, 4,000. Man, they level up so much faster. And then body doesn't level up at all. Little baby child. They're so goopy. Time. Ooh. Yes, phew, we got lucky. We did, huh? It's gonna make me fight. Oh, well, maybe not. I somehow juked it. I'm so good! Wait, over there, isn't that a bathroom? Seems so. Let's go to the bathroom. Bathroom. Bathroom! Bathroom! Mm. Close the bathroom cell door. You like coming here. Because you know you'll be able to be alone for a bit, but you almost feel like going outside right away right now. 
Huh? Why? You feel weird. Even though you're stuck in a time loop and you don't know how to escape yet. You feel happy. You feel happy. Why do you feel happy? Is it because you're helping everyone right now? Hearing them out, helping them with their problems. You've talked to each one of them, learned more about them as people. Talked about things with them you've never talked with anyone. Siffy. It was embarrassing a bit, but it makes you feel so warm. It was nice. Even though you're not friends. Even though you're just allies. Oh, don't say that. That's how you become closer to people, right? By helping them out. So maybe right now, they like you better than in previous loops because you helped them. And, and, okay, this will sound silly. Maybe that's all you need? To break the loop? That's stupid. You're stupid. Don't even think about it, or it won't come true. You smack the side of your head, focusing on the pain. Stay focused. Stop thinking about the best case scenarios. Stop thinking about your allies. Stop thinking about how they don't see you as a friend or anything. No! Sifra! <laughs> That's so fucking miserable. They don't see it. They don't see it. He's such a dumb fuck. Well, I don't think there is something in this room, but it's crabbing dead end. There's a dead end in here. I'm so fucking annoyed. How dare there be a statue? I hate the statue. Shrouded in. Join them. You wish for rest. Yeah, I'll come back. Found the key knife. Sifrin? What are you holding there? A knife! Did the change god give it to us? No, no it can't be. I, I think they did. With it, we can. Whoop. Wah! Teleported back to where it all began. But what the. That's Floor three's entrance! A change god beamed us here! That's. Well, at least we don't have to backtrack. I'm not gonna ask questions. Thank you, Change God, for the spoon. Thanks, Change God. Thank you. Thank you, Change God, or expression, or whichever deity gave us this knife. Thank you. Uh. Sharpening stone. Sharpening stone. Apply to key knife. You can have a sharpening stone and mumble repeatedly. Please be sharp, please be sharp, please be sharp. Please be sharp! Please be sharp! Please be sharp! Well, it's shop now. You got the key, knife key. Knife key, uh, pocket to equip later. We are going to equip it now. Knife key. Did I forget to equip the gardening shears again? Oops. I guess somehow I forgot. That's my fault. I did not mean it, but I fumbled. Knife key is like the only direct upgrade. That's crazy. Makes sense, though, considering you needed to beat the, the shit out of the king. Actually, before we move along, I'm going to go to the bathroom really quickly. I'll be right back. Alright, I have refreshed myself. Now time for apparently the best scene. Well, we're about to find out if this holds a candle and you guys are not just lying to me. I'm sorry, why are we back here? Madame, are you saying Sif was wrong to bring us all back? Room we already searched top and bottom because there's only one thing here? Madame, you're so weird. Mirabelle's intact, uh, intact statue of the change god. You look a little closer. Try not to make a face and fail. 
Can noses look like that? Can noses look like that? Wow, that left eye is somehow above the right brow. I can't tell if this must be smiling or frowning. Mira, Mira, help us roast this statue's terribly made face! Uh, uh. Oh, fuck. Mira? Oh! Uh-oh. I was trying to make them look gentle and nice. Mira, we're so sorry! Sorry we said your statue sucked! No, no, it's fine. I'll get my revenge against you all someday. You all shudder, but... Statue is a link between the change god and the crafter, right? I wonder what would happen if Mirabel touched it right now. Mira, can you put your hand on the statue? Hmm? Um, sure. As soon as Mirabel touches the statue, you hear something. Choo! What? What? Huh? What? Where are... Mirabelle and you got transported somewhere. Something, someone's there, Mira. Huh? What? Hello? The, the head house made it? Uh. <laughs> Mirabelle! I can't believe you can't recognize me. They changed shapes? Yeah, yeah I did. Don't you know who I am? Someone who changes shapes? No, this can't be! You're- And she got it. It's me, the change god! What? Why do they do these fucking- What? 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 <laughs> oh no, 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 no. I didn't mean to make you cry. I messed up. Oh, change god. I- I'm so sorry. Sorry? But for what? <laughs> emoji for so many things for being useless for not being willing to change enough for lying and making everyone believe you bless me for oh that i don't care it's fine don't worry about it huh if i was mad about it i wouldn't have helped you earlier right but i did i did it because i am rooting for you helped us earlier do you mean the knife the key knife okay it has a name and you should use it but yes that was me it was? So... Oh, housemaiden Mirabel, I'm about to tell you something really important. For many reasons, you won't remember it after I send you back to your quest. Well, your brain won't remember, but your heart will! So listen. It's true that as much, the cha as, much as the change gods, I can't help humans much. Mostly because I don't wanna. I can't help with your petty struggles for survival and stuff. But it doesn't matter. Even my little... Because even my little god powers are nothing next to yours. The real cat power comes from you, Mirabelle. If you decide you can change, that's enough power and belief to do anything. Uh, don't even need some silly witch wills or anything. Like some other beliefs out there. Look how far you've come. Without me. But if that's not enough for you, then look like the know this. What? You are loved, Mirabelle. I see you changing, even if you do not. You are always changing, always evolving. You are not stagnating in any way. Even if you were, that would be fine. Because life is about changes. <laughs> but also, it's also about staying right where you were, are sometimes. Change God insulting Sifrin's belief, like, out in, like that out of nowhere, what's wrong with them? I am proud of you, and I love you. And I love that the stupid, ugly face you gave me, and I won't ever let anyone destroy it. Remember that, okay? <laughs> oh, she's crying. Thank you, Change God. You are nothing like I was expecting, but I would expect nothing else from you. <laughs> oh. Here, well, Change God. Somehow, your belt looks so much less burdened than before. Oh, oh, I want to do this. You got a memory of me. When equipped, it'll do... Ah, uh, who cares? I don't know why you need to remember things so much, weirdo. Um, what? Mirabelle tilts her head side confused. Oh, crap, look at the, look at the head tilt. Look at that head tilt. <laughs> the, house, the head housemaid of yours is white. You really are so stinking cute, Mirabelle. Oh, um, all right, that's it. That was your god call.
Good luck, Miravel. I'm rooting for you. I love you. Bye. Beams you away. Wait. Mirabel disappeared. Where did she? And yo! Sifrin, no middle name, no last name. Sorry for not talking to you. This was all for Mirabel's sake, you understand. Her side quest. You know all about side quests, don't you? Plus, I know you don't really care about me. <laughs> but hey, it's not every loop you get to meet a god. It's not like yours will ever really talk to you. So I'll give you some words, too. Uh, I'll say them through the face of your little sponsor buddy, too, for the effect. Hi, hi, hi. <laughs> sponsor. And those words are, I have seen it all. What? Pitiful traveler, walking through time, going against the very nature of this world. This ridiculous, never-ending play. It goes against everything I stand for. I am the change god. My domain is the future itself. The possibility of it. And this is what I have now. Dormant repeating. Dormant unchanging. Stagnating. A crime against life itself. But you don't want to be here either. You could change it. You would. So. <laughs> you misunderstand. What? The events unfolding right now may go against my very nature. But it doesn't mean I'm not enjoying myself immensely. This pocket of time may be rewinding. But you are not in this bubble where everything stays the same. How will you bring about change? How will you change? I... I just can't wait to see more! I'll keep giving you the knife every time, so don't worry. Keep going! Keep changing! And keep giving us a good show! Bye! Wait, what? Nope! Bye! Hangs up the phone! You stumble. Whoa! Hey! Mira, Seth! Are you two okay? What? What happened? I don't know. You both started looking weird. Like... Like you were about to faint or something. Are you both okay? Can you stand up? You Mirabel nod. Yes, I... I feel like... I feel like I saw something incredible. Huh? I... I don't remember it anymore, though. You do still. If you're good, we should keep going. Yes, yes, let's go. But then, who was phone? <laughs> what? What? I'm so confused. The fuck? The fuck? What do I say to that? What? What the fuck? Go ahead and send it to me. I, I so... What do I... You know, I was wondering, like, the king clearly closed his door and put these in our way, but uh, the locked doors weren't they? Yes, we were wrong. They were most likely locked by the residents of the house. The house was attacked. No one... Oh, it's... I didn't know about that. I forgot I read it before. It has been, like, a week or two. Another strong sadness. We should... Let's go, everyone! Let's kill it. Alright, chat. Let's move forward. I'm gonna see what I got sent real quick. Let's see here. Owie. 
So with your honey and you're making out, when the phone rings, you answer it, and the voice is, is what are you doing with my daughter? You tell the uh, you tell your girl, and she said, my dad is dead. And then who was phone? <laughs> what the fuck does this mean? Chat? I have no idea. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, Change God is host of group therapy in the group AU. Who was phone? Then who was phone? World may never know. Wait a minute. Hold on. There's no way it'll let me do this, right? There's no fucking way. There's no fucking way it let me do that. There's... Hold on. Oh my god. That's so fucking funny. <laughs> no way. Sparkle heal now. I need to heal until. That's so funny. I can just punch it like this. <laughs> That's so broken! No way. Holy shit. Oh my god. Oh wait, let's go for crits. Let's fight for crits. <laughs> That's so fucking funny! <laughs> There's no way. That's so funny. Rose printed glasses. Level 50. And learns Shining Life. Isabelle's now level 50. Odile's now level 50. Wait a minute. Oh, thing change! I'll be able to help out more. I've never got this skill before. Oh, that's crazy. What a creep, your housemaid and will be able to use Shining Life as a skill, even if she isn't at level 50. Shining Life is a skill that revives a KO'd ally. Yes, we won! Let's- Come on, everyone. Let's keep going! Mira. Alright, chat. Now I can build a bomb. Oh, and then we get to Claude. They're sadly dead. Dialogue is new, by the way. Oh, okay. Uh, someone this far inside the house? Who? That's... Mira slowly breathes in and out. That's my roommate, Claude. Oh, oh Mira. Uh, no, it's okay. I... I figured it'd be the case. If she was in the house, she'd be as close to the head house being as she could get. But you can get to her in time, could you, Claude? Mirabelle. Are you okay to continue on? Yes. Like I said, I was prepared for it, and we still have the king's butt to kick, so we can save everyone, don't we? Indeed we do. Let's go ahead and kick it, that crabbing king's butt! He will know I hit him! <laughs> oh, no breakdown. Mirabelle's roommate. Her eyes are open. Resigned. It's only something tightly in her fist. You kneel down. Small vial of secret ingredient. You got the secret ingredient. You put the vial in. All right, bomb time. <laughs> this would be fun. Bomb time. <laughs> you got memory of bomb. You always remember this. If you have this memory equipped and loop back to the king, the bomb will magically appear in your pockets. Oh my god. The safe room. Let's rest for a bit, shall we? This might be our last chance to breathe. Oh, and then she's not upset. Well, quite look Mirabelle's way, trying to make sure she's alright. Must be different somehow. Hey, hey, Mira! Everything good? Oh, um, yes! I got a little fired up, fighting that sad uh, that big sadness earlier. But I feel better now. I... <laughs> I'm doing breathing exercises. To stay calm. Ah, yes. The fabled Sifrin breathing exercises! Told you he wasn't doing it for no reason. It had to help somehow. <laughs> Yes! Thank you, Sifrin. Mm. I'm gonna cry. I need water. And thank you for yesterday, too. Oh. 
I don't think I'd be this calm if we hadn't talked. Huh? Ah, when you two spent some time together. Yes, we had a good talk. It helped me realize some things. Oh, I'm glad! Nothing like a good talk between friends to feel better! It seems you were hard at work with- uh, it seems you were hard at work yesterday, weren't you, Sifrin? Helping me out along with Bonnie and Madame Odile. And me! <laughs> I suppose that's what friends are for, isn't it? To help with important things. Friends? Ah, oh, Are you all friends? You traveled together, ate together, laughed together. So you thought it made you- f and so you thought it- it made you friends, but it deals at the same time every, every same thing every time, doesn't she? Are we friends? Huh? Um, yes. You said it once, didn't you, Odile? Huh? I, you remember, every time you stop for a snack break on floor one, she says, she says, you said we weren't friends. You said we were allies, colleagues at best. Uh, did I? Odile, how could you? I don't remember her saying that. But sadly, it does sound like something she, Odile would say. But she says it every time. Every blinding time. Wait, did she even say it this loop? You stopped for a snack on the second floor. It was all different. Maybe it was all different then, too. Allies, I don't. Well, that does sound like something I'd say yes. I don't know if I consider you all my friends per se, but the five of us are just very different people with different goals and thoughts. Our age difference makes it difficult for me to see you as friends. After all, why would an old lady be friends with a preteen? Oh, it's just strange. So, no, to me, we aren't friends. I mean, I thought it's absurd to me. Way to bring down the morale, madame. I'm not done. I don't think we're friends, but... Oh, fuck. I skipped the dialogue on floor one, by the way. I thought it was the same! I guess this happens when you zone out. I would do anything to protect all of you. Horrible things, to be honest, as long as I could be sure you all was, you were all safe. And I think you'd all do the same for me, for anyone in our little group. So... Friend... No, so friends doesn't fit to me at... But... But we're family, right? Huh? Oh! Yeah! We're family! Like me and Nile. We stay together. Eat together. We say good morning and good night. Family... I have a difficult relationship with that word, but yes, family fits better, I think. Family. What a lovely word to describe a relationship to each other. I already thought of us like that, but it's kind of awkward to say it al aloud, isn't it? It is, a little bit. We don't know what tomorrow or even the next few hours have in store. So while we're still together on this journey, we might as well say it. Say the unsaid. Especially since Sifrin over there seems to think he didn't. I didn't care about him. <laughs> I didn't care about him. You... Don't know how to react. All this time, you were trying to keep in mind what she said. That you were just allies to each other. But... Odo reaches over and ruffles your hair. I don't think so hard, Sifrin. Quite honestly, it doesn't seem seem to work out very well for you. <laughs> so mean, madame. <laughs> Sifrin's hat's all lopsided now. You look funny like this, friend. You readjust your hat, hide your face. <laughs> they all look at you smiling. Oh. I'm gonna cry. I'm bored. Snack time! <laughs> I have. Um, I'll start with the waste one. Leftover samosas. From yesterday's dinner. Yeah. They're the ones I burnt. But I thought I should keep them in case we get super duper hungry. Don't be mean to the burnt samosas. They were delicious. They really were. They're not the worst of anything. <laughs> okay. Next one. I have... Palmiers! Palmiers! We all know palmiers. They're yummy. They're crunchy. They get crumbs everywhere. Moving on! And um, the last snack! Okay, I've never tried it before, but I think I cooked them well. Ta-da! Malanga fritters! Huh? What are they? They're fried malanga and garamin. Well, malanga is some kind of root and garamin is some kind of pumpkin. This smells heavenly. So, which one? Which snacks do you guys want? You'd like longer fritters. There you go! Bonnie hands you them the longer fritters. Everyone starts eating. Longer fritters again. The novelty's faded a bit, but you're happy to find them again. You bite into one. Mm. <laughs> After eating your snacks, everyone's health has been restored. As you eat, you look at everyone. They're smiling. Happy. 
times, one of them sees you looking at them and smiles at you. In this moment, you were loved. Oh, fuck, dude. You know, I have a good feeling. We'll definitely kick the king's butt. Kick the king's butt? Kick the king's butt! <laughs> All right, everyone, let's finish eating our snacks. We have a king's butt to kick. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Let's save our- Wait, hold on. Before, uh, before we move forward though, I just want to record all the process. Let's save this. What? We'll allow that. Why? Is that not allowed? I need to make that Discord sound again. Sorry, girl eating burger. I don't know why auto- I think it's girl eating. I don't know why that's- Sorry for messing up your hair earlier. I know you don't usually like to be touched, but I think you needed it this time, right? You stay silent and readjust your hat. If I can help with anything, Sifrin, just let me know. You and I are very private people, but we need to learn to open up every once in a while, don't you think? We're family, after all. <laughs> I don't think I can. Open up, you mean? <laughs> of course not. As I've said, it's not a skill we're very good at, but... No, that'll always be here, if you decide to do so before we part ways. You don't say anything. So, Sif, Sifrin, buddy, do you want to talk? What about? Oh, okay, we're ignoring the whole thing. Sure, that's fine. We can do this if you want. We also ignore how you are acting weird, and how you stop smiling every time you think we're not looking. I'll give you one last chance, though. Would you like to sit down and have a talkie-talk? About what just happened? No. Nope. Okay, no problem, but when we're done, and we've won, and we eat dinner tonight, having beaten the king, before we go our separate ways, we will have the feelings talky-talk. Ha! Huh, you snort. Sure thing, Isa. Oh, you said sure. We are, we, we are gonna have this talk. Can't you? You're stuck now. You will be emotionally vulnerable. Don't you have another talk with Isabel planned? I believe we have that... Okay, so this one I do remember. We never had this talk, so... <laughs> that first talk? What? Isabel freezes in the middle of a sentence. <gasps> yes that other talk! The one I said I would have at the... Last night at the clock tower after we went back! Yes! Oh, okay, so they did do that. That talk, yes, uh-huh! Two, two, two talks, if... One talk each, we can get through this! As long as you're shaky thumbs up, striking game went back. Sifrin! Would you, perhaps, accept a comb? Is your hair that bad? You nod. Put your hand out to receive the comb. Uh, actually, would you, perhaps, allow me to brush your hair? You... You nod. Oh, that's completely fine. I just thought I had since... Wait, you said yes to getting your hair brushed? You nod again, slightly farther. You hear someone gasp and curse. What's that about? Quick, quick, sit down in front of me. Do it, quick. Do it. <laughs> Sabo, holy shit. Finally, I can repay the favor. You did my hair so wonderfully a few weeks ago, so I'm glad that I get to brush your hair in return. I was surprised you had experienced taking care of uh, kinky hair, too. Uh, look at your hair split everywhere. You should take better care of it. Such a shame. It's such a nice, bright shade, too. Will you dye your hair again? I think you should, uh, should let it grow out. Light hair suits you so well. You can barely hear what she's saying. Since your hair, uh, getting your hair combed feels nice, you can feel your tension in Mirabelle's, f uh, in Mirabelle's fade as she takes care of you. Mirabelle chatters on for a few minutes until... All good! You're ready for the king now! Yes, we do have a be- We do have to be beautiful to, in <laughs> to appear in front of him. We do, madame. Got to appear fierce. Of course. <laughs> Mirabelle smiles at you. What? What is it? Are you still hungry? Here, have some of a longer fritters. Bonnie fills your cup, uh, cup hand with fritters. Eat them, okay? You look weird. I think you're out of cal calories. <laughs> calories. I think you're out of calories. <laughs> calories. Tastes good. <laughs> you know, you know, I made them for you. Thank you, Bon Bon. <laughs> <laughs> you're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not good. 
feel family member. <gasps> oh! <laughs> I can't. I can't. Stop saying that shit. I'm glad this is all working out. Yep, can't wait to die. The king must be up ahead. Are you ready? Ready. I should probably try to give Sifrin a proper voice instead of just doing my normal voice. <laughs> Might be a good idea. Okay, I've got to readjust myself! Ugh! Uh, we don't have to hear him talk again. Fucking annoying ass one. Do you remember? Remember you. Is that so? We shall fight. And we shall see which side the universe favors. More powerful. Our attacks will hit harder against the king. Going out for this part? Yeah, dude. Beat his ass. Automod, you suck. Get ready, everyone! King waits. Ooh, I hate you! King. So you're using Timecraft? Timecraft! I suppose I am. But if you're using Timecraft, how did you manage to control it? Timecraft should be a me should use immeasurable amounts of power that no mere human could have. So how? Ha! Yes, it is true. I could not have harvested Timecraft on my own. So, I had some help. Help? Who would? Oh, oh! Isn't it obvious? The universe would. Ha <laughs> ha! I only had to wish for it, and the universe delivered. Universe? Who is that? A person? No, nah, no. Nah. It's. It's. Wow, it's on the tip of my tongue, but I can't seem to remember. It's. What's beyond this plane, correct? What's in the sky? You clench your fist, the king sobs. <laughs> oh! Ah! Uh, I knew our guardians were ignorant of it, but I did not think travelers from other countries were too. How? How could you have... Our guardians, huh? Interested choice of words. Are you not a Varga from Vargard yourself? Is it, Madame Odile? I feel like I've seen an article about it somewhere recently. I saw it today. Where was it again? So you're not from Vargard, but you still want to freeze it in time? What do you call home, then? The king flinches. He does not answer. You shake your head and breathe out. An article about the king somewhere. Mirabel remembers it. Might have seen it somewhere too. Could it be somewhere in the house? Asked the king. Why call yourself king? Oh, oh, I have. I have decided my will is more than just the will of Vargard. Vargard doesn't know. No one knows what I am doing, what needs to be done. They do not understand. Someone who selfishly does what it needs to be done against the will of the people. In Vargard, such a person can only be called king. So you know, you know what you're doing is wrong. Then no one wants to be frozen in time. Against the will of the people. Yes, against the will of the universe. No. Is it, it is not wrong. Our will is not wrong. What am I getting Discord messages about? Oh, it's another thing from earlier. I'll check later. I just want Vargar to stay like this. Forever. 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 Ask. Gives two jackpot points instead of. Oh. 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 That's interesting. These two do that thing. Okay, cool. Uh, here we go.
There we go, now we can use all of our skills against it. Hmm? Did you now just realize about the Sifrin's other type skills? <laughs> yeah, I didn't know. <laughs> now it gets two stacks. Oh! Oh! It is time, save yours. DIE! Ouch. We survived it. Everyone okay? Oh. Oh, you're still here. Good. Let us fight to the death then. Butterbell! Yahoo! <gasps> Makes all family members! I hate this. I hate this. Let's do this the easy way. <sighs> Alright, chat. Uh, done here. Uh, we should all have to do this, actually. Uh, there's nothing else I can really ask, huh? Let's guard. Paper Alpha 5. Goodbye, bitch! <gasps> all out attack. Oh, I saw that super sad. Oh, why, little baby? <clears throat> Zone out for this part? Yes. I don't care about you, King. I hate you, actually. Don't have the right to cry! King doesn't answer. Uh, holy cash shield. Look at that. We are so strong. Look at this. <laughs> Moron. We will win! <laughs> um... In a while, Rockadile. We'll do this. Let's go. Hey, Buffy friend. I don't want to fight anymore. No, you dick. I just did that. At the time, go faster. Smash! Oh, I should have done the other one. Oops. Uh, don't really have a lot I can do here. We'll just guard because I'm building a rock. Cries. Ouch. Uh, unheal. Look at Lisa. Slow him down. Should probably salty broth Mira sometime soon. I'm thinking about it. It's next on my list of things to do. Here's get in front of the king. Okay. Uh, we'll actually use this opportunity to build up that shield for later. I feel like I'm gonna need it coming up soon. Smash! In a while, Rockadile. Oh, hello. Welcome to the stream. Right, we'll go back to papers for now. It's probably the best call for now. Ah, oh, fuck. You've heard this before. <laughs> go, Bonnie, go! Nice! They're not gonna miss anymore, huh? I set this up because I know it's coming. I feel it's coming. Stupid fucking king attack that I hate so much. Boom. Oh shit. I might have to do another Mirabelle skill. Oh, you're right, bomb. You are at that point, huh? Bomb time! Bomb time! What the? Oh my god. Crab, yeah! Yes! Take that, king! Oh, that felt satisfying. <laughs> Go, buddy. 
Uh, break, break, break. Get weaker for me, why don't you? I'd appreciate it. Um, uh, two more. Some more Odile damage. She does a lot of damage. Paper craft A. Good alpha five. <clears throat> Zone after this part? Yes. I've heard this before. That's that just a dumb baby idiot who froze the country in time for a dumb baby idiot reasons! Your turn. Sounds like there's nothing else for me to add, huh? So all you need to do right now is just disappear. No. No, 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 no! Disappear! 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 Oh my god. Disappear! No! You attack the king with all you've got. You all attack the king and hit as hard as you could. Thunderbolt's attack brings the key to his knees. No, I can't! I can't disappear! Not yet! Not when! I still can't say it! No! Stop saying for real this time, I know you're lying to me. <laughs> We're about to go through misery! It's 12.21, holy shit, I've been here for fucking hours. <laughs> no, it's okay, don't worry about it. They can lie to me all they want. <laughs> I'll, I'll get used to it. I'm happy to see them happy. We did it, Mirabelle. <laughs> we did it! I'm just gonna zone through, through all this, because I've already seen this before. Let's go see what Mirabelle's up to. Whoa! All right, I forgot how she's scared of heights. <laughs> Matter with you, so scared of heights. Taylor, <laughs> change god statues. They're moving now. Something does happen when you walk to the edge. Oh, I didn't know that. Head house maiden, Mirabelle. It's more. That's the head house maiden! She's so tall. He's on the all this. Here again. Last time you got here, you looped right back to the start. After talking to the head house maiden, didn't you? The loop is breaking when you talk to her. Does she know why? If you talk to her, the time loop back again? But you managed to beat the king, didn't you? Together with your family. You didn't think helping them the day before would amount to anything. Time changed a little, didn't it? Even if it wasn't much, it changed. It changed. You know them now. You're a family. Isn't it just like the books Bonbon reads? Friendship fixes everything. And so, if you talk to everyone again, talk to the head housemaiden again, maybe, maybe something will change too. You should talk to everyone. Hello, Odile. Hmm. Well, we did it! We won! Whoop whoop! <laughs> whoop whoop indeed! <laughs> it was fun, traveling with everyone. <sighs> I will miss it. I'm reading chat and I just like, know what's coming. I, I suppose everyone will go back to their homes now. Mirabel will probably stay here. Isabel will probably go back to Juvente. And we'll ask someone to accompany Bonnie back to Bambouche. And what about you, Sifrin? Will you go be going back home? Odile. Hmm? Why not say it in the end? I can never go back home. Oh. Why not? You walk away. No. Sorry. This isn't any of my business, but no home at all. I never knew. I'm sorry. Keep looking away. I'll probably be going back to Kabu soon. Our paths will diverge soon. But if you ever come towards Kabu, please come by and say hello, won't you? Don't be a stranger, Sifrin. You nod. Honey. I never said thank you. You saved me that time against the sadness, and you saved me when we met. 
You're the one who saw me back then, right? When I was walking. Ah, when you first met Bonnie forever ago, Bonnie was out of it. They'd been walking away from their village for days when you saw them, crying, barely hanging on, walking, walking to escape the slowly encroaching king's curse. They fainted as soon as you got to their side. I was really tired then, so I don't remember it well. But you saw me, right? You made everyone notice I was there. And I never said thank you for that. Or for protecting me. So, um... Thanks, stupid! <laughs> Bonnie runs into you, pressing their face against your left side. Their arms are still at your side, at their sides, though. Is this a hug? Without raising your arms, you gently lean back against them. <laughs> I'll miss you, Flynn. Oh. I know you'll leave soon. But y you should come by for Bush one day, so you can be my sister, so I can say that's Flynn. They helped me a bunch. They're really cool. So come and see me sometime, yeah? Promise? Yeah, I'll come by. <laughs> Yay! I'll be waiting for you, Flynn. He smiles at you. I'm gonna kill myself. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Sifrin. <laughs> I know you may be tired of hearing this by now, but I'm glad we talked yesterday. I've always thought change was about changing yourself, and only yourself. If I couldn't be how I thought I had to be, completely the fault was mine, you know? It's my responsibility to change, even if I don't want to. That's what I thought, at least. But if even you, Sifrin, can understand what I'm going through... If you're the same, even in a small way, then I must believe that I'm not the only one feeling this way about ch the change belief either. And if I'm not the only one feeling restricted by the change belief, if there's more people out there feeling the same as I do, then shouldn't the belief change instead of us? I have a lot ahead of me still, but I, I never would have realized this without you, Sifrin. So, whenever you're done traveling, or you'd like to stay someplace for a little bit, maybe think about coming to visit Dormant? Just to say hi? But but if you don't you don't have to, it's just an idea. I'd like that, Mirabelle. Oh <laughs> I'm glad we're friends, Sifrin. Don't forget about me on your journey, okay? Mirabelle smiles at you deeply. Uh Sif! We did it! We beat the king! You wanted to tell me something? Uh, oh! <laughs> yes! I did! Um okay. Okay, so, the thing is, I said I would tell you, is, is... Isabel stares at you thoughtfully. Eh, never mind. Huh? What is it? Nah, I just... It doesn't really matter that much. I really want us to have a feelings talky talk about your feelings before we go our separate ways. And I can tell you about my thing after that. So, never mind. Sorry. I'll tell you later. But, you could tell me your thing now. Wow, you're really curious about it, huh? But nope! I will not say my thing. Oh, but I will say something, though. I'm glad we're friends, Sifrin. Oh. Somehow, you feel a little let down. He didn't try the usual thing. But I'm glad we're friends too, Lisa. Uh oh! Oh! <laughs> oh, oh, oh! Oh, crap, I think I might cry. <laughs> we're friends. You're friends. His cheeks are, che cheeks are dark. You're sure, you're sure yours are too. You both smile. I hope, I hope you'll at least visit some sometime, Sif. Our journey is over, but don't be a stranger, okay? You nod. That housemaiden, last time she said the loop was broken, you loop back for no reason you can tell. Now you're here with your family. Has to change, doesn't it? Time might not loop again, because you're loved. You should talk to her quickly before the loop restarts on its own again. Hello, traveling one. Are you done talking with your companions? Yes. Wonderful, wonderful. Wait, isn't she saying the same things? Same things as last time? I'd like to thank you for accompanying young Mirabelle this far. I'm very grateful. Sifrin, yes? If there's anything I can do to thank you, please don't hesitate to let me know. Oh, stars. No, she's saying the exact same thing she did last time. I know you'll go back to your travels one soon, but I hope... No, 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 it should be different, shouldn't it? You said something different this time! You're with your family, and they love you this time! So, so then, why is she repeating the same exact thing? No matter what, know that Dormant will always be open to you. Please come back. Any 
time. Oh, oh no. Oh no, 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 no. You breathe, you breathe, you breathe. Power of friendship, huh? Why would you, why would whatever happen before change anything now? Because you're loved? Because you're loved now? Because you were safe. Is that what you thought? Stupid, stupid, stupid. You try and breathe. Oh. Sifrin. It's fine. It's just the end again. It's the same. I'm so sorry. There's no way we can stop it now. It'll just be... He'll be going back. Back when everything started. See? You already know what will happen after that. If you know what happens next, it means you're fine. You're fine. You're fine. It's different? Something wrong? You turn your head. Odo. At you. I can't shift your expression fast enough. Sifrin? What is it? Is everything okay? Head housemaiden, is something the matter? I, I can't fix it on my own. Not before it all ends. If only I had noticed it sooner. Huh? What's happening? Wind? You can't move. You're frozen. Sifrin, what's. Sifrin, what's. <laughs> Is something happening? The air around us, it feels like... Oh. My head hurts. It's my fault you have to suffer like this. Sifrin! They're all running, reaching towards you. Flynn, come back! Something's wrong! I have to move. Sifrin! Just... Move! I hope that one day... You can catch Isabeau's hand. Sif! Sif! Sifrin! You might learn. You take a step forward. To forgive, and then... <sighs> you open your eyes. Hand already reaching out. Reaching out to nothing. Stupid. You press your palm against your eyes. And laugh. You really believed it, stupid. You really thought this was it. You really thought helping them would save you. If you helped them, if you were loved, it had to save you, didn't it? Friendship would save you, wouldn't it? <laughs> it was different, but not enough to save you. And now... Mirabelle is back to feeling awful and out of place. Isabel won't remember the night you spent under the stars. Odile is still hiding everything about herself. Ponpon Pon is back to Bonnie. Is back to hating you. And you're back here. That's what you get for hoping. That's what you deserve. <laughs> will be here soon, won't she? Just breathe, Sifrin. The power of friendship didn't work. It's fine. All you can do is try something else now. It's fine that it didn't work. It's fine that they don't remember. It's all fine that everything that just happened has been reset. It's totally fine. You're fine. You're fine. You're fine. You're fine. Back to the stage. Got a memory of family. You'll always remember this. When equipped, memory of family doubles everyone's XP gained in battle. Except yours. But what now? You've talked to the king and the head housemaiden. Are those really the only two people that would know anything about the loops you're stuck in? Who else could you talk to about the loops? To theorize. Oh, wait. There is one person. You need to go to talk to them anyway, so... single eye. So chat, is this? No, we're not done yet. Of course we're not. Actually, let me save that as Act 3 really quickly. Save this as Act 3 really quickly. And then we'll go save Act 4 when we're in Act 4. That's my plan. Sifrin! You're up! Here again. 
Oh, I, I was actually thinking about it. What did you think? Absolutely, I'll let everyone know. You're right. Talk to you later, Mira. Okay. Oh, Mira, but with the current methods, you can that one skill. Wait, how did you know about... Link. Let her go. Where's the change god statue? You believe strongly or whatever. Always attack first. Don't leave the enemy a chance to touch you. Repeat under your fast breath. Super fast, super fast, super fast. Wait, what do you mean we're not reaching the end tonight? Very long? Oh, fuck. It's not even the end of Act 3. Don't tear up. Not much, that much agile then, huh? Even your family member's attack speed got boosted. You close your single eye. I'll know when it's Act 4. Gotcha. <sighs> Halfway through Act 3, huh? I suppose here, probably pondering what favorite has the tree. Hi, Isa. I need to do the favorite tree thing. Oh, sorry! I'm in your way then, aren't I? I'll get out of your hair. See you at the clock tower! Welcome back, Stardust. Power of love didn't cut it, huh? That's too bad. I was hoping this could be it somehow, too. But at least you found out more about your party, didn't you? You had fun, didn't you? What is it all good for if they'll all forget it in the next loop? Yeah, but... For once, loop seems at a loss for words. In the meantime, though, how can I help you in this wonderful new loop? Let's talk about something. Sure! What do you want to talk about? Hold up! Me! I want to chat! Hey, you've been carrying that silver coin for a while, haven't you? The one in your pockets, I mean. Since before you started looping, yes. I don't know, I'm mentioning it because it's just so weird for it to be the only thing you had in your pockets. Hmm? Only a silver coin? What's the deal with it, I wonder? It's just a coin. Is that so? It is so. I like to twirl it, flip it, or interact with it every once in a while. <laughs> so it's not secretly made of gold? Or it doesn't have anything hidden inside a secret box? Or it doesn't even open some secret door if you press on it real hard? No, but... Pretty pathetic to be carrying it around with you the whole time, though. Okay. You went to Mirabel's statue and saw- I saw that! I wanted to ask you about it! I couldn't see you very well. I saw you go to the statue and ask your housemate to touch it! And then poof! Nothing! I think you were talking to someone. Uh, yeah, the change god. <laughs> what?! You tell Loop about you and Mirabel talk to the change god. Well, I'm- um Putting aside the whole the change god knows you're looping and thinks it's funny to watch aside. I think it's nice that the change god talked to your housemate and she was thinking she was a bad believer because she doesn't feel romantic or sexual attraction. Isn't it nice to know that some god out there doesn't care about that sort of thing? <laughs> yeah, chat! <laughs> Especially the change god! Kind of freeing. Your housemate had got some closure. Even if she doesn't remember. You nod. So I think it's funny, huh? Swears under your breath, you're angry too. You just breathe in, move on. Well, neat. That's neat. And I guess that's the end of that. There's the book fan. Ah, the man living in the house full of books. He seems to be really into that book series your housemaiden likes. The Cursing of Chateau Castle, right? Didn't the last issue come out right as the king's curse started freezing Forgotten Time? Might be hard to find. If you find any issues, you should remember the issue number and tell him. Maybe you might end up finding the very last one. Questions. Here is a fan. She does. That stylish woman in Dormant, right? You should tell your housemaid and make her happy. Sanuses are different. <laughs> I've noticed. They don't always appear on the f at the floor that where they should be, right? The king didn't happen before. This didn't happen before I beat the king. They did not... Is it because you beat the king? Is it related? The theories? None. 
But hey, variety's the spice of life, isn't it? <laughs> Tee hee. Ah, the thing. He said he'd tell you at the end of your journey. He mentions he wants to tell you something when you go to sleep at the clock tower. That's probably it. But someone interrupted him just as he was about to tell you. How unfortunate. If only we were to make sure he was wouldn't be interrupted, maybe you'd finally get to hear what he has to say. Like the funny friend, maybe. Wait, what? But that's different, though. Isa just chose not to talk about it this time. You're doing so many different things. What do you need help with? About the king. What should I do? So the king might not be from Valgard. That is interesting information. He smiles smugly. Sounds like asking him stuff was a good idea, huh? Yeah, yeah, Stardust, you were right. We really don't know anything about him, so any new information is useful. Your housemaid had mentioned she saw some articles about the king somewhere, didn't she? If she saw some, maybe you should check around the rooms that you explore every time while going through the house. It might be a lot of information, though, so make sure you ask yourself the right questions. Any other questions? Isabel doesn't confess when doing family runs, so to get him to do so, don't do family quests unless you want to be gay, which I did, LMAO. Huh. Yeah, not on family runs? Okay. So, should I not do another family run, or what? Which one, Stardust? What? Need help with your family members again? You know what to do. Just help them all in the same loop. Then go through the house with them. You know it won't change anything. It really won't. Do I really need to help them again? <laughs> if you want to help them again. Or do you want to help them again? Yes, of course. <laughs> well, you can help them again if you really want. But you don't really need to. Necessary. Uh. I'll do just fine without you, you know. Who do you think you are? Their savior? Silly. If you do need if you do help them, you can just zone out and fast forward to it if you get bored. And you'll still get a nice skill for the, for them out of it. I pity them though. I wonder if they think you're doing this out of obligation. Or worse, just because it makes your life easier. Bro, that's fucked. A nice time talking with your housemaiden. So, she feels bad because she can't love people romantically. She feels like she can't do what's needed of her as a housemaiden. She feels like she can't change in the way that's asked of her since she doesn't want to get into a relationship ever. Must be hard, having a crisis of faith like this. Sounds like talking to you helped her, though. And talking to her help didn't help you, but it, did, it made her stronger. Which is all you can which is all you can ask for, huh? Don't forget, if you want her to get that special skill again, you'll have to hang out with her some once more. Or, well, you could do it and zone out the whole time if you wanted to. But that's cheating! The researcher. She was looking for a family tale, maybe the whole time you've known her. Family tales of Vargardian tradition, and as half Vargardian, she felt like it would bring her closer to her roots. And that's why she came to Vargard, even, to find out more about herself able to go wherever you want and find out more about yourself in the process well that sure was interesting wasn't it you want to hang out with that kid you got to hang out with that kid didn't you so all this time they felt guilty because they feel like they're the they're the reason you're half blind what a silly idea but they're dealing with a lot right now their sister was frozen in time. They had to run away from their home and escape the king's to escape the king's curse. And they had to see you and your stupid eye every day. No wonder they don't know what to do with all the these thoughts rattling in their brain. No wonder you felt like they hated you. But isn't it nice to not be hated anymore? Well, I suppose you're still hated now. What, need a reminder on their favorite foods? Well, so far you found out they like rice, pineapples, and samosa with potatoes, but with no cheese. That's all of them, isn't it? Had a nice time talking with your fighter. What a nice guy. He prepared everything so you can watch the night sky, because he noticed you like the stars, and he wanted to spend some time with you. Who knew he had such a history with the change believe it, belief too? <laughs> Come to think of it, he might represent the change belief better than your housemaiden does. 
She must hate that. And he tried to tell you something at the end, too? Do you think it's the same thing he always tries to say at the end? He'll never spit it out. Poor guy. That's right. He wants to say to you every time. Your family member. Actually. I did not mean to do that one. Loop is such a bitter little asshole. I don't know more about the loops. I do. So you found out more about Timecraft, and the head housemaid and just repeated everything when you saw her. What else could you do to find out more about the loops? Maybe you could talk to someone whose name is Loop, huh? About the loops. Any other questions? Actually. Ah, uh, no, nothing. See you later, Stardust. They gently wave you goodbye. You give them a nod as you walk away. Are you rolling that coin again? You've kept it this whole time. It's just pathetic now. Okay, Loop. Hmm? Get up and sit down again? Sit down again? Hi, Stardust. So, so, got any theories about the loops I'm trapped in? Why would I? Your name is literally Loop. Oh, Stars Above it is! Tee-hee! <laughs> Ugh. But just because I call myself Loop doesn't mean I know anything. I'm just bad at names. But I'll see what I can do. What's your question? Do you know anything that could help? Such a broad question, Stardust. But as I've told you before, I know as much as you do right now. How can that be? What do you mean? Aren't you here to help me? Why don't you know more about the loops you're supposed to help me with? Tee! Don't you teehee me. Oh. I still don't have a good answer for that for you, Stardust. Isn't it already nice that you have me to talk to about those loops? You could be alone, stuck with your tiny brain for company, with no one to talk to. Okay, okay, okay. Well, why don't we summarize what we know about the loops? We might find something out. You sigh and nod. Nothing better to do, you suppose. So, you're currently stuck in a time loop for some, some unknown reason. The loop starts when you wake up in Dormont. It seems to end when you talk to the head housemaiden. Unless I die first or touch a tear. Yes, maybe the loop considers getting frozen in time by those tears a sort of death. But why aren't you looping back when you get frozen in battle? Huh? Isn't it because... I thought the tears work differently than an actual time freeze skill. Is that so? Well, you're the one getting frozen, so you'd know. So, you loop if some uh, something keeps you from advancing in some way. I wonder if other things would count as keeping you from advancing. What? Like, what if we cut, your, cut off your legs? Would you immediately loop back? You can't advance if you have no legs, right? Um, I'd rather not test that one. Oh, but understandable. It is interesting, though makes the loop actually loop. Maybe does the loop consider talking to the ho head housemaiden? Something that keeps you from advancing somehow. Oh, maybe, but what would advancing even mean then? Towards what goal? Is there something that happens uh, when you talk to the head housemaiden that makes a certain goal impossible to accomplish? As you found out, all of this might be the work of Timecraft, power that should be impossible to use. But you and the king are somehow able to manipulate it. But am I manipulating timecraft if I can't control it? But you can, can't you? You can more than less control when you come back. Especially when you talk to the head housemaiden, it seems. Which brings you back to the start. The start. But just being able to loop back in time and avoid death might count as you being able to use timecraft. Timecraft is supposed to be too dangerous to even use. How did I get that power? How can you break the loop for good? Yes, those are the big questions, aren't they? I do wonder about the limitations of your powers still. What makes you actually loop? 
Somehow I feel like finding out more. That, that would be useful. Stardust, we've been talking for a while. So maybe not right now, but when you have some time, will you hang out with me for a bit? What? Hang out? I have a theory I'd like to test, and... And we haven't spent any time together, Stardust. I'm lonely. I want to have a long conversation with someone. Anyone. I want to hang out. Ugh. Again, it doesn't have to be right now. A little hangout time might last a while. Maybe even longer than the rest of the day. I'm sure you have plans for this loop, so I can wait until you have time. Okay? Loop would like to test about the loops. Might be useful. Should talk to Loop and hang out with them when you have time, huh? Yay! I'll be waiting, Stardust. In the meantime... How can I help you in this wonderful new loop? I have to go do something uh, first. I want to go ask about the book and then we'll do the loop. Uh, and I also want to go get that object because I have to get that thing. I want to get the thing for the bomb because it's just easier to do the bomb and it's cute. And also I want to talk to... I don't, I don't think I have to do the other things, right? I got the coin now? Like, in front of Loop, or just now? Come in here a few times. Like, go in front of Loop and just do the coin thing, or...? You know, the end of the world is fine and all, but I only have one regret. Last one you've seen is the final issue- is the final issue issue 87? Uh, do no, I guess. Do not, uh, do it not in front of Loop. That's... That's it! That's the one! Oh. Oh, please tell me what happens in the issue! Please! You have to tell me! Oh, you didn't read it. You awkwardly smile. I will never forgive you for the emotional journey you've just given me. That's fair. Time to go back and read it. Fuck. Coin. Sure, why not? I don't see why not. What about the incident? Hey, I think about the incident. About the incident. Grip the coin tightly between your fingers. I think about the incident. I mean, what? Grip the coin tightly between your fingers. I mean, I don't know why Sifrin's so hellbent on keeping it. Going around in your pocket. Well, hey, you know what they say about me? I'm the luckiest woman alive! What the incident? Oh, well, I tried. What was I trying to do? Oh, wait, bomb part. I'll do that first. Because if this is going to go to the end of the day, I at least want the bomb parts. We don't have to do the family route now, because I imagine this is going to be a trial and error route. Um. Like... I imagine, yeah, because I imagine this is going to be a trial and error route. <sighs> I doubt I'm actually going to progress to Act 4 through it. But hey, I mean, if I do, it's Act 4 of, like, what, 6? I'll probably have another time to go back into another fucking loop. Check this out. Damn it, I tried. Really? Point in the air a few times. Damn. more time. Going in the air a few times. Got the incident. Well, I tried. Hi, Stardust. I feel like I see you pretty often. Are you sure you don't have anything better to do? If I was in your place, which I'm not, I'd spend the day in the house forever, getting stronger and stronger. Anyway, how can I be of help with you on this wonderful loop? We can hang out now. Oh, a theory hangout! Yes! But we can't actually hang out right now. It'd be pretty useless. So how about you come back here early tomorrow, after you've done acting things in the, out of the clock tower? Wait, you want me to sneak out and spend a loop with me? Yes, but... You always go to the house after the clock tower. If you're not here, what will everyone do? What will everyone think? Does it matter what they think? They'll forget it all in your next loop after all. It matters. 
So you won't do it? You won't come and hang out with little me? I'll come, yeah. Neat! I'll see you soon then. You nod. Spend the rest of the night with everyone. Early in the morning while everyone's still asleep, I find the slip albums at the head of the favorite tree. But you can't see Loop anywhere. Up there, Stardust, up there! Up there? Did Loop go back to their home or something? You look up. Loop is waving you from the top of the tree. I'm here! I'm here! Come and join me, Stardust! How? Oh, come on! Just climb the tree! I know you can do it. You sigh and climb the tree. Uh, I guess this is the Loop hangout. Whoa. Good pretty Stardust. We're so high up. You are. You can see the house from there. Everyone will be inside the house soon. I'll try not to think about it. Thank you for coming to today's loop hangout. If you hang out with me, I'll take some time and... Well, you know how this goes. I sure do. I um, haven't actually prepared anything to talk about. So, tell me about yourself, Stardust. Really? I'd rather not. Oh, uh, why not? Don't you already know me? Huh. It just feels like it. You know too much about me. You knew my name, you know how I think. You knew it before we even met, didn't you? Kinda. Kind of. I know you? Oh, no, you don't know me. <laughs> don't worry, your memory isn't failing you this time. When we met under the favor tree, that was that was the very first time we've ever seen each other. So, so, so then... Is that why you're helping me? Because you know me? Oh. Not really. When I decided to help you, you were not a factor in the slightest. Well, now, I suppose, but... Does that mean you're act you actually believe me? When I say I'm here to help, you don't think I'm lying. And I'm actually the one trapping you here f or whatever. You really believe that I'm here to help you? But I don't. But I do. Oh! You always surprise me, Stardust. I know I wouldn't believe myself if I was in your place. Every time has made me more jaded than you are. It's fine. Whether you believe me or not, I'm here to help you. So you can escape this loop. So you believe it's possible. For me to escape. Of course. Why would I be here otherwise? I'm trapped here with you, after all. I want to escape just as much as you do. I know how it feels, you know. What time is it? It's almost one. Maybe we'll end after this? I don't know. I want to see how this goes. I know how it feels, you know. To be stuck somewhere, with no hope of escape. Forced to relive the exact same events over and over again. Taking any deviation as a sign that things are finally going to change. That everything will be okay. And finding yourself trapped still. <laughs> Look at me, talking and talking. Don't pay attention to me. I'm doing fine. Luke laughs sadly and looks at the house in the distance. Tell me about yourself, Luke. I'd rather not. <laughs> Luke winks and blows you a kiss. Despite yourself, you laugh. Your Luke laughs softly as well. <laughs> Say, Stardust. That reminds me. I can't believe your first death was being crushed by the very first trap. How embarrassing. Hey. Luke, adamant, uh, animately, uh, animatedly talk about the different things you've done during your loops. It's nice to be able to talk with them, with someone. You talk and talk until the sun has risen high above you in the sky. Ah, it'll happen soon now. What will? The theory crafting part of our hangout session, of course. You open your mouth to ask them. <clears throat> you hear such? A, you hear a horrible sound. Your head. You saw something. I'm glad you decided to spend some time with me, Stardust. 
Sorry, it's going to end with this. What? I thought maybe it wouldn't happen, but... See that light in the distance? It's from the king's floor. I see it every time you get far enough to fight him. His first attack. The king's first attack? How long have you been talking with Taloop? Who was the king attacking? Who was he? The king doesn't attack or do anything until you get to him. He will only attack if, if someone... I can feel it every time. Whatever he does, it makes you see something, doesn't it? Something awful. Something so terrible it's enough to bring anyone close enough to their knees. Stars. I wonder who he attacked. I can't even hear Luke speak. We're friends. We were against the king just now. I knew how to survive his first attack. You found out, but... but you hear someone cry out. You look at Luke. Loop is just looking at you, not saying anything. There's no pity in their gaze, no sadness, just some slight impatience, like, did you figure it out yet? Did you figure out what made the king attack just now? There's only one answer, Stardust. Just figure it out already so we can move on. Who was the king fighting? Who did the king just kill? Did you figure it out yet? Did you? Start screaming. It's because you weren't there. They died because you weren't there. They're gone because you weren't there. You clutch your head, your hair, your stomach. Because you weren't there. Because of you, they're gone. They're gone. Because of you. Because of you, because of you, because of you, because of you, because of you. You stumble and fall to your knees. You breathe harshly in and out. It's not working. You can't take a full breath. You can't. You hit the ground with your fist. Why? Loop does not answer. Did you know this would happen? Which part? You living back or your party dying? I had a suspicion about the former. I was certain about the latter. You! Loop is looking straight at you. They don't even seem to care that you drew out your dagger. Somehow, this calms you down. If I tell you to breathe, will you? You... Breathe slowly in and out. What was that for? For funsies, of course! You take a step forward, and because I was curious to know how the loops work. Aren't you? How the loops work? How could what just happened teach you anything about the loops? Think, Stardust. Why did you loop back just now? Huh? Because the king won, isn't it? Why would the king winning make you loop? You don't immediately loop back to the sec the second you and your party lose, don't you? Don't you? I kinda do, though. No, Stardust. You loop when you die. I no, it takes a little bit. You loop when you die, Stardust. The fact the king wins is irrelevant. But you didn't die just now, did you? So why did you loop? But it's the same thing with the head housemaiden. You don't die when you talk to her, so what makes you loop? You loop when the head housemaid and talks to you, and you looped just now. Why? Do you think this would be important to figure out? That's right. There have been other times you loop back without dying too, but what could be the reason? I wasn't lying when I said I wanted to spend time with you. I never got the opportunity to really talk after all. But Yes. I figured this would happen. I... I won't say sorry, so you can stop waiting for it! You don't answer. Well, it looks like that's all like you can find out about the loops for now. But you can still find out more about the king, can't you? I'll be ready to help you out next loop. But for now, I think we both need some time. Come back next loop, Stardust. You just walk away. Oh man, dude, so this is a new loop? Are we on a new loop? Like a new new loop? Or is this like the loop before we did the loop loop thing? Loop thing, loop, loopity loop, 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 loop. So many loops. Still like three.
Okay. I think that's a pretty good place to end, don't you think? Sufficiently, uh... Mind blown. And beyond... Oh, sure. Yeah, I'll check my coin for last time for funsies. Why not? With the incident. Nope. Six hours. Holy shit. Oh, anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Holy shit. That was a long ass stream. Dude, this is so fucking long. Anyway. This is where, chat, this is where we're going to lay anchor for the night. This is, this is where we're going to lay anchor for the night. I need to think. Uh, I assumed as much, but yeah. Holy shit. Anyway, I have a lot of theories. I'll probably talk about it. If you guys are in the actual server, I'll probably talk about it there. Or I'll talk about it on Twitter if you follow me there. Um, thank you very much. I'm glad they're very entertaining. But yeah. Thank you all so much for coming to tonight's stream. I have a lot. I have my theories. I... I have one that I kind of feel like sharing right now, actually. Where it's like... It clearly seems like what's killing Sifrin, or why these loops are being started, is because Sifrin loses their family. That's my big thing, right? Sifrin loses their family. What this has to do with the head house maiden, I don't know. The king, I don't know either, but the king might just be completely irrelevant, who fucking knows. But that's my theory. That when Sifrin loses his family, the loops begin. Because there's one thing that keeps reoccurring. No matter what they say to each other, as soon as, like, they say when we part ways, it starts to happen. Because progressing isn't beating the king. And Sifrin probably sacrificed some. If it costs memories to loop, if it costs memories to use Timecraft, then, did Sifrin lose all their memories of their family just to relive this moment for a second chance? Anyway, that's my theory. Whether or not that's correct, I don't fucking know. But, yeah. In this moment, you are loved. That's what I'm saying, right? Anyway. I'm, I'm done for the day. Uh, how we go about streaming? It's spring break for me, so I low-key might just start streaming a bunch. It might not be ESAT. I might keep ESAT to Friday games just because, like, I like that. I enjoy that a lot, where it's like, everyone come on Friday to watch In Stars and Time on a Friday night, which we'll see. I might do an art stream, maybe tomorrow even, but we'll see. Uh, I hope you all have a wonderful, wonderful rest of your day or night or start of your day because it's 1 a.m. for me um thank you all for coming by and enjoying and suffering through this with me maybe i'm doing more suffering than the rest of you who knows this has been part three of in stars and time i guess or part four part four of in stars and time anyway uh i'll see you guys later peace
Thank you.